<laughs> right, first person to text in. What to are we? Today's theme. What are we? What are we? Oh, sorry are we? about that. It's all right. <laughs> morning. Good morning. Yeah, good morning. Here was you and I. I know. All smug. All smug. Because thinking we'd... <laughs> we've swerved Halloween we've swerved this year, Halloween. haven't we? Yes. No, you haven't, because let's do a show a month early. Well, we have to do that, don't we? For to get yes. your Halloween makes in. Oh, it does make sense. Absolutely. It absolutely. does make sense. Yeah, it's a nice way to end the month as well. So it's all That's good. true. Yes. Although I do yes. have to pick yes. up my almost two-year-old after the show. Like, I mean, like that. I might have, <laughs> might have to have a little wash before I go and pick her up. Otherwise, she's going to be like that. Hey, mommy. Morning. Good morning, lovely jewellery makers. Now, I have to say, Mark, thank you so much for organising. Good. good fun. No, I love it. All love good it. fun. Do you reckon yeah. anyone's going to guess what we are? Well, I hope so. I've not put any clues on Facebook or anything. No. So, um, Can you guess what we are? Joker and Harley Quinn. I think we've got no, Joker no. Joker and Harley Quinn. <laughs> Flynn, do you have any idea? 60 zombies. 60 zombies, <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. No, nobody's 60 guessed it. 60 zombies. Yeah. That's far from that. Yeah, no, we're not, not 60s. Have we missed the brief? <laughs> maybe, maybe. <laughs> 80s, no, 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 no. Guess, text in if you know what we are. It's a play, I'll give you one hint. It's a play on words. Mm, it's yes. a play on words. There we go. And you might, you might guess it. Yes, oh, yes, Ollie's yes. just got it. <laughs> well done, Ollie. So, so what have we just come back from, Ollie? What have we just come back from? Yes. Yeah, yeah you had it. Yeah, yeah. He says we've just come back from a... Yeah, Text yeah. Down. It's uh, all down to you, Mark. You're genius. You are genius. You're very good with the Halloween themes. It's funny because I really don't like Halloween. Yeah. It's strange, isn't it? But yeah, really yeah, Do you know, on Halloween, we turn all the lights off and we hide behind the sofa. Do you? And we ignore the door. Yeah, every time. See, no, but I... apparently, no, there's a signal. If you put a lit pumpkin in your window, yeah, it's a yeah. signal to say that you're yeah. admitting guests and giving sweets and things. Totally. I've always right. taught, I've taught Willow that. So you don't go to houses that, do, that aren't decorated for Halloween. Right. If a house isn't decorated for Halloween, then you leave them alone. Um, because I also do things like, like my mum, for example, my mum has Alzheimer's, so I worry about sort of what of course, Halloween yes. means for her and she yes. has people with yes. her now. But if you decorate your house, that's, that's the rule mm. that we say anyway. Yeah. Um, so happy month early Halloween. The mm. idea of today's show is that you can get making ahead of the Halloween Amazing. celebration. So my kit hours today, I was allowed free reign of the first in the nine o'clock hour. So, yeah. we have, so we've gone for one of my favourite techniques, a simple spiral, but Love in it. Halloween themed <gasps> colours. I tell you what, they're, which they're are so beautiful. The colours of these Such kits. a simple technique and it's just absolutely beautiful. And then in the 12 o'clock hour, it's all about pumpkins. So I've got gemstone pumpkins. I've got the most amazing witches cat gemstone they're just amazing so oh, cool wait. so we've got that in the 12 so, so, so lots so of cool. lots of mini mates in the love it well. uh, yeah, yeah pumpkin themes we've got sort of cats lovely sort of halloween like colors like yeah. the black and purple amazing. black and red yeah um you might be going cool. to maybe not sort of de uh, dressing up as mark and i are this morning but you might be, I don't know, just going out and about on Halloween mm. and you want to wear those sort of yeah. celebratory colours. Absolutely. Yes. It is huge yes. now, isn't it? There's it's no getting massive. away from it. No, Halloween it's bigger, is absolutely isn't it? huge. Yeah, it's um, we've got a few messages coming through. Um, hello, Alison. Oh, that has made me giggle. <laughs> you know, do you know, a lot of people around the studio here, not just to obviously in jewellery maker, they know what's going on, but in the building, have you had as many funny looks as I have this morning? I think I've managed to dodge everybody. Have you? No, um, I have, and I think I've hit everybody. everyone, even the cleaner. <laughs> even the cleaner, she was like, okay. Ooh, <laughs> scary, says Miss Janet. I, I, I mean, I think that we, look, we look hilarious. It's good. I it's mean, hilarious. First time I've ever seen a glow stick. <laughs> oh, they're Amazing. good, aren't they? I was like a kid at Christmas when I got the packet. Because I, I thought, you know, I, I don't know how many we need, so I bought a pack of 100. <laughs> and it came in this massive box with lots of accessories and bracelet yeah. clips and all sorts of things. And I thought, how do these work then? I read the instructions. Yeah. And they just say you click and yeah. they just glow. They're amazing. See, I put these in, um, in party fantastic. bags. When, oh, when the girl, you know, when Willow's yes. had her birthday parties, these go in party bags. The kids yeah. love them. Well, Hello amazing. to Teresa, fabulous guys. I'm thinking Rocky Horror Picture Show. Ooh. Ooh. Somebody is very close, right. apparently, as well. Karen yes. and John in Norfolk, you're very, very, yeah. very close. Oh, good. Yeah. 
We're not supposed to um, um, have secret conversations between the studio and the floor and the, um, the gallery, mm. but I'm just going to say pampas grass. They'll know exactly what I'm talking about. And then we'll, we'll continue now. I don't know what you're talking well, about. It's a conversation that Ollie and Ross had about two minutes ago about plants in the garden. Oh! Yes. Oh, I think I... Yes. I think I know what you're talking <laughs> about now. Goodness me. But apparently, really? but, but apparently, I read recently that the age of the pampas grass is over and now you have to have a statue or an iron statue of a pink flamingo in your garden. For the, for the same, same reason. reason. Yes. Listen, I have to say you're not very discreet. I know I've totally clicked <laughs> on to what you're doing. I expect our audience have as well. <laughs> yeah, of course you do. <laughs> and I have to say, growing up, we had a pampas grass. We did as well. Yeah. yeah. But it used to get everywhere, <laughs> didn't it? Has, have you got a pink flamingo, though? Yeah, pink flamingo, yeah. <laughs> I want a pink flamingo, though. That sounds really nice. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> What have we got oh, coming we up do, can in we, today's sorry, show? Sorry, before we go, can I just say a massive thank you for Dan? He came in early this morning to decorate yes. the set for us. And it's all going to come down again at one o'clock and be put away for another four weeks. He's done so a great thank job you, Dan. as well. Thank you, it's amazing. Our unsung hero. I love him. Yeah, he's, he's great. Apparently, this yeah. chap here was meant to be... Um, you were trying to get him to sit down, weren't you? Ah. Uh, he wouldn't sit. Has he actually not he got a amazing. body? Is that why? No, he's just slouching. No, don't slouch, even if no. you are... Dead. It's ace. Yeah, it's very cool, isn't it? You've yeah, done a great job well addressing this. Well done, thank you, Dan. Thank you. Um, yeah, honestly, it's such a jam-packed show. Your deal of the day is really exciting as well. Um, it's about the it's a ring bender, so a tool that will actually. Uh, um, well, basically bend rings mm, uh, yes. in an easy way, give you that professional finish. So that's coming up at 10 o'clock today. All of your kits are very Halloween themed colours. Now, even like, like we said, you don't necessarily get behind Halloween, but you like the particular colours Absolutely. that you might see around this. Do you time remember of year? a long time ago, and it was nothing to do with Halloween, I made you a choker out of black and red super I do. do you remember? Well, I, I've sort of harked back to that sort of look, and I've made this suite here. So this is, this is the simple spiral. Beautiful. But I just think that's that's so Halloween, isn't it? With the black and red, oh, quite vampire. Yeah. Was like um, what's her name? Morticia. Yeah. Oh yes, yeah. Morticia uh, of the Adams family. Yeah. That would be amazing. Yeah. But also, can I just say, if you're mm. going on a cruise liner or something oh, yes. like that, yeah. it doesn't have to be <laughs> no. a Halloween theme. No. And um, we've also got some absolutely stunning opportunities, last in stock opportunities on your Type A jadeite. We've got the four strands of pearls coming oh. up within this hour. Um, we're going to do an absolutely amazing closeout deal on those. We've got Grand Digirite, like I don't think you've seen before. We've actually got calibrated stones, so cut oh. to go in a beautiful solitaire. And check this strand out. Can you see it there? The quality of this colour is quite simply off the chart. Totally and utterly natural. Just next to it as well, you'll see it is that strand of Herkimer Quartz, which will go down in history, I think, as the best that we've ever, 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 ever seen. Um, you see, when you look at that strand, you see why Herkimer Quartz yes. is often referred to as Herkimer Absolute, Diamonds. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah, I mean, imagine those two together. Um, we've got lots of amber included in today's show. We've got some beautiful pumpkin cuts included in today's show. And just awesome kits. <coughs> I will apologise. The cold that I have had over the past couple of days has now gone to a horrible tickly cough. So I apologise if I'm coughing and spluttering. <coughs> it's not COVID, I promise, I promise. <laughs> um, OK, so without further ado, should we get cracking? I think we should. Shall we start with uh, some beautiful pre-night? Again! So I've, I've been um, with Jewelry Maker family now for what will be 12 years next year. Mm. And, um, and I started watching for, it was about three months before I first appeared on the show. And I have to say, pre-night was one of the first strands that I bought. I was just, I love tourmalated quartz. And, <coughs> um, Excuse me. And this is just beautiful. And I love that grape green. There's, there's just not another, there's just not another green like it, is there? No, it, 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 we used to have it. Like you said, mm. we used to have it all the time. We very rarely see yeah, it now, no, do we? Absolutely not. It's no, got almost no. like um, like a kiwi green. It is. That's perfect colour. Yeah, yeah, perfect kiwi, kiwi yes. green with li the little pips inside, tiny little inclusions that occur uh, completely and utterly naturally. We see it very, very, very seldom. Um, I should imagine. Is this the case then, Roscoe? Limited in stock. Oh, forty. It's not a lot, that, is it? No, well, no. <laughs> but sometimes I'm used Come to Ross out. saying, oh, we got, we've, we've only got a handful, we've got, I don't know, 10 or 20. But 40 of these available today. I can't remember the last time I even brought a pre-night to air. £9.99. Pence. Lovely long strand as well. Beautiful. In your faceted cubes. 
Yeah, perfect with lots of the lo lovely colours that uh, we're going to bring you today. How about this with the bundle of pearls that you've got coming up? How about this with some lovely jade? How about this with Mark's amazing kits? $9.99, full 38 centimetres round. But do you think Ross is done? No. He's not done. He hasn't said those words yet, though, have you, Ross? Ross? No, not that one. Fast and pacey, oh, fast and pacey. You haven't said it yet. Normally come <laughs> at 11 minutes past eight, you have done, normally. We've got, um, in one of the kits at nine o'clock, we've got a green kit, and I think Ooh, those would do beautifully. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, love that. Who would like pre-night under five pounds? Oh, yes, please. Karen does, and another Karen. The pre-night recently is seriously mm. good. I yeah, totally agree. Absolutely. Totally agree. No, it is that lovely, very distinct green, isn't it? No, it's gorgeous. It goes perfectly with these shell pills. Um, going under five pounds for you today. I don't know if it's all the makeup, Mark, mm. or, um, or, or, or just me. Could just be me as well, but is it really hot it's in this studio? It's very hot, yes. <laughs> I think it's just all. Ma mixture of both things. Yeah. <clears throat> Hello to you all. Karen. Zombie ravers, says Karen. <laughs> Close. Very close. Very, very close. Mm. Mm. Hello, Kim. Straight to the point. Swing. Uh, yeah. You know what we're talking about. I have to say, not we, what they were talking about. Oh, yeah, it's I, nothing to I, do with the studio. We weren't no, actually no, no, included no, no, no. in this conversation. You just overheard it. <laughs> You're just talking about what? Playgrounds, right, though. Yes, OK. Uh, hi, it's Ted. I have no idea what you are, but you look absolutely amazing. Well done, Mark. Oh, bless you, Ted. Oh. <coughs> he want, you, want, you definitely came up with this idea. I came off air and I was like, look, Mark sorted it. Well, I just thought, what have I got in my dressing up box? But A, because we can't wear the same costume twice. We can't wear the same costume twice. And no. I, think, I think we we sort of peaked at our last day. Yeah, that was a good one. And I was, so I was looking through it and I found these T-shirts and I thought, I wonder how I can do a, a little sway on, on these type of T-shirts. Very clever. Yeah. It was very, very clever. <laughs> very clever. Um, uh, moving on, well done, everybody who managed to get hold of that. Shall we bring you some beautiful moo kite? And I do have a smaller size as well if you wanted to create the graduation. Wow. These are limited. Um, I'll say it, say it as it is. It's going under £10. Again, perfect, perfect Halloween colours. Massive. They're amazing. We've got, we've got a moo kite kit at 12 o'clock in pumpkin. Yes. Which look amazing. Oh, it'd be yeah. a perfect addition. Yeah. You know it's not stopping there. Good morning. I love Mukite. Mukite, yeah, it's the, it's the warming, perfectly autumnal colours. Um, have you noticed the conkers are out as well? I was walk, walk, yeah, walking the dog the other day. But I have noticed there are a lot more being left on the ground now, because I think, it's, hasn't it been banned in schools now, conkering? Has it? I think it has. Oh. Yeah. I picked up a few conkers for the girls on the... On, on but in your windowsill, it keeps spiders out your house. Yeah. Apparently. Apparently. Yeah. I don't know how true Apparently. that actually is. But just, just a bowl of conkers on your coffee table. That's I nice. think that just looks lovely. Yeah, it? it does. They are beautiful, yeah, aren't they? Yeah. On the verge of selling out. Yeah. Should we do the smaller size for you now? Yeah. Um, yeah, I was picking up mm. conkers and both the dogs were like, ooh, what are these? These are fun. <laughs> 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 they both walk around with a conker in the mouth. <laughs> yeah. T Tiggy didn't have a clue what was going on, but Willow loves a conker. Ooh, what are these? Uh, 35 carats of natural uh, wow. mukai, all the way from Western Australia, totally and utterly natural. And of course, one locational. Love the fusion and combination of colours that you get. I'm looking at the kits before me, and really? yeah, they're going to work with every single one of them. Who wants another under £5 deal? There's only 11 left, though. Not stopping there. Just making our way towards it. Speaking of spiders, we could do with a con few conkers on our we table, couldn't we? Something, couldn't we? Yeah. yeah. $4.99 only. Um, they're flying out the door again. If you got the six millimetres a few moments ago, gosh, look at you all there, you lovely, lovely jewellery maker viewers. I hope you're all well. Hope you're feeling better than Mark and I this morning because uh, <laughs> we, we, we clearly had a heavy night last We're night. Very pale, didn't we? aren't we? Very pale. Yeah, yeah. Just a little bit peaky this morning. <laughs> um, good morning to you, Karen. Raving Dead. Oh, that's oh, good. Another close one. That is another close yes. one. Yes. Uh, we've got. What's that? You are tie dyed. Oh, that's tie clever. Tie dyed. Very that's clever. Very clever. Yeah. Very clever. Very clever. That's actually really good, isn't it? I love that. I should have thought of <laughs> we that. Should, yeah, yeah. yeah. Good well really done, Miss Janet. One. That's yeah. Ace. Love that. Love that. And you're all very, very, uh. very close. <laughs> uh, very, very close. Well done, everybody. Congratulations. Let's do. 
<coughs> excuse me, some green fluorite coming up next. <clears throat> beautiful clarity with this strand. 75 carats, beautiful fluorite. Again, a gemstone we don't see very often. No, look at this. I, I generally think I could count on one hand the amount of times I've actually seen this gemstone. Well, maybe two hands over the past year. I think we've seen more blue john than that's fluorite true. This that's true. Yeah, that's yeah, true. This I really do. We don't see it very often, particularly in that, uh, you know, when it's exclusively that spearmint green. I oh, really I've just noticed like you've got that. a spider in your hair. Have I? Yeah. I didn't put one in there. Didn't you? I've just noticed he's in there. Are you sure? Yeah. You're not winding me up? No. I didn't put one in there. Is it a... <coughs> <coughs> you have, yeah. He's just chilling though, it's all right. Okay, He's just I'll ignore that. Ignore the spider. I don't mind spiders. I, I've, I've, I've grown to get you, I, I think I'm no. better now. Now I'm a parent, I kind of have to be, and I don't want to pass on my fears. No, no. It depends. It's if what they, they do when you're sleeping at night. I don't want to know, don't, don't, because that fear's going to come right back. Mm, mm. Apparently you eat about seven a year. Mm. They have a saying. feast on your face while you sleep. A feast on your face? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. <coughs> Excuse me, what are they feasting on? Murder on the dance floor! Oh, that's a good one as well. Oh, I like that's that. the groove. <laughs> oh, yeah. uh, very good. Very, very, very good, it's Karen. These. These are good. I tell you, they're, they're bright sparks, yeah. aren't they? Yeah. Yeah. You're yeah. on it. You're on yeah. it. Down to the final nine. Alice, Patricia, Lorraine, Helen, London, new customers. Make sure you do check out those baskets. Here's another message coming through. Are you out of the thriller video? No, but that's good. Wow. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun. Is this a thriller? <laughs> I was amazed. I was amazed at that. <laughs> was good, wasn't it? Yeah. Was good. He's, yeah. He is awesome. Um, okay, coming up with. I don't know how I'm going to do any of these strands seriously, to be honest today. So I've had these. I had these pearls on. I can't remember when it was. It was the weekend, I think. And Zena and I were on and. We, we were just absolutely gobsmacked at the price these pearls are going to yes. for four strands. It's, there's, it's just ridiculous. I think it's, of all the years I've been here, it's probably the most ridiculous price for pearls we have ever bought to wear. Genuine cultured yeah. pearls. Yeah, it's I know, it's mad, ridiculous. isn't it? We've, yep. got, we've got a hundred of them available. You do get all four strands. <gasps> I didn't see that. What? There was a little thing just came on the screen, 25% off Halloween. Web exclusive, web, web exclusive oh. deals. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there we so go. So the deals continue online as well. Oh, Both of amazing. these are coming up. Can we pre-order on these then? You can. You can shop ahead and pre-order on your pumpkin amber, and you can shop ahead and pre-order uh, pre on your four strands of, uh, of cultured pills. Um, I would do that because the deal is, or the deals today, ge just generally speaking, are absolutely insane. Okay, shall we do a little box oh. of cut gemstones? But, oh my goodness me, I have to take the top off if I can. If I can, she says. Oh, she said it now, isn't she? <laughs> Honestly. Oh, hang on, there we go. It's oh, all right, I've redeemed myself, Ollie, I've redeemed myself. Um, so look at this, you've got nine beautifully, beautifully calibrated stones, um, including your beautiful tanzanite, black star diopside, and at the bottom there you have your lovely mystic topaz. I mean, what are these going to then, Roscoe? Oh, look at those. These go low, he says. Per box, how about £10? Yeah, I mean, look at the quality of the Tanzanites. Oh, no. Should we match the launch price? Look at the quality of the Mystic Topaz. I love Mystic <coughs> Topaz. How what? about... You go on our sister channel, see if you can buy any of these gemstones in finished jewellery. Didn't you have Mystic Topaz this week? Yeah. You and Claire, didn't yeah. you? Yeah, sold out. Single stones, yeah. Sold out. Oh, no. Wait, that's £3.33 per... What they call... What I learned over in, uh, uh, over in Tucson, they call these layout boxes. Oh, makes sense, doesn't so, it? So, yeah, they are, almost have them laid out so you can right. imagine and design the jewellery around it. On the verge of selling out, well done, well, well done. Keep those messages coming through. Nice to hear from you this morning. I hope you're all well. Um, OK. Labradorite. Big Labradorite coming up. Um, the quality of Labradorescence. Each of these. Now, we've, we've had cabochons. We had cabochons in one of Claire's kits the other day. Um, but checkerboard faceted. I haven't seen that in a long time. So show you the checkerboard fasting and then 
Look at that labradescence. Look at that. We don't have a lot of cabochons. Yeah, I totally agree with you, Ollie. We don't see that many of them anymore. I'm just going to pop that one down for a second because each and every single one that. of them has just that magical effect. Perfect for Halloween, perfect for all year round. Labradorite never, ever, ever goes out of fashion, does it? It's always been one of our most popular, wonderful gemstone with mesmerizing phenomena effect. Um, so we guarantee the carat weight. You'll get 145 carats of natural Labradorite in an assortment of shape, all of which will be um, checkerboard faceted. So great if you do things like your bezel strip, your Amazing, yeah. wire work, but also uh, yeah. CB bezeling. Yeah, bead embroidery. You can pop it onto <coughs> the backing foundation and yeah. your brooches and, and things. That'd be lovely. That'd be lovely, wouldn't it? Yeah, perfect for that. Yeah, bead embroidery. Yes. Um, which I, I've been hearing about, actually, in the background. I wonder if there's going to be some bead embroidery shows on the horizon. Maybe. I hope so. I hope so. It is yeah. lovely, isn't it? Yeah, Even I, I can it. do bead embroidery, and that's saying something. <laughs> £24.99 pence only to get hold of these. We're not stopping there, though, says Ross. Oh, no. How about these with those pearls that are coming up? Imagine just one of these suspended from a strand of those pearls. Fourteen pounds and ninety-nine really? pence. Oh gosh! It's a massive carrot weight. What I really like about Labradorite, even when it's heavily fastened <coughs> like this, it doesn't detract from the colour nope. underneath, does it? At all? No, you can't. You can't no. stop that colour, can That's you? Amazing. And it is. You know, as an artist, you know, as a gemstone cutter is an artist, essentially, aren't they? And they've got to know where to position that facet, So, you'd, especially with something like opal or labradorite. Because mm. if you cut too much of it away, then you're not going to see the no, labradorescence. Right. If you cut too little, then again, you're not going to see the labradorescence. That clock is ticking away on our screens. He's going, he's going again, says Ross. Going again. One day, Ross, we're going to get you to dress up. <laughs> He said he went to an 80s theme. Ah, <coughs> <coughs> oh, it's annoying, this tickly cough. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> Let me have a look at them. So, here we go. 12, 12 99 They're just beautiful. Absolutely extraordinary. They're just amazing. So you get 145 carats. So as you can see on the screen, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it, it's going to be on ground weight rather than the number of cabochons. So you've got three huge ones in here. This beautiful pair. What are we going to do next? Look at this. Minute clock. <laughs> really? You're on good form today, Ross. You're on good. You were, you were saying that you went to an 80s themed party. Ah. Oh no, you were the only one there, not in fancy dress. When we had our engagement party, we had an 80s theme, and I went as I went as Prince. Yeah, there was a Prince, was there? And Andrew went as a member of Spandau Ballet, which was hilarious. This was hilarious. He had the seagull. He, he went for a spiky, bizarre flock of seagulls type. You know, it was really good. Really so good. sorry. Thank you, Mark. That's all right. That's all right. I think it's the aircon setting me off again. When was the last fancy dress party you went to? Um, oh, I don't know. It's been a long time. Been a long time. It's been a long time, but I do like a bit of fancy dress. Mm. Uh, I can't remember. It's been a long, long, long time, but that's good. I can imagine you as Prince. That's hilarious. Really good. Look, yeah, look. It's hilarious. I'm glad I've got you here today, Mark. <laughs> The aircon setting my tickly cough off once again. Um, <coughs> yeah, make sure He's, you um, check out your baskets, everyone. It's part of another clock in, look. We're going a lower again. What are you doing, you know, Ross? Like under a tenner. <coughs> under ten pounds. Oh, that's ridiculous, isn't For it? For 145 yeah. carats. It's lovely to see Labradorite. We hardly see it, do we? Considering for so many years it was our absolute number one, yes, wasn't it? Yes, yes. Our absolute absolutely. number one favourite gemstone. Beautiful. Amazing, amazing. Yeah. Loads of you there. How many do we have of these then, Roscoe? Just shy of 100. So what's your, what's your favourite underlying colour then? The, the turquoise blue, what, the in dark Labradite? blue, the peaches, the yellow. I'm going to say that probably that, um, yeah, the, the, the paler blue. That's just amazing, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, I love that almost love parabola-like yes, blue. Yes, yes. What's this one? 
Let's have a look. But look, I like the fact that they're so understated from, you know, you're looking from a distance and you'll have that wonderful dark colour and then all of a sudden... They just pop. It's, that, it's the veining, Magic. isn't it? The dragonfly. Dragonfly veining, that's just amazing. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Sorry about that, everybody. Like I said, I've had the most horrendous cold and now it's gone to a really annoying tickly cough. I think I'd rather the cold. Especially yes, with our I, job. I'm, I, I, so it's, it's just sometimes I'm in here and I get a little tickle. And there's <laughs> it's the aircon, I think. Yeah. Air conditioning. Yeah. Um, I complain it's hot, and then when the aircon comes on, <laughs> you start coughing. Bless Dan. He's like, I can't help, I can't, I can't win. That's beautiful. Loving that. Absolutely loving that. How would we use these in terms of bead embroidery, then, Mark? You know, is it? So you, so you can either bead bezel. Mm. Um, you were with Caroline, weren't you, the other day, who won the competition yes, and she showed us how Caroline. to be bezel freehand, she that freeform bead too. bezel. She was amazing. Um, but my favourite is when you place it on backing foundation, <coughs> and then you bead around it to <coughs> different levels and then you can make patterns and all sorts of things. <coughs> what a centre stone to have though, that's just amazing. I'm really love pleased. it. That's amazing. <coughs> I love Lapid, right? I've got a box at home where I must have about 200 cabochons in of Labradorite. And I, just, and I just spill them out onto a mat and just look at them occasionally and put them back again and... Uh, yeah. Do you think you'll ever work with them or is it just for that reason? Just, just to look at them. Just, just to look, to look just at them. And, it's the only, and to this day, it's the only gemstone that Andrew can name. Yeah, yeah, I think, uh, yeah. <laughs> he's not interested in gemstones and jewellery at all, <coughs> but he's fascinated with Because it's cool, drives. that's why. It's cool. It's it is, cool. it is, no, absolutely. Oh yeah. my goodness, yes. me, look at this. <gasps> oh. Now, when I was on holiday, this was a strand that Ross brought to air. Clearly zircon, right? Canary oh. zircon. In fact, hang on a minute. Coloured zircon full stop. I don't know if we've seen this before. Yes. There's paparaccia colours. You've got all that double dispersion, champagne tones. That, do you remember that colourless zircon strand that we launched the birthday with this mm, year? Yes, oh yes. <laughs> That's on that level, isn't it? Mm. Oh my goodness. So my first, my first uh, uh, um, time ever seeing this, now out of the 100 that was launched a couple of weeks oh, ago, wow. 19 are left. And Ross says, you had to see them, Al, so he scheduled them in today's show. And I'm so pleased, I'm so pleased you did. Now a little bit of a heads oh. up. What we're going to do is do a clock to graphics. There are 19 of these available. Zircon is, I, I agree with you, uh, just to steal what Ross has just said in my ear, he just said one of the best zircon strands I've seen. You know, cinnamon zircon, as it's so frequently, you know, that's something that you find in our Larique collection on our yes, sister that's channel. True. That's true. For four figures. Champagne colours, canary colours. Zircon is what we call a doubly refracted gemstone. So what that basically means is as white light enters into the gem, it splits and you get twice the fire, twice the scintillation, twice the dispersion that you will get in a diamond. That's why, that's not light trickery, that's the gemstone that's giving that beautiful performance. I've not seen this strand, this is my first experience. It's absolutely incredible. Imagine this with those pearls that are coming up. Yes, just the spaces in between. That'd oh, be it's here. Isn't it? Oh, you've got them there. <sighs> Look at that. These are available on pre-order. Imagine that together, oh, that. One of, the One of the classiest combinations you could possibly wish for, don't you think? Oh, that's wow. Beautiful. Just literally alternate. £69.99. London straight on in there. Well done to you. New customer, Merthyr Tidfil, Carmel. I can see you there as well. I love it. And if, you, if you wanted to, you could use your champagne with your champagne zircons. You could use the canary mm. with the canaries. Um, the cinnamon colours, those red zircons. They're just beautiful, aren't they? Red zircon. And the skate for ombreing as well. I mean, I would, I would do the pearls, as you said. <clears throat> and um, you could do a micro marla, couldn't you? Oh. and have one either side of the pearl and then a knot, one either side of the pearl and then a knot, and start with a dark in the centre and then get lighter as you work. Absolutely. Back. I think You'll amazing. kiss cross as well. Yeah. That would be amazing, wouldn't it? There are 10 oh, no. left, and we're not even stopping at 39.99, which we absolutely should be. I mean, the rarity. That's, well, simple way of actually establishing the rarity of a gemstone. How often do you see zircon on our screens? Firstly, not often. Secondly, how often do you see the fancy colours? 
You know, that's what these are. You know, we, we would describe a canary diamond as a fancy colour. This is a fancy coloured zircon. They absolutely flew it in my absence. Who was it with? Carol? Or was it, was it with Claire? Claire Cummings. I bet she was blown away by this. Yeah, it's incredible. Down to the final few. New customer, London, Alison, Merthyr Tidwell, Isle of Man, well done to you. I've got multi buyers getting involved. There were only, what did you say, 19? Seven oh, no. of them left. If you don't grab this, I will. And that's what I'm thinking of, literally just teaming it alongside some lovely pearls, some high-end pearls. Do you think we'll ever be able to have a Zerk on our? No. A beady, beady bead, bead and these will be amazing. Yes. Twenty-four <laughs> pounds and ninety-nine pence only. Oh. Unreal. Yeah, the greeny light colours, almost colour changing. Yeah, absolutely beautiful. Down to the final five. I mean, I, I should imagine the question's already been put to our gemstone buyer to get more. Is that the case, then, Roscoe? Oh no. He says I could, you can only actually buy a hundred of these. They're just incredible because you've got the surface performance, haven't you? That luster on the exterior. But one of the things that Zircon is most celebrated for is the fact that you get that spectrum of colour twice over. Even if you were to look at, you know, Ollie's amazing, amazing recording there. If you were to look at the back of the screen, can you see the, the, the constant rainbow? That spectrum? Amazing, isn't it? Absolutely amazing. And it does that completely and utterly naturally. The final two opportunities. <coughs> Make sure you do check out your baskets. I apologise for coughing. Zara, Catherine, hello to you. Lorraine, Alison, new customer. Make sure you check out those baskets. Those pearls are coming up as well. You can pre-order on both of those. What price are they on the website, these pearls? Well, the uh, on the website, we can show you, actually. Yeah. All the W's at jewelrymaker.com. <laughs> £140.99 <laughs> for four strands. That's all right, isn't it? That's not too bad. You no. pop along to somewhere like Ernest Jones, you'd pay that for a single. Oh, necklace, yeah. 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 I think so. Now, even if you do make your confirmations right now, I guarantee, I guarantee you'll pay the absolute low price and it is ridiculously priced. So make sure you check out those baskets. Um, awesome, awesome, awesome. Well done, everybody. Congratulations to you. Speaking of pearls... Oh, oh my goodness me. This is one of your favourite strands, isn't it? It is. Absolutely. Amazing. Look at that colour, Mark. They're amazing. Totally and utterly natural. I hope described as perfect round pearls. Because that's exactly what they are. Look at those. Uh, this is why I had a conversation with a lovely couple who um, we were fr got friendly with over on, uh, on holiday. Um, <laughs> Lynn, uh, Lynn and Rob, and you know, bless them, they just they were just great with the girls and everything. And she was really in interested in sort of what we do here at Jewelry Maker. And uh, she asked the question, she's going, oh, so do you buy, buy items to sell on? And I was like, yeah, absolutely, particularly our pearls. Because you could literally get these home, you could knot them, you could put them mm. on 18 karat gold clasps, and you could sell them at a profit, in, I, I think, very, very easily. Um, I'm not talking necessarily sort of at your local markets or maybe your school fates. You need to go to the right avenues. But these are top quality pearls. What makes a pearl top quality? Because there's obviously various different degrees, as there is with all gemstones. Well, firstly, these are not bleached, these are not dyed, this is naturally occurring. So every single one of those pearls, which by the way, would have more than likely have been cultured within one single mollusk. So one single mollusk, which should have probably matured to about so big, um, will have housed a single pearl. Then there'd have been a, a, a natural process, which is incredibly rare. That's why we refer to them as the impossible pearls. That pearl, instead of forming within the muscle, will have migrated to the circumference of the, uh, of the oyster shell. Here's a photograph to show exactly what we're describing. It's not the prettiest of pictures, but you do get what we're seeing. Instead of the pearl being in the center, it's actually on the exterior. And that's where your mollusk will house the most color. Now imagine that happening multiple times over. 
Now imagining that happening to in the perfect spherical shape. Now imagine that happening so much so that you can actually, you can actually color match them to this perfection. You've got those five virtues multiple times over, but multiply that rarity given the fact that these are not dyed. They're all mother nature produced. The rarity is so much so that they are displayed or were displayed rather in Tucson, the largest gemstone fair of the, uh, of the year, displayed, literally protected by armed guards. Oh. Look at number nine. Would you all agree that's entirely reminiscent, mm. almost identical, identical to the necklace that, or rather the strand that we're giving you the opportunity of owning? It doesn't say a price tag. Doesn't say a price tag alongside that necklace, but just so you know, an idea of you know how, how exciting each of those pieces, exhibited pieces are. That's Sophia Loren's coral necklace. Oh, is it? Within that case, yes. Uh -huh. So not this. Imagine it on a platinum or an 18 karat gold clasp. Then yes, I truly do believe you could sell this at very high prices. This is wholesale. Wholesale. $1,250, which is underpriced, I think. Gosh. <coughs> Again, naturally colored, exactly like yours. I have five opportunities. These are the pearls that, yes, I buy for my girls, but I buy these pearls also, knowing that if I could, if I needed to, could literally just sell them on to make a quick mm, profit. Absolutely, yes. <laughs> well, you know, 1,250 wholesale, which means that will probably be about, and I th again, I think this is underpriced, about five, six thousand dollars. So would that in be turned shop. into earrings and pendants, would it, if it was wholesale, or would they just sell well, it? Well, that's on? a necklace. I don't know, oh, okay, right. I, but it, but it's underpriced. Mm. Mm. Sold onto a shop that would probably mark the price up by about five, six times, probably. Wow. Do you see a difference? Not at all. Look at this jewellers. Let's bring it closer to home, shall we? This jewellers is in London. Oh, no. The Novus necklace, a freshwater pearls exactly like yours. They have 18 karat gold, and it says price on application. Doing a bit of research, we found out what that price was. What? Yeah. 22 and a half thousand pound. Oh my god. Do you think the rarity is in the gold or in the pearls? Oh it's definitely word. in the pearls. And yeah, I agree, Ollie, ours is actually a better colour. These are a better colour than those pearls. Oh my word. We're already significantly beating both prices. And we're not stopping there. If you were to sell them individually, which is what our supplier is actually saying to us now, listen, <coughs> we can offer you naturally colored pearls. However, they are probably going to be individually or at the very least pairs because they make more money that way. Mm. They make more money. And it's also, this would have been years of investment, not just to culture the pearls, but actually to match them, to make enough to do a full necklace. So I don't know, this could have been decades in actual yeah, waiting. Um, to put that necklace together. Because can you imagine if one was a pale pink and one was mm. a dark purple? It all has to be completely uniformed. Well, they probably were missing one or two to make the full length yeah. of, the, of, the, of the necklace or the strand. Yeah. They'd have to wait until two were available. See that price that's on our screens already? It's an absolutely incredible deal. But you today will pay no way near that price tag. Really? <laughs> <coughs> Under 500 pounds for a full 360 necklace of naturally certified lavender round pearls. I haven't mentioned a few things here. <coughs> Excuse me. They are round. Still the most expensive. Yeah, yeah. They are. Yeah, graduated, absolutely. Perfectly colour matched in their colour. They are natural, the nacre is unbelievable, absolutely unbelievable. See that beautiful metallic-like iridescence across the surface? 
Ollie's just said something, size. Yeah, we haven't spoken about the size because any pearl that is, you know, round about 10 millimeters <coughs> or above, excuse me, uh, it is, is, is basically, and I remember asking Charlie Barron this question, what's the equivalent in a diamond world? He's like, well, about a 10 millimeter um, pearl from certain locations is like the equivalent of a three carat diamond solitaire. You've got a full necklace here. <laughs> yeah, to so never lose sight of just how rare this is. <clears throat> That's a previous closing price. We have five available. Shall we do a major, major closeout deal for you today? The last five opportunities <clears throat> sold very successfully at £399. And that does mean Yorkshire for the two that you are, you've just secured. Um, you pay the final low, regardless of where you made your confirmations. This is the kind of necklace, or I'm saying necklace, it's not a finished piece of jewellery, you do need to knot it and you do need to put the clasp on. But this is the kind of, kind, kind of piece that you would see in Bond Street, that you would see in Hatton Garden, that you would see for the thousands of pounds that we've just shown you. Even online, look, two pearls, which are beautiful, absolutely beautiful, <laughs> $1,500 for those two. Shall I count how many you have here while that clock's ticking away? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 39. Oh, my word. 39 solitaires. Shall we take them under, what was that, $1,500 for the two? For two. <laughs> This oh, price tag on your screens is just a mad £7.66 per naturally. That's ridiculous. Spherical, <laughs> coloured, <laughs> sizable. If we went off what? If we went off the price of the two, that's almost £30,000. Now can you see why our supplier yeah, doesn't yeah. want to sell us to the Mon yeah, Strand? Yeah. Uh, again, yeah, now can you see why our supplier is saying we can't bring you the strands? That £22,000 strand necklace seems actually quite affordable, doesn't it, in comparison? I mean, yeah, actually, it's not a bad deal. Plus, you've also got the gold in there. It's not a bad deal of making a saving. That's a bargain. No, well, no, it's not. It's not. It's not. What is an absolutely amazing deal is £299. I've got London there, Hazel there, new customer there, Yorkshire, you're there as well. Um, anonymous customers on the phone line. There is only one of these remaining. Get it home. Use your 30-day money-back guarantee. You don't have to take my word for it or Mark's word for it. Do your research and you will absolutely... Make sure you research the, you know, the five virtues that you've got, the fact that it's graduated, the fact that it is naturally coloured, Look at the valuations that some of our other customers have actually had on mm. strands like this as well. Um, yeah, and, and, and you realise again just how exciting two hundred ninety-nine pounds. That's mad. It's actually mad. <laughs> that's mad, mad, mad. Um, okay, let's go from naturally coloured purple pearls, just... and like I said, we can bring you pearls of all different varieties. Classic pearls, culture pearls. Not, not you know, not synthetic. They're not glass. Not plastic, genuine pearls. This is just all crazy. four strands. Absolutely crazy. I would, I would, a word of advice for you is put these in your basket and check out now because the price is ridiculous. It is, isn't it? Do you know yeah. what it reminds me of? Um, Jacqueline Kennedy, that mm, pearl necklace yes. that she used to quite frequently yeah. wear. You know, that classic multi-row necklace. You know, you so easily just recreate mm. that, can't you? <coughs> the, you, because you're getting four strands here, you've got you can make a complete pearl mala necklace. Oh, Imagine that. Amazing. Just, just beautiful. Absolutely amazing. And pearls are or always have been very much on vogue. There's I remember reading an article to you guys um not so long ago saying a pearls are the new diamonds. Mm, and yes, I think yeah, I think yeah. I think that is potentially uh, the case. They're absolutely everywhere at the moment. Um, I was looking at some of my mum's uh, my mum's jewelry. We've got it so, uh, keeping it safe obviously because she has carers in and out at the moment. But mum's got a really lovely pearl necklace that my dad bought for her gosh many many years ago. And I was literally looking at the clasp and the finishing of it just thinking oh I wonder because she bought that from a jeweler's is it any different to what we do here at jewelry maker? It's not. It's no. French wire. 
Oh, really? Literally French wire and a gold clasp. No different to what we actually do. There's that necklace that I was uh, just describing. Oh. There's the beautiful Jackie Kennedy wearing um, a multi-row necklace. I mean, how easy would it be to recreate a design mm. like that? It's classic, it's timeless. Um, but something like that, as you can imagine, would probably cost a fortune. Mm. We can teach you to pearl knot. We can teach you all of those wonderful techniques. And we can also oh. bring you the best possible deals on genuine pearls. Look at the beautiful, beautiful Angelina Jolie. Ugh. Oh. Catherine. Heigl. Heigl. Yeah. Good that. Sarah Jessica Parker. Just a few pearls there. Just a few. Just a yeah. few. Just a, just a dusting. <laughs> Rihanna. I love that look. Mm, just a, just a, a cardigan. Yeah. She's literally wearing Very a cardigan. Relaxed. Yeah. Look at this. Could you recreate that? Little seed pearls. How about something like this? Just tussled across the front yeah, of the neckline. Oh, look. Each of these That's are nice. entirely possible. Yeah. I love that. And the gents. And the gents, yeah. You've got Harry Styles, you've got Pharrell, and you've got who? <laughs> ASAP Rocky, right, okay. Is it Rihanna's fella? There we go. Ah. Uh huh. Oh, look. Oh, Pharrell totally rocks the pearls, doesn't he? I like the fact he's wearing a Chanel jacket as well. Yes. Now, first price point that you're about to see is not your closing price tag. You do get all four strands, totally natural, <coughs> cultured pearls. Sizable too. Mark, you know where this deal's going, don't you? Mm-hmm. Absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> That's £10 a strand. <laughs> No, that's no. not what we're paying, is it? No, no, absolutely not. And and, uh, and I said on the sh on the show that I was on the other day that um, it, you would, the amount that this deal is going to, you'd expect it to be shell pearl at a bargain price. Yeah. And the fact that they're they're cultured freshwater pearls is just ridiculous. Yeah. How, how, how Wayne got this deal is beyond me. It really is. A meter and a half of yeah. of genuine cultured pearls. You know. You look at you look at Pharrell Williams ropes of pearls there. We could all do that. I think yeah, as, as customers yeah, of yeah. Jewelry Maker, that's absolutely possible. And they probably are Chanel pearls because they're Chanel. They probably are. Yes, yeah. Because Chanel does work with, with Chanel pearls. We're not stopping here. The only issue is that we have only 100 of these opportunities. In-house designer Anne's got hers, well done. Mary in Yorkshire, hello Anne. London, uh, Dennis and Pearl in Nottinghamshire, well done to you. New customers, it is starting to stack up on the phone lines now, lovely jewellery makers. Do bear with our call centre. Never any cues on the website or via the app, so you can always give that a go. Everybody pays the final low. How good's this deal? Just how low can we take top quality pills? <laughs> they're not small either. I mean, they're nine mil they're, way. They're huge, yeah. That's just silly. Just, just silly. <sighs> yeah, this necklace, they do look like a jade at the bottom, don't they? They do, yes. Yeah, little tassels. We've got, we've got some amazing jade coming up a little bit later on. A little bit of a queue on the phone lines. Imagine just one of those. Oh, someone's bought four strands there. I don't blame you. No. Pure white, yeah. natural type A jade coming up. Yeah, just one of those at the bottom, maybe, um, to recreate that beautiful scarf. Like I, sh I, I brought that picture in, oh, gosh, it was a few months ago, and I showed it to Susie because I was like, that's a little bit of Susie style, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. And I think she has actually gone on to recreate it. So wait a second, I'm useless at maths. What's that working out at? Per strand. Six twenty-five. Six pounds twenty-five. <laughs> Goodness me, that's absolutely crazy. Mad, isn't it? But yeah. also, Mark, what about this? Mm. Perfect. Oh yes. <gasps> oh that. hello. That's all you need to do. It's lovely, isn't it? A few it? of your Herkimer courts in there, or Herkimer diamonds, as I think that would be more accurately described. How beautiful. Now these are coming up at what time? Remind me, I should know this. 10 o'clock, 10 o'clock hour, last in stock opportunities, yeah. Herkimer diamonds alongside your pearls. How stunning is that? Imagine if you bought this and, and made a pearl necklace for all of the ladies in your family for Christmas. Oh. Just gave it all the ladies. 
Yeah, Ollie would be. Um, buying, I'd yeah. start buying oh, now, Netflix Ollie. This is the kind of deal that you would yeah. need because there's a lot of ladies in your family, isn't there? A lot of ladies. And you better start pearl knotting right now mm. as well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, how about alongside the Grand Did You Write, too? The perfect backdrop for each and every single one of those stones. Um, so many of you have it in your baskets. Veronica, Margaret, Alice, Johnny, Jeanette, Caroline, Catherine, Maker in Lincolnshire, Lynn, June, Marva, Jackie, Teresa, Alison, Jane, Denise, Liz. Uh, down to the final 30. Jacqueline, Angela, Sarah, Alan, you need to check them out if you can. Anna, well done. We've got three rows of names. I only actually had 100 and we're straight wow. down to the final 25%. Um, we can see quantities of like twos and threes and fours still in baskets. Good luck. Good luck each and every single one of you. If you love the Herkimer Courts that, uh, that, that has I have across the back of my hand, um, likewise, it's coming up in today's show. An amazing deal. Once again, the perfect addition, I think, alongside those four strands. That's four amazing. strands. What about with your kit to the nine o'clock hour? Perfect. As your little spaces, your little station spaces. So if you have, um, if you divide 160 by 24, well, 24 99 divided by 160, that's yeah. roughly what the number of pearls you're going to get. 15 pence a pearl. 15 pence. <laughs> Make some pearl earrings for 30p. Yeah, honestly. It's crazy. It's absolute madness. And uh, you know, in house designer Anne's got involved on these and multi bought in it. I mean, why wouldn't she? Wow. She's got a really successful yeah. pearl business. Yeah. That's silly. You know? It's a no-brainer, isn't it? An absolute yeah, no-brainer. We're in the single figures. Make sure you check them out. People will be missing out on this opportunity. I'm so sorry if you do. Um, we had a hundred of them. We had, only had 100 of them, but again, even if you've got, like myself, you've got loads and loads and loads of pills already yeah. in your stash. Yeah. There's always room for more. That's amazing. Just before, just before I went on holiday, Mark, I was like, oh, I'm going to make some jewellery. You did, and I it, remember. I did, sat down and made a few pieces oh, well of jewellery. I did, made oh. a few, uh, literally, let, one of them was, was tiggied. But, um, but yeah, I, I wore oh. them quite a lot throughout the course of the holiday. Yeah, Tiggy got hold of it. Um, and it was just, it was all pearls. Wow. That's what I wore on holiday. Pearls, oh. pearls, 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 pearls. Love them. Absolutely love them. Well done, everybody. That's Sorry, amazing. Ross. Have I got a little hedgehog? I do. Oh. Wait, he's the cutest because he's got a pearl tummy. Really? I've not seen him. Are hedgehogs out yet? Are they out they're, of hibernation? They're no, they're about, they're about to hibernate now. They're about to go into hibernation. Yeah, yeah. We used to have hedgehogs in our garden and I miss them because we don't have them anymore. Let me show you this little guy. They are the sweetest, aren't they, hedgehogs? He's cute. I want a hedgehog <laughs> in my garden. Look at him. There was originally 140. Now there's just 26 of them left. Look at him! Oh, his little bobbly back, that's lovely. Look, and look, there's his little... Oh, that's so beautiful. It's so beautiful, yeah, and then he basically has a little outie. Yeah. Can you see? Yeah. Oh, and that's look. where you put the pearl. Oh, he's got a nice full tub, full tub there. That is so clever. I love that design. Last chance to get hold of him. Oh, look, any, any animal species that thinks cu curling up in a ball mm. is the best form of defence, I love. I just love that. Yeah, I think it's really yeah. sweet. Uh, what? Oh, my word. Um, I've never seen this before. No, I've not. Absolutely no, beautiful. No. <laughs> For the pearl on its own, that little button pearl, that's an amazing deal. But you do also get, the, the, the obviously, all that sterling silver. It's just the sweetest, aren't they? And it's they're the perfect now, autumn pendant, isn't it? It's perfect autumn pendant, the hedgehog. Have you we, had a, we, had, we had a hedgehog in the, um, in the chestnut close range. Yes, I remember. The summer, yeah, it's beautiful. Yes, but we've got hedgehogs. I love them, and they're really yeah, noisy, yeah, aren't they? Yeah. Really noisy, and they can run really fast, deceptively fast. Yes, yeah. Um, absolutely, I absolutely love it. Down to the final four. <coughs> Mark, yeah, your, your autumn collection was yesterday, which I did tune in, and I did send you a message you as did. well. It was yeah. just the cutest. Um, <laughs> <coughs> I love the frog yeah. and I love the bat. But in the in the summer range, we had um, <coughs> we had us we had a hedgehog. Yeah. And it was it was silver with black spinel eyes, I think. But yeah. this, you get the black spinel and you get the pearl. That's just look amazing. at him. 
He's cute. He's like that. Mine. Yeah. It's mine. It's sold oh, out. Well done. It has sold out. Have I got an owl? Yes. An owl? I have an owl. Uh, I've not seen this range. Oh, this is perfect. Do you know what? I might have to get some of these because what great teacher gifts. Absolutely. Yeah. For Christmas or something like that. And it's a beautiful. Oh. Wow. Oh, hang on. Oh, yeah, got the wrong one. Wait a minute, there's another one. Oh, God. Wait a sec. That's the connector. He's coming up. Right now. Oh, when were these launched? Oh, I see, oh. when I was away. I see. <laughs> oh, Ollie's saying, you know what? If you wanted to make a pair of earrings, you just need to buy Twit Twoo. <laughs> <laughs> That's very good. Look at the attention to detail, <coughs> meaning that it's going to sit perfectly on the decolletage. You've got a hidden bale. Um, that's not a synthetic stone either. That is a genuine, natural red garnet. Similarly, again, what lovely yeah, gifts, I think. Not, not just for teachers, but guardians. Yeah. Forget the owl. Forget the garnet. It is too good for the garnet. I agree. Yeah. Let's just focus. Let's just focus on the gemstone on its own, shall we? A single garnet on its own. Never mind all that beautiful filigree work and craftsmanship of silver. Two and a half grams of sterling silver. This isn't your price. No. Did you just hear what Ross just said? Yeah. That's mad. He's he's so right. A five mil, 60 point natural red garnet. Black spinel in the eyes. What was that, sorry, Ollie? Is he standing proud? Yeah. yeah Look man. at his little belly. That's so clever. Look at all that silver here. No. <laughs> no. Honestly, oh Ross, I'd go away for a couple of weeks and look what you do. Madness. <laughs> Absolute madness. Alison, Susan, Lynn, Janice, Cor uh, owls. There's got to be meanings to owls. And mm. I know, what's a group of owls? Parliament. Parliament, yes. Yeah. I love all jewellery makers know what groups of animals are called, by the way. Um, you, you mentioned a few. What was the bats group of bats the other day? Yesterday? Linda told us, didn't she? Yes, she did. Yes, she did. What's a group of bats? No, it she was some, us, something yes. very Halloween related. Yeah. A cauldron. That's cauldron, it. that's yeah, a cauldron it. of that's bats. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. There is only one uh, continent on Earth where owls don't exist. Must be one of the one of the north or south. It must be Antarctica. Yes. Yeah. Not even a snowy owl. No, I suppose no. not. No. And I there's over two hundred and fifty different species of owls. Can you tell I've researched owls before? <laughs> Do you know what I'm doing after the show today? What? I'm going up to see Caroline, and we're signing off winter. <gasps> Is there going to be an owl? No. <laughs> no. What do no. owls do at winter? Do they, they're still about. They stay. They? they stay. They stay active. They're still yeah. about. Yeah. Oh, he's I've, cool. He's really beautiful, isn't he? Yeah. Have you ever seen an owl's legs? They're really long, aren't they? Really long. They're really long, yes. They kind of lift yeah. their, their... It's almost like they're lifting a skirt up. Now, this is a, a, a connector. It's so perfect for things like your slider bracelets and things like that. But I love that idea. I was saying, what about turning it into a ring? Yes, because you'd, be you'd be able to bend it, wouldn't you? In, well, using the ring bender, we might be able to. Yes. Ah. We might be able to I think Claire's sending us a little demonstration. <coughs> she has, probably. yes. Yeah. yeah, she sent us a little, which I'm ever so glad about because I wouldn't have a clue. We're under £10. Solid 925 what? sterling silver. Again, oh. put this on something like a Monica Veneda inspired bracelet. Do a bit of macrame either side. That'd be perfect, actually. Perfect. Yeah, a little, little, little slider bread. That'd be an amazing children, um, teacher's present, wouldn't it? Because that's gents and ladies, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, that's nice. That's idea. one for both. We're going even lower, though. How many do we have, Ross? 60. I might have to get a couple of these. 
Really Again, because you've got like your, uh, your teacher's presence is always tricky. And if you go onto some apps, for example, not on the high street, you're talking mm. 30 quid a gift. Yeah. Those leather bracelets that you had with Alison the other day. Yeah. One of those with just the connector in the inside. That'd be amazing, nice. wouldn't it? Almost yeah. framing it round. Yeah, that would be, be a lovely idea. Because then you've got your teacher, you've got your teacher's assistant. Yeah. And I remember Willow saying to me at the end of the school term just gone, she's going, Mummy, what about the what about the lunchtime teachers? I was like, Willow, I can't afford to buy the dinner ladies things as well. We didn't have teacher's assistants when I was a child. No, we didn't either. No. We didn't. But Willow wanted me to get 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 a gift for everybody. Teachers, dinner ladies. <laughs> I was like, seriously, well, I was going to stop somewhere. Aww. What about the head teacher? No. Is it a lady or a man, the headmaster or a mistress? It's a lady. Headmistress. Headmistress, oh, yes. Lovely. And she's very nice too. Mm. Six ninety nine only mm. for your beautiful owl. It got nice little bookmarks. Still got That's that nice bookmark idea. that you made, Willow. Nice. I don't let her have it, though, because otherwise she would break it. So until she's a little bit mm. older. Nice little bookmark or something for grandparents. Lovely, lovely idea, yep. Lots of meanings behind the. That would make a really owl. nice um, tassel for your guru on your marlas, wouldn't it? Oh, yeah. So have you have your tassel suspended underneath the owl, and then your pearls, all the way around. Very nice. Love that because they are sort of classed as almost like a, a symbol of education, mm, I guess, right. and guidance. Yeah. 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 Um, uh, sort of mentorship, that kind of thing. £6.99, lots of multi-buyers on this one. Johnny's got two, one and two. Jacqueline, you've got two. Janice has got two. Claire's got two. Alice has got two. Susan, Irene, Cheryl, well done to you. Candice and Inverclyde, well done to you. Yvonne in Cumbria, congratulations. Your amber is coming up as an early bird in just a few moments' time. I actually haven't shown you these, but... Not yet. seen amber for such a long time yeah a long time and they have been flying on pre-order though i've just learned oh amazing because all you need to do is actually feed them onto a stunning silver and chain. they do look like pumpkins so it's very apt for today they're big little pumpkins yes perfect you wouldn't imagine it's halloween would you <coughs> is it halloween we've been very subtle about yeah. it yeah i'm just not mentioned it i like the fact that no. people will be flicking through the channels and be like what are these two doing <laughs> Is it Halloween? Even Lindsay said to me the other uh, the other day because I had the email about right. about us uh, um, mm. about us dressing up, and I was like, Lindsay, have you got any cost? Uh, you know, this before we discussed. Um, so I've got any costumes, and she was like, Oh, I keep them every single year. Um, she was like, It's not. It's, you're a month early, though. Well, I wasn't. <laughs> I wasn't. We classic jewelry maker. We were meant to be a month Absolutely. early. Absolutely. Yeah. Because we're making for Halloween, aren't we? Right then. Are you ready? I don't think you can do a, um, a Halloween show. No, absolutely not. Without this gemstone. Do no, you agree? No, absolutely. No, spot on. That perfect yep. pumpkin spice colour that occurs naturally in Mother Nature. Up next, these are just beautiful. And I know you can pay a huge premium for something like this from your Amber Boutiques. They have been flying on pre-order. Amber coming your way in pumpkin cuts. Next. <laughs> Check this out. To cut this oh. gemstone, understand firstly, you know, what is amber? Well, amber is what we call an organic gemstone, meaning it forms from a living organism. So pearls are an, organ uh, are an organic gemstone. Amylite is an organic gemstone. Um, this is a gemstone which is basically formed from what once was ancient tree sap. And only a handful of trees actually produced it, hence its rarity. It went through a process called polymerization, which if you just imagine that for a second, this is why it comes under the gemstone category because it is very, very rare. Polymerization is basically defying mother nature's natural process. I mean, if you think about it, we're organic materials and we will return to the earth. Your gemstone, <coughs> your, your amber has defied that natural process. Mm. No, you know, if it was part, if it, when the tree had actually fallen, if, which obviously these all have, it didn't naturally decay. It didn't get sort of eaten up by, I don't know, movements of tectonic plates, fires, mm. uh, erosion. It has defied that entire process. So, yes, amber is incredibly, incredibly rare. But as a form of resin, 
it's very difficult to carve. It's very difficult to facet. And that's basically what we're looking at here. We're looking at a carved and faceted amber because it can burn very, very mm. easily. Yes. Believe it or not, there are over 250 different colours of amber. <laughs> we narrow it down to seven for ease. This is one of the rarer colours, and it looks black, doesn't it, from a distance, but if you actually get closer, you'll notice that it has got actually a really beautiful, almost like cherry cola bottles, a really lovely, warm, cherry-like red. Can you see it just there? Yeah, that's really, amazing. really intense red colour. In the centre, that's 925 sterling silver. All you need to do, exactly as we have done here in the studio, is feed it on direct onto a sterling silver chain if you've got other ideas. More inspiration than I have, I'm sure. So that, that sterling silver insert, that, that's large enough to go onto your, you know, your high street charm bracelet brands. Pandora's. Yeah. Yeah, easily. Yeah. Yeah. And I don't think they do genuine amber. No, no, they don't. So I wonder how much this would be if they did mm. in that establishment. <laughs> a lot. It would be a lot. Great gift. A great, great, great gift. Yes, it's your, pam uh, it's your pumpkin cut. But at the same time, I can see uh, almost like Mary Quant flowers. That's the kind of thing that it I is, would actually, wear on it. Yes. Um, every day of the every day of the year, beautiful, warm cherry amber colour. We've also got it coming your way in the lemon and in the cognac too. Maybe if you wanted to wear them all together, I quite like that look. Yes. Let's bring it at a true early bird deal. Now, remind me then, Ross, how many do I have of these? We've got a hundred. Straight away, <laughs> if that was just an acrylic that you could find in somewhere like, uh, I, I literally walked past a Pandora shop yesterday. Mm. It's, they're always busy, fair play to them. They're always, always busy. They do amazing marketing campaigns and things like that. And Christmas, the queues are out the door, aren't they? Yeah. Something like this, if it was in, 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 in Pandora, it would be acrylic. And there's absolutely no way on earth with sterling silver, you'd be able to pay as little as 20 pounds. But that's a genuine amber. This is millions upon millions of years old. <laughs> this has literally defied the entire mother nature process, seen more life than any of us will yeah, do. Absolutely. I just love the fact that the, but the poor tree gets injured and it produces this resin, which yep. is an antiseptic, which heals the wound to prevent disease and fungal infections That's and all sorts in of itself, things. Isn't it? And then after all these millions of years, we benefit from that as well. I think yep. I think it's amazing. Yep. It is amazing, because yeah. inside your ambers, of course, is life that's preserved. Over 1,500 different species have been identified through amber. Wow. It's one of the most it's one of the most significant gemstones out there, not just gemologically, but paleontologically, biologically. Yes, actually. Historically, it is one of the most significant gemstones. Yeah, identified over one and a half thousand different species, and they're still identifying more. Fun fact. Twelve pounds and ninety nine pence. Oh, my word. That's crazy for amber and all that sterling silver as well. It is silver, isn't it? In the centre. <coughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Oh my goodness me! I'm going to be getting some of these perfect Christmas gifts. I think a, a couple of Christmases ago, that's exactly what I did. I bought these kind of donut shapes, but yeah. that was without the facets. And, and, and fed them onto some lovely sterling silver chains. Um, and my circle of friends were over the moon. I'm sure I paid significantly more than what's on your screens right now. People multi-buying. This is the cherry colour. Goodness me, that quantity's flown out the door. Shop ahead on the yellow and the cognac. Um, classic cognac colour. We're bringing those to air too. Conway's got two. Joanne, you've got two. Uh, Carola, hello to you. Alison, Dawn, Christine, Gillian, Lynn, Catherine, James, hello to you. London, Pauline, new customer, Elizabeth. Shropshire, too many names for me to mention every single one of you. Um, but yeah, very closely, uh, very closely approaching uh, single figure prices now. I love the cherry colour. We're looking at it here in the studio, it's not in its best light. When you actually see cherry amber actually out in natural sunlight, you see those warm, beautiful red Absolutely. colours. It's like a glass of Merlot, isn't it? <laughs> mm. You've got that rich, intense yeah. colour. Shall we do the yellow? 
love lemon. I love lemon amber. It's like sunshine. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Where's your, well, you've lost your shades now, haven't you? Well, I can't see the colours. Yours are quite light. Mine are quite dark. I almost can't take yeah. us seriously, you know, look like we're like this. <laughs> there you go. Right. Not paying £29.99. pence. Um, a very rare variety of your amber. That. You've got this really lovely... Yeah, it's like sunshine has been like captured. a buttercup, isn't it? Oh, yeah. beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, and you can see there as well those lovely little facets. What do they call that middle bit? Is it a rivet? Is it rivet? Uh, yes, I think I it's think a rivet so. of some... Yeah, yeah. I mean, do we even do that? Mm. I know. you can't put the gemstone around. No. It's the other way around. <laughs> that in itself, I imagine, is quite challenging. Twelve ninety nine. I'd love to see these all together. Literally, just to, I'd have the, the cherry in the centre, the yellow, yeah. yeah, and then the cognac. Uh, very, very popular on pre-order. Christine, Margaret, Dawn, Lynn, Weldon, Chew. Lots of amber lovers getting involved. When was the last time we had an amber day here at mm. Jewelry Maker? It looks like it looks like a nineteen fifties flying saucer, doesn't it? From the old black and white sci-fi. Yes, <laughs> especially the way it's spinning round yeah. there on That's our lazy beautiful. Susan. Uh, down to single figures already. The cognac is coming up in a few moments' time. If you love your sort of uh, sort of classic amber-like colour, very distinctive. Do you know, uh, um, I was in a supermarket the other day and literally just you queue in as you do, you're minding your own business. And I always have a little mooch in people's trolleys. I'm always nosy. But right. you self-scan? I do sometimes, but right, okay. I, f I end up getting cross because it never... Well, I go shopping. I don't have to talk to another human being. It's, it's ace. I like talking <laughs> to people, but no, yeah. no, but uh, there's never no. enough room no, on the self-scanning things that I get really impatient if it doesn't right. go through oh, the yeah. first time. Mm. Beep, beep, and you have to wait yeah. for somebody. Somebody, the red light yeah. flashes. Yeah. yeah, no, so normally I, I'll go through the, yeah. I'll go through the, the checkout, checkout. Um, but there was a lady stood in front of me and she had the most amazing amber jewellery on. And you really? just spotted it straight away. Um, let's bring you the classic cognac colour. I adore the, uh, the others, but for me, cognac all the way. Yes, yeah. Oh, that's Look at that. Isn't that's it? the pumpkin colour. Yeah, it's like a very fine brandy, like a Cabossier Ooh. or something like that. Yeah. Is that a posh brandy? Is it? Mm. Do you like a brandy? Oh, I don't mind a brandy. I tend to have it at Christmas because I drink malt during the week. Yeah. Yeah. What, like a whiskey? Malt whiskey. Do you? Oh, I love whiskey. I, I knew yeah. this. I knew yeah. this. I got well, you. Bought you bought me a bottle, which is very nice. Do you like it? Yeah. Have you had some yeah. yet? <laughs> Good, good, good. Yeah, yeah, well, Tom's the same. He's a yeah. whiskey lover too. Yeah. Um, but yeah, you've got it is that whiskey like colour that you can see it's within perfect, here. Yeah. Beautiful. Um, Sterling silver there at the top and the bottom as well. Straight away, immediately, we've got people multi buying on this as well. Dawn, Margaret, hello to you, Conry, Jacqueline, Lauren, Christine, Lynn in Lancashire, Lynn in Gloucestershire, wow. London. Hello to you, Candice, Carola, Lincolnshire. You know where we're going. Not going to stop at 29.99. Um, yeah, proving to be the most popular. And I don't think you need to overcomplicate it. I think it's absolutely perfect, just like so. I think, I think with the cherry and the lemon, people might ask you what you're wearing, but you can see straight away that... People know this, this, don't they? They know what it is. That's lovely. It glows, doesn't it? It's like it? a Chinese lantern, doesn't it? Ah, well. great idea. Yeah. What are those little flowers? Yeah. That look, I think they're called Chinese, Chinese lanterns. Chinese lanterns, yeah. I can't remember what they're And you used, used to dry That's them, right. didn't you? Yeah, the little orange, yeah. My mum and dad used to have some, and I was, yeah. as a child, you were just desperate to pop Popped them. them. <laughs> <laughs> 12.99 only to get hold of this. Again, absolutely flying on pre-orders, especially if you're thinking about gifts as well. Um, one thing I'm you know, so very mindful of, my friends love gemstones, but they might not be as enthusiastic as I am. So if I was to give them maybe, you know, one of the other colours, they wouldn't know what it was. No, no absolutely. So, absolutely. so sort of stick yeah. with, ooh, um, stick with the sort of classic cognac colour. £12.99 pence only to get hold of it. Loads of you there. How many did we have of these? We are just over 100 on this, but lots of you are choosing to multi-buy, so that quantity is absolutely flying. Essex, Johnny, you've got two. Kevin's got two. Lincolnshire's got two. Well done. Um, think Christmas. I'm saying it. I know we are still clinging on to September, but you think October, November, December, we've only got three months. I've already brought my Christmas jumpers down. Have ready. you? Yeah. Ready. I saw shops getting decorated for Christmas. Yeah. Shops have Christmas got Christmas crackers, stuff, Christmas yeah. crackers and yeah. things. Yeah. Absolutely, because I think everything goes fast. Every, everything, everything speeds up towards the end of the year, and I don't want to be spending my Christmas money 
on gifts. Actually, I want that all done Ooh, and dusted well yeah. before. Perfect present. Perfect present at 12 99 It's not breaking the bank. Well done, everybody. Congratulations. We've got some gorgeous kits coming up after the break, Mark, haven't we? Including seed beads. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful uh, um, hot... Hello, I almost said Hawaiian. Glass pearls. Then. Halloween colours. Yeah, no, I can't wait to show you this. They're amazing. I wish I'd had that green. That green is amazing. It is gorgeous, isn't Rhyolite, it? Rhyolite, I think. And, yeah, Rhyolite. Yeah. And we're going to be bringing yeah. them to you at amazing Halloween deals. Don't go anywhere. We'll return after this. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Hi uh, guys, so you, you know now, you guys, a lot of you are more educated than I am, but jadeite forms in boulders. Okay, and it's only the skin of that boulder that can, if you're extremely fortunate, contain those ultra rare colors. You know, the lavenders, the, 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 the mottled colors, sometimes a white skin. And in the rarest cases ever known, a beautiful red skin, which is the red jadeite. Now this seldom makes its way to market because it is so thin comparatively to the boulder that it's almost impossible to carve an entire piece out of a solid red color. Well, if you join me for this incredible showcase, you're gonna get the opportunity not just to see it, but to own it and at the most incredible deals. Taipei, 100% natural, Myanmar or Burmese red jadeite. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Welcome back, lovely jewellery makers. Yes, it is Mark and I. Ooh. Oh, 
goodness me, look, let's see. It doesn't really work with the spectacles, does it? <laughs> it just fell on the... Fell on the... Have I still got that one in my hair? You've still got I've loads still got of them in, in your hair. Okay. Mind, Things we do for JM, eh? I know, I must admit. Honestly. I gave the cleaner a right shock this morning. <laughs> Let's start to be around the corner. I'm going to drive straight home, but you've got to pick girls up from I've, school. I've, and... Yes. Oh, I'm, not even I'm not even joking, yes. I have got to do the school run. <laughs> I might have to wash my face, though, because I can't go like that. You're like, just, just, I think you should get your hands at the top and just drag, <laughs> drag it down. Yeah, and, just, and then go. <sighs> Yeah, I think you should. These are amazing, these glow sticks. I, they're I'm fab, really aren't they? They are fab. Can we turn the lights down? Have you ever seen... If you don't want glow we'll sticks to... turn them off do, or do something. They literally... Well, it says what it does. They're the best. They're the best. Ready? Ready. Oh, why are my glow sticks not working? I well, think you need the... some kind of light. Oh, you need the light, do you? You need to switch them. Oh, there we go. You need to re redo them. Do you? Yeah, you just bend your glow sticks. I don't think I, I don't think I squished them enough. Oh, That's better. There we go. Anyway, thank you. Yes, has thank anybody guessed what we are yet, Ross? The closest oh. one we've had so far is from. Oh, you've had some, we've had some good guesses though, haven't we? Yeah. I like I like the murder on the dance floor. That was a That's good a one. That's a good one. Here we go. What's this one? Uh it's a rave from the grave. That's, that's pretty spot on. So, Yvonne, so, well, you said the same. Yeah. Morning all, looking fab, guys. I think it's a rave from the grave. Pretty good. So we are, in fact, a pair of gravers just got home from the grave. Yes, that's, absolutely. That's that cheese. I think back in we my back in my twenties, there were probably nights where I rocked in looking like this. Yeah. <laughs> from not that I did the no. raves. I didn't do raves, but. You know. I've never done a club. I like, I've been clubbing, but not raving. I can't believe you've been somewhere where ladies wear bikini bottoms on a night out. No, no, you've misheard me. I misheard you. Yeah. <laughs> my friend, one of my friends right. at school used to be a bit of a raver. Right. And I can I remember photographs of her and she used to literally go out in like bikini bottoms and fluffy boots. Nothing else? Well, yeah, top. Oh, then, oh right. She'd right. wear a top, yeah, obviously. It would have been cold and... Yeah, she was a raver. They were I'd, tough, were they? Apparently ravers? so. Right. Now, that's, and that's why it was never my seat. I bet Jim has been to a rave. Jim, have you been to a rave? Every day. Every, Every day. day. Every, night. Every night he's at yeah. a rave. Um, how come you don't look like this then, Jimmy? <laughs> 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 right, then let's talk about these kits because they are beautiful. Mark, they're amazing. You've done it again. Your jewellery is just well, gorgeous. So, this is, and um, it's one of my favourite ever techniques. I think this is on a par with the kiss cross purely because it is the most simple technique ever in the world, but it produces the most exquisite, beautiful jewellery. Okay. And it does it all itself. I'm not responsible for this twist, it does it all itself. And it's just one move that you repeat over and over and over again. So this is one of the kits, which is, I think, I mean, we're going down the Halloween colours, but this is shouting out Chanel, isn't it? Yeah, it absolutely. Really and then the purple necklace at the back there, I've made little, little simple spiral stations, which you separate. Um, so I'm going to show you how to do these little stations here. So that's another way of looking at it, exactly the same little technique. And then we've got bracelets and all sorts of things. But um, I just think it's for, for, for a quick make, a really effective. <coughs> I can't believe that's a quick make. It's, it's amazing. It's so cool. Well, we started with that kit. And the gemstones that we have in these kits are amazing. Yeah, and I've put these kits together. So are these so mark kits? These are mark kits. Oh, yeah. I love it. Yeah. I love it. I love it. Well, yeah. that purple beautiful necklace is the one we're starting with, actually. Oh, brilliant. Um, so, like you said, the gemstones are absolutely incredible. Absolutely yep. incredible. Yep. So you've got beautiful tourmaline in here, like a cinnamon coloured tourmaline. So beautiful. Um, alongside this lovely lilac. Shell pearl, and they're four millimetres. You're a big fan of shell pearls, aren't you? Love shell pearls. No, a massive shell pearl. Are these are actually are these shell. These are shell. I know we've got some that are, that are glass coming up, but these these are the shell pearls, aren't they? Yes. No, I just absolutely love them. So I've incorporated them in this necklace piece, and uh, and what I've done is I've ombre the colours as well. So I've each of the little stations has five rows. Mm -hmm. So I've I've made sure that each of the five rows have the same colour from the from the strand. If that makes sense. Beautiful. It just works. It just and works. And, and you've yeah. got enough here to make that entire Masses. necklace. And I had some left. Oh, okay. And I think I made some earrings as well. Yeah, I made some some earrings to use the tassels as well. So um, yeah. So nothing's ever wasted. Uh, Mark commissioned kits, which I'm very excited about. They always that always. Well, we always get an well, Alice put together the kits for the 12 o'clock hour, which are all about pumpkin. <coughs> and, Love. Uh, and, I was, and she asked me to come up with the 9 o'clock hour, but sort of 
Halloween related. So we've gone with the colours of Halloween rather than Halloween pieces. Purple is a very like. Halloween colour, isn't Purple, it? It is. Purple, black, red, orange. It's all um, going greens and greens. all sort of thing. Yeah. Beautiful. Are you ready for the deal? And if you want to learn how to make these beautiful necklaces, of course, you have Mark. You can text us here in the studio. And of course, you're going to be demonstrating. Going to be demonstrating. Is your cobwebs getting in your way? I know. It's going to be it was, well, but it was a bit it? tickling the end of my nose earlier. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing. Trying to get... oh, honestly. £39.99. The strand on its own, yellow tourmaline. Yeah. yeah. Very similar in terms of uh, in terms of its beauty, but also in terms of the quality of that cognac zircon that we had earlier on at twenty four pounds and ninety nine pence. Would you yeah, all agree? Absolutely. Tourmaline is a complex gemstone, uh, gemologically one of the most uh, uh, complex in actual fact. There's around about fifty different chemicals present in one particular variety of colour. Completely natural. Fifteen carats. How about you get? absolutely everything within Mark's amazing kit for under 20 pounds. Uh, <laughs> That's the strand and everything oh, else for free. Down. I mean, how much are these tubes normally? 7.95. They're normally 7.95 yeah, on their own. Yeah. So the what that's 16 pounds that for those mm. and then you're getting your shell yeah. pearl and your tourmaline for free or vice versa. So I would I would buy the pearls and the seed beads and get that beautiful strand free. Yeah. That. that with the zircon we had at the beginning of the show would just be oh. incredible together. Just beautiful. How about with some Herkimer quartz in there mm. too? Yeah. That'd be a nice Amazing. little addition, wouldn't it? £19.99. And, and also, do have a little look on the website because there are actually what? One, two, three, four, five, six, six different kits. So we've got different colourways of your kits. So can we pre order on the different colourways too? And maybe if you wanted to, mix and match those colours too. Um, how many do we have in terms of quantity of these? There was 50 roundabout of each, so that, yeah. I mean, there's always going to be certain colourways that will sell faster than others. Purple is absolutely one of the most popular colours as well. Um, the black and gold, you've got reds in there, you've got greens, you've got oranges, you've even got sort of like a silvery black too. Right now, though, for these beautiful oranges and purples, I'm trying to think of what kind of Halloween character wears purple. It's a witch, isn't it? A witch wears purple. Yes. Do you remember Megan Mogg? Probably, Megan Mogg, I do, yes. Oh, you do remember. I was going to say, you're probably not old enough. No, that, that rings that, a that bell. Was, that was the first witch that I ever knew when I was a child. Wasn't she a friendly witch, She though? was a friendly witch, yeah. Mogg was her cat, yeah. Yeah, I do remember. In fact, I think, I think the girls have got a Mogg book. Oh, right. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Mogg book. Um, okay, this one's going to be popular. Heads up. The Strand on its own. Uh, I like... I have to say, this is probably my favourite. It's mine as well. Is it? I love it, yeah. Look at the this quality strand. of this strand. <clears throat> Look at the quality of this. It's called Potion. Ah. Is that right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah? Are my specifications right? Multicoloured spinel. Look, you've got pure, if you see this, Pillar box red spinel. Look at the quad for that red spinel yeah. on its own. Go on the GIA, you will see red spinel, cobalt blue spinel commands astronomically high prices. Look at the quality. I'm sure we bought this strand to air as a deal of the day, you know. I wouldn't be surprised. I'm really, yeah, I really do think we've bought it as a deal Ross of the day. Ross is thinking the same. Yeah. The quality of this strand is absolutely unbelievable cranberry colours yes. with your shell pearls, with that lovely iridescence across the surface. This would also be great for Christmas. Mm, absolutely. Not just Halloween. Really unusual, this shell pearl. Right, it's just, just lovely. Oh, these are glass. These are the glass. <laughs> um, four mil glass with, it, with that lovely kind of mystic-like coating. Oh. Now, we have promised these kits under £20. The strand on its own oh, has closed at £20. <laughs> oh, that had. Yeah. yeah. Natural, totally and utterly natural. Burmese, yeah. so not only is it of top hot quality, it's also from a location that we can no longer, you know, replace. Made a bit of a mistake on this, uh, on this kit. Should have been $24.99 when you consider the strand on its own is £20. Mm. But we've made a pledge. We've made a promise. Um, absolutely going to be the most popular of the kits. I think so, because you've got that really beautiful red. 
Plus then, yes, it's Halloween, but it's also perfect for Christmas festivities. I'd wear that on New Year's Eve. I'd wear that on Christmas Day. Oh, ma. So that's using the spinel. It's just lovely. Absolutely beautiful. So it's actually the spinel yeah. that sort of orbits the spiral. Right. Yeah. And if I'm new to this technique, Mark, or new to seed beading, is this something I can do? The easiest of all of the tube techniques, without a doubt. Really? Mm -hmm. And what do Honestly. I need to get myself started? Needle and thread. <laughs> That's it? That's it. You need a beading needle and some, and some what? And some fire line. Fire line. Fire, yeah. And away you go. Yeah. It's that simple. It's not even a massive investment. No. In nine seconds... <coughs> I, 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 would, I would sell this bracelet for 60, 65 pounds. Definitely. Any day of the week, yeah. And I bet day. it would absolutely fly. If Hour and a half it took me to make. If you still did your craft fairs, mm. which I know you don't get the chance to do these days because mm. you're so busy, yeah. I bet you this would be one of your most popular lines. Do you know, I, when I stopped my craft fairs, I hadn't, I hadn't done any seed beading. No. Anymore. It was all gemstones. And macrame. And macrame and things, yeah. So who, who knew what, um, what seed beading would have brought to the craft fairs? So, how many of these bracelets do you think you could actually make? Out you of can this make, make one bracelet, a pair of earrings, well, a couple of pairs of earrings. So it's, 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 it's quite, it's quite heavy, heavy stoned. But yeah. So it's, it's, but see how it holds its own against the black. It totally does. Yeah. That's the quality of the spinel. It's, it's just beautiful. Amazing. Yeah. Loads of you there. Uh, we wish we had more of this kit to be truthful, but mm. uh, unfortunately, yeah. limited. And that probably is down to, no, it's not probably. It mm. is down to the fact that it we is have this. We'll get a bit, give the viewers a bit of insight <coughs> of sit here. We have. On our system, <coughs> we have something called Sorry. top noting. Yes. Which basically means if we've got a big event coming or mm -hmm. we've got a week of shows or something like Christmas or Halloween, all of the, the gemstones or CBs that are going to be re relevant for that, that, that theme, yeah. they get top noted, they go bright yellow on the system and the producers can't include them in the show. Yeah. Um, some of these. We're top noted. <laughs> oh. But I haven't told you that. Oh, you could always do that. Well, if they're your kits, you could go, I just didn't know. I didn't know, no. I didn't, I didn't know, know what didn't top... Know. You've just no. confessed to something have, you no, shouldn't have done. No, Because um, that's what I did when I helped Georgia out with some kits a while a while ago. I was like, I didn't know about the top note in. No. I, I knew. No. I, of course I knew. Yeah. So, I think, so I think that red was definitely top <coughs> for Christmas. Yeah, well, that would make so, sense. It's the perfect yeah. cranberry colour. It, yeah. um, it may well be a sellout. We had just 50 of this kit. Angela, well done. Mm. <coughs> Excuse me, Caroline, Anne, Pauline, Susan and Brian, Mary, Jeanette, hello to Cumbria, London. Too many of you to be to say hello to everyone, but well done, each and every single one. How quickly is that going to sell out? Seconds. Mm. You know they're all under £20 as well, so you can shop ahead and pre-order. This is so elegant, absolutely. Beautiful. It's so, so elegant. Ah, oh, and you'll oh, know straight it. away which, which necklace. It's black and gold. Yeah, I love oh, it. Oh, Sabbath. Love it. Look at that, Spinel. Gorgeous, isn't it? Oh, it's onyx, I beg your pardon. Beautiful, beautiful black onyx. Classic black and gold. Then you have your uh, silver glass pearls, which are four millimetres and you're getting 12 of those. There we go, so I can scooch that alongside. And then the two tubes of your Mayuki, which are quite literally like gold dust, your, uh, your 11 0 gold sea beads, and then also the um, opaque black. They are like gold dust, aren't they? They're Atos, right? Yeah. So Ato size. If you got your, your webbing's I've everywhere. Got webbing is everywhere. We really must uh, it, dust more often. It was a it was a good idea this morning, wasn't it? If I I'll have to move that out of the way, Jimmy. But so I got the, I used the glass pearls to make these earrings. So this was um this was a little project I had in mind. So you can see the earrings through the webbing there. So that's oh, using the beautiful. little glass pearls. So beautiful. The combination of silver and gold really works, doesn't yeah, it? Does there it is, cobwebs everywhere. Cobwebs everywhere. Under twenty pounds. <laughs> We're already under, he said under £20 already. <coughs> yeah, and we're not stopping there. Really? We've got 75 of this kit, 3mm faceted black onyx. Black and gold is always, always very popular. It's luxurious, it's got that. It's the, it's the perfect party, Christmas party combination. What was the box of chocolates that you used to get in the, in, in the 80s? Terry's. Terry's all gold. That's it. Yeah. You just knew, you, you knew it was Christmas when the all gold was, was, yeah. was in the house, didn't you? Yeah. Uh, in your house, are you allowed to open the chocolates before Christmas? I can't. Well, I didn't used to like. Well, I don't like chocolates, so it was all a bit of a waste. But I used to, <coughs> for Christmas, before we, you know, before I was earning proper money, 
I used to buy my mum like a Terry's chocolate orange yeah. every year. Nice. And I used to buy my dad a pack of 20, 20 Embassy Regal. <laughs> and I used to go to the shops as a little kid and buy them. Literally. Yeah. Wine gums were my dad's. Oh, wine gums? Yeah, uh, box of wine right. gums every year. <laughs> right, right, the way, uh, right the way up. Oh. Um, 1999 only, but we're not stopping there. What's he doing? Going even even lower. Yorkshire jellied fruits. There's another one. Oh, yeah, you know it's yeah. Christmas. York fruits, yeah. York fruits. York, York fruits. fruits. Yeah. What's he doing? What's he doing? I mean, for the onyx on its own, 1999 was absolutely amazing. Goodness me, 14 pounds and 99 pence only. Even if you just didn't, wow. I'm looking across at your lovely memory wire bracelet, which is just what that was just using some rotations. more. Of, that, that was just more of the more of the sea beads that I had left. So I've made a pair of earrings, a necklace, and the memory wire bracelet, and I had some left as well. So look at that. And that's just simple memory wire threading. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Just a mixture of your two Mayuki colours that come within this kit. Again, we said it a few moments ago, Mark, the two tubes on their own should be that price. Absolutely. No, that is the price of the sea beads, yeah. Absolutely. <coughs> the two sea beads on their own, but you are getting your onyx and also your uh, lovely uh, silver glass pearls, which we don't see very often either. And no. um, We had 75 of this kit. It's the only black and gold kit that we actually have available. If you want the silver colours, we've still got another, um, another kit to bring you to. There's more colourways still to bring you. Um, but bear with us, and now yeah. we've brought two air, and again, shop ahead. These glass pearl strands are huge. Massive! I love the green. I wish I'd had the green. Did you not get sent that kit? No. Well, they're, they're getting quite canny now, because they know us guest designers work so hard, and they think that we work too many hours sometimes. So what they do is that they've only started sending us half the kits now. because That's they know Alice, they, isn't it? If they knew that they send them all of us, then we would make so much jewellery. Look at Al Yeah, that's so Alice, Alice. Alice looking after That's how she's yeah. looking after you, making sure you don't... Because you, you would make up with every single kit, wouldn't you, Mark? Perfect. You would. I know. I, we know what you like. Um, which of these techniques are you going to show us then? I'm just going to show the spiral. The spiral! Yeah, the we, lovely as, spiral. As again, it's a technique that I've shown quite a few times, but <coughs> we get lots of new people joining us or people who miss the show. And, and, it, and it's such a lovely, lovely technique that is so simple. And as I said, the spiral does itself. So I'm not responsible for doing that at all. And not only that, even if you have seen the technique, I've seen it before, mm, yeah. but I wouldn't be able to just make it like that. No. I'd, need to, I'd need the refresher. No, so, um, again, if you're watching this right now and you're thinking, yeah, OK, I want to do that, but, I, you know, I'm not going to remember everything that Mark does, then don't worry, we record all of our, our uh, uh, demos as well to mm. YouTube so you can watch them back, yeah, can't you? Absolutely. OK, absolutely. take it away. So, what you need first is your beading thread, and I've gone for Hobnob, which is the forest green, um, which is my go-to, and it's perfect for every single one of these kits. The, the colours work. As you can see, it's forest green. And why I like forest green <coughs> is that it just disappears. Whichever seed bead or gemstone, anything you use, it seems to disappear. It's, it's absolutely amazing. So I tend to use forest green more than anything. And then what you need, you need an 11 OC bead and an 8 OC bead and a 4 mil or a 6 millimetre bead of your choice. So you can either go for a glass bicone, you can go for a round, you can go for a gemstone, anything that, that is at least four millimetres, which is, so hence you can see why I've designed the kits that you have everything you need yeah. for each one. Okay. So I would probably take, if you're making a necklace, you are going to add thread probably two or three times. So just choose a piece of thread that's comfortable. I tend to go for three or four feet to start. Pop it on your needle. And then we're just going to take one of our little 11 O's and we're going to pop it at the bottom of our thread. Now, a lot of my necklaces, I don't tend to do the spiral all the way round. A, it takes a bit longer to make. B, you might run out of gemstones, but mainly I don't like, I think it's a waste sometimes taking all that time on making jewellery that's going to be at the back of the neck under hair. Yeah. Okay, so what I tend to do is leave a thread of about 12 inches. You do your spiral <coughs> section, which tends to be half the necklace, and then, you just, then you're just using your seed bead combination, which will then go around the back of the neck. So, so leave a decent length tail. So we're going to pop our stopper bead on. And then in the simple spiral, you have two sections. You have the core, which runs through the center, and then you have what's called the arcs, which are your spiral sections. So there's only two sections. And I've done all the working out for you. So for each of the pieces that I've made today, it's, it's the same size spiral. So what you need to do, first of all, is you need to pick up five of your eight O's. OK, you can do 11 O's, but you find that 8 O's is a really nice size because, because we've gone for five core beads. 
each time you add a move, you're going to be sewing through five elevens. So you need a, a, a larger size seed bead because you're doing quite a few multiple passes. So we're going to slide that down. So that's your core. Then you need to decide on the combination of your arc. And once you've decided that, it's going to be the same combination every single time. So I'm going to go for two purple 11. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to place the combination on the top of my board as a reminder. So two purple, then one 8 And what you need to do, you need to go small to large to small. So you need a mirror image. Okay. And then I'm going to choose one of my pearls. And then I'm going to go for an 8 and I'm going to go for two 11 O's. Okay, so that's the combination you're going to pick up every time. So as I said, just leave that at the top of your board just to remind you. Yeah. So we're going to do our first arc. So two 11s, one 8, one of our pearls, one 8, and two 11s. And we're going to slide that down. And then what we're going to do is we're going to let that fall. So that's our arc section. We're going to take our needle round all of our five beads that we added at the beginning in our core and we're going to take the needle up through all five beads and we're going to pull okay so now you have your core and then you have your little arc so that's the only time you're going to add more than one core bead at a time so it's just the beginning you add your five so we're going to pop that to one side so every single move now because not only do we have to do our little arcs, but we also have to um, elongate the core going through the centre. So from now on, every single move, we pick up one eight, then we pick up our combination. So always remember the core bead first, and then our combination, which we know from our roll on the top, is two 11s, one eight, a glass bead, an eight, and two 11s. And we're gonna slide that all the way down so it meets our beading. Now, can you remember the first move we did, we took our needle round and back up through five of our core beads, okay? Yeah. We're gonna do the same, but we're gonna start from the top. So we're gonna count backwards, one, two, three, four, five. So we're going to ignore bead number six. And you're gonna take your needle up through the last five. So one, two, three, four, five. We're gonna take our needle back up through we're going to pull nice and tight. So that's our second arc. And then what we're going to do is we're going to place the second arc we've just made round the back and pull nice and tight <coughs> so the two arcs are next to each other. Place that down and we're just going to repeat. So you're going to pick up one 8 which is your core bead. Then we're going to pick up one two 11s, one 8, one pearl, one 8, two 11s. Okay, we're going to slide it all the way down so it meets our core. And then we're going to, again, count from the top. So that's the core bead we've just added. So that's bead number one. So one, two, three, four, five. We're going to take our needle back up through the top five, ignoring the bottom two. Pull nice and tight. And then we're going to take that little arc we've just made round the back, pull nice and tight. So now we have three together. So you can already see the spiral starting to happen. It does it all itself. So we'll do a couple more. <coughs> so again, we pick up <coughs> our black arc. <coughs> Excuse me. Slide <coughs> it down. Then we're going to pick up our arc, which is one, two, one, one glass pearl, one eight and two elevens. Got two joined together there. And then we're going to Take our needle, we're going to count from the top, which is the one we just added. So that's one, two, three, four, five. So as you can see, as I mentioned, there's a lot of multiple passes through the, the beads. So um, you will need to use the minimum of an 8 -o. You can use a 6 -o if you wanted to as well, going up through the centre. So we take our needle back up through the five, pull nice and tight, and then we flip the arc around the back to meet all the rest. And you can see now, if I lay that down, you can see the spiral already starting to happen. So, oh, so all you're going to do now is just repeat and repeat and repeat, and you'll start to get the spiral. If I just bring the piece down that I made using the beads, what I've done here is I've done a section of a group of five. So I've done my group of five. Then I've popped a shell pearl in between, 
and then I've re-threaded my five core beads. Okay. I've made another section of five, placed my little pearl in. So can you see I've done little, little sections rather than a whole complete spiral yeah oh yeah so, so it lays see, flat so it lays flat so you can do it that way if you want to as well and again that's less work and it just gives you a completely different look or if i bring if i bring the black spiral across here just take the cobwebs, cobwebs away uh, everywhere so if i just bring the necklace across there we go so what i've done with this one which just again so just to give it something else is I've, is I've done a different with the arc you see i've started with two so the original arc in the center instead of five beads was six which then means I can have a larger arc. Mm. So what I've done here is two gold, one black, one gold, and I've got that amazing spinel. Well, no, it was Olinx, wasn't it? Yeah. Black onyx going through the center. And then I've gone, um, as I said, the mirror image. So as long as you're, you, first of all, you need to decide how big your spiral wants to be, and that will determine the number of core beads you first start. But as I said, my top tip is to lay out your little arc section at the top yeah. just so you remember time after time after time and also i suppose if you get if you if you are often asked maybe for recommissions mm, absolutely then you're going you know, to you're know you're going to know you're absolutely gonna need to know which, yeah. what the order actually was yeah. so as you can see what i've done here do you remember at the beginning of the demonstration i said if you don't want to spiral all the way to the back of the neck mm. just leave a long enough tail and all i've done then is i've just added a, a seed bead selection on the back there and then attached my jump rings and it's claws. probably more comfortable that it's way more as comfortable well. as well or if you want to you can just continue the spiral and do a 360 if you wanted to as well but as you can see it's a really simple technique it does all the work for you but i think the end results are just so beautiful oh. i mean how elegant is that stunning absolutely stunning and you've got more than enough within these more kits to enough. actually make that necklace. yeah so so this so I'm, in this kit i made the necklace the earrings and you have so many cbs that i that i did the the memory wire bangle as well so you know, you can make a whole suite out of it. You can make a whole suite out of each of these kits easily. Love that. Easily. Absolutely love that. Easily. Particularly after, say, this next kit, because it's huge. Oh, those this are, next oh, kit is huge. Eye of Newt. Oh. Oh, I love it. Look at that. Look, look at the length of the strand of your, and these are glass pills. We're going to bring you an amazing, amazing deal. So alongside that, you've got your Terra Jasper. Four millimeter wow. silver um, glass pearls. You get 200 in total in that strand just there. And then I see where the eye of Newt comes from now. They're amazing. Look at the colors of these, uh, of these beautiful Mayukis. So you have, um, how do we describe this? So opaque black, fairly obvious, that's the Ato. And then you've got opaque yellow Hello, Picasso. Picasso. Ooh, that's gorgeous. I guess that's the and I've not I've not seen the yellow Picasso before. Um, yesterday, Carol asked you, have you got a newt in your in your garden? Yeah, no, we don't have, we don't have newts. We don't they're have newts. Again, they're, 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 they're actually, protected. They're protected, yeah, aren't they're protected, they? Your newts. Yeah, yeah. Twelve ninety nine only to get wow. hold of this. Wow. That's amazing. That is an incredible. Again, that's a great price tag for you for your Mayuki or for the shell pearl. Not shell pearl, glass pearl, I should say. Um, but you are also getting the Terra Jasper as well. Again, perfect, perfect Halloween like colours. But also that could be almost a golden influence, couldn't no, it, with absolutely. the... Yeah. Uh, and, with and if you buy more than one coat, one kit, there's so many different ways of colour combinations you can use as well. Yeah. That's, that's stunning. Well, this would mix really nicely with the orange or no, with the green right. that you've yeah. got coming up I as well. That green. that green is so beautiful. Love it. I can't wait to see that. Absolutely like incredible Hulk, love it. Absolutely love it. It is. <laughs> yeah. Um, perfect. Well done. We had, how many do you say? 75? Gosh. Yeah, it's not going to be enough, is it? Especially when people are multi-buying on this one. So, Eye of Newt. What's the rest of it in that set? Know. Anyone that's watched Hocus Pocus, aren't they remaking Hocus it's Pocus? It's being launched this weekend. Hocus is Pocus it? 2 on Disney. Yeah. Love it. With same, cast, same cast. Same yeah. cast. Sarah Jessica Parker yeah. and... I always forget. Somebody to me. I can't remember the latest yeah. name. Yeah, amazing. Yeah. Absolutely amazing. Um, move on to the wow. next kit, shall we? So, this one's all about the pumpkin colours. <clears throat> So we have here, excuse this. me, sniffling. Is that an iris mix? That one? Like, yeah, it looks like an iris mix. Let's have a little it? look. It says metallic variegated. <laughs> variegated <laughs> variegated <laughs> iris. Variegated. Yeah. Here's me trying to spell it out. Oh. Uh, it's the, uh, I'll blame the glasses. Oh, no, yeah, yeah. Variegated blue iris. You iris, said iris. iris mix. I love the iris mix. And yeah. then you've got your opaque orange, which I love. I would buy the kit for that one tube on its own. See, I'd buy the kit for the orange. Oh, would you? I love yeah. the orange. Yeah. 
Then you have your lovely uh, shiny eggplant. Oh. Shiny eggplant glass pearls. So there we go. You get a lovely strand of that as well in your classic four mil. And ro uh, rhodonite. Um, is your accenting gemstone there? 45 carats of your beautiful road night. I've not scrimped on the gemstones with these. You kids. definitely <laughs> haven't. Definitely no, not. No. And you've really chosen the perfect Halloween like yeah, colours. No, I think so. I'm really pleased. Most of us were. I, I do like a little window mm. scene at Halloween. I do. Because, like I said, I've always been brought up that if you go trick or treat and you only go to the houses that are right. decorated. Right. So I, we don't really do much at the front of the house, but I do in sort of our bay mm. window. Yeah. Um, and yeah, little pumpkins. It's all these colours, literally mm. oranges and purple. Yeah. Oh. Beautiful. I, I also I also have a curfew. We don't do Halloween past nine o'clock. Well, that's quite late. It is. For a school night. I mean, we're yeah. we're in before that. Yeah. But I don't. I won't answer the door after nine o'clock. Right. Yeah, because it gets it gets yeah. dark then, doesn't it? Yeah. Uh, Twelve ninety nine only. Loving those colours. Well done, everybody. Congratulations. A mix and match. Then that's oh. a great price for the uh, for, for for the Mayuki bead. Now, Mark, you're very Here excited about this yeah. one, aren't you? Yes. I hope we've got the quantity of them. I'm a green person, so straight away this has got my these. attention. Two beautiful tubes of your Mayuki, both in your 8 and also your 11 -0. It's like Zavarite greens. Love it. Absolutely love it. So, uh, silver-lined green seed beads, okay? Um, and then you've got one which is described as lime. The Atos are described as lime. Um, then you've got, I know they are, they say gold on the specifications. However, for me, let's be honest, it's a canary yellow. It is. Lovely yeah, canary yellow. Yeah. And, and, and I think we should highlight that. Plus then you've got yeah. your rhyolite, totally natural, beautiful gemstone. Oh, the pumpkin's just in the way. Let me just move him. Hang on. Slimer. Ah. Slimer, wasn't he? Wasn't he the ghost? Da, 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 yeah. Da, da, da. Yeah. Da, da. yeah, Ghostbusters. He was the good ghost, though, wasn't he? Twelve ninety nine only for the two tubes. For the two tubes of my Mayuki beads. <laughs> I mean, if, if could you pass over that lovely oh, um, that prize? Yeah. Oh my word! For the two tubes of Mayuki, can you pass over that black and gold memory wire bracelet? Yes, certainly. You don't have to be a sea beader, do you, to have to work with these kits? I mean, imagine that. <coughs> Excuse me, with the green. green. Yellow and green. <laughs> Love that. Imagine that, but in the green colour. I want this game. I hope we've got enough of them. And again, can you see the um, the top noted greens there? Yes. I'm going to get into so much trouble. Yes, because they are I've done. I've done the deed greens. and then I've confessed it live on. Live on air. Live on air. Alice will be rolling her eyes at you. Mm. But, mm, she's too nice to be cross though, isn't she? Yeah. To be fair, that is the perfect Christmas green colour, Mark. Mm, no, it's ace. Hey ho! So imagine mixing these up. So if you were thinking about at these kind of prices, why wouldn't you? If you are thinking ahead for Christmas, mm. imagine those greens yeah, then yeah. with the gold. Yeah. Or with absolutely. a little bit of black, you've then got your Santas, haven't you? And your your Christmas yeah, wreaths, all yeah. of the above. Well um, shop ahead. Make sure you do check out your baskets on those. Well done, every single one of you. Again, loads of you there. Um, as you predicted, Mark. It's my favourite, I think. Yeah, this is the yeah. uh, this is actually the most popular. This and the black and gold, I think, yeah, have been. Yeah. Slimer. I loved Ghostbusters back in the day. I was scared of it a little bit. Wait. You know that scene where what's the name Sigourney Weaver kind of mm. is, oh, is levitates. levitates. That was quite that was quite scary. Mm. Not quite as traumatic, as, I, I think, as maybe the Never Ending Story. The Never Ending mm. Story was really really scary. Really? The nothing. Uh, I suppose so. Yeah. I'm, it's, <laughs> I think I think it's deep rooted. Yeah, it's really terrifying. The nothing. Oh. The world is just because people well literally done. don't don't uh, don't right. believe anymore. Um, I don't know. As a child, what film did you watch that had a bit of an effect on you. Which one? Return to Oz. Return oh, to Oz. Yes, yes, that is terrifying. Yes. yes. Yeah. Gremlins. Gremlins. Scared, me to death. Scared you to death. Gremlins were scary. They don't make them no. like that anymore, do they? No. Oh, well, yeah, they were terrifying, actually. No, I like, yeah, I like Definitely with you on that, Dan. Return to Oz. I wouldn't. The, the monkeys on wheels. <laughs> what is that all about? Yeah. Um, OK, now. <coughs> oh. I'm always, game, I'm always game for dressing up. However, 
When I see strands like this, I almost feel like I definitely, definitely should not be dressed up. So, Dan, yep. can I borrow um, one of your white busts? Oh. Look at the quality of these. They're just so pretty. You did say on your, your message back to me when I suggested dressing up, you said, well, it depends whether we have anything high-end that you need to hound uh, your forgot. neckline. And then we just <laughs> forgot about it. It's OK. It's OK, because Dan's always on oh, hand man. with this. Thank you, lovely. I'm going to put the two together. Oh, look. I'm going to start with the larger of the strand. Look Genuine that. cultured pearls. Look at the quality of the colours that you're getting within both of these. Oh, my word. They're natural. You've got natural pinks. Natural peach. I'm going to start with the larger of the two. They are separate opportunities. No, 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 no. Naturally coloured pearls are normally quite the investment, as we've discussed earlier on in the show. Is that the larger of the two? Or have I got the smaller of the two there? Hang on. No, I've picked up the wrong one. There we go. Now... To get hold of, listen, it's, it's, it's like Sapphire is a prime example. Heat treated or diffused Sapphire is still valuable. It is, but it's not as valuable as natural. Mm. The same applies when it comes to pearls. Dyed pearls are still valuable, but they're not as valuable as natural. Now, we know that. You know that. And yet here we are bringing you eight to nine millimeter, genuine cultured pearls, natural in color. It should be, a, I agree, it should be a sort of a hundred pound strand. Our first price crash, the highest price. Yeah, it's already way too low. Ross, what are you taking these to? Yeah. <laughs> Do you know, those, those purples, if you were with Mark and I earlier on this morning, when we were discussing, mm. you know, how pearls acquire this natural colour. It's all down to sort of the migration, if you like, where they occur, where they form within the actual mollusk itself. That, that should not be 34 99 we have 25 of these available and we have a smaller size still to come. So if you wanted to create a really beautiful graduation, you could do that. I don't, I don't. No. Oh, you're joking. You'd think we'd get used to these prices by now, wouldn't you? Because You'd every think. day, oh, I'm surprised. Me too. I'm shocked. Do you know, uh, it, it, ma it makes me chuckle because uh, I think uh, there was, a, there was a, uh, somebody mentioned to me, also oh, stop acting surprised when you see the prices. Do you think I know these prices? I genuinely don't. I genuinely, I can't remember every auction that's included in the show. So Ro what Ross does, he sends me a star buy sheet. And to be honest, I don't look at the prices because more often than not, he doesn't, he doesn't stick it to anyway. himself. No, that's it. Twenty-four ninety-nine only. I'll never. We'll never get used to these deals. No. It's not. If they were dyed, absolutely. That's it. That that would be a great price if they were dyed pearls. They're not dyed though, and they're big sizes. Eileen, Yorkshire, Christina, Gabrielle, Pauline, Tracy, Christine, and Essex. I think we've missed a digit on these. Something's gone wrong. Maybe an admin error. I don't know. I don't know. I wish we had more. I wish we had more because they are over allocated significantly. So we have got the slightly smaller size if you did want to create maybe a classic rope. And it is, again, it's these beautiful colours which are very much in the limelight. We spoke about the Novus necklace earlier on, didn't we? We spoke about those two naturally coloured pills that sold for $1,500 online. These are on the verge of selling out as well. Well done. Well done. Let's do the smaller strand now, shall we? These are cute. Beautiful. Yeah. I'll hold the two alongside. So again, oh, you can perfect. see how perfectly colour matched they are. <laughs> Go on, Mark, you say that. Oh, no, really? There's 14. Ross has just told me to tell you that there's just going to be one crash and it's going under £20. So grab it, absolutely grab it quickly. Oh, gosh. You can't not get these if you've got the other strand. No, you? I agree. Absolutely not. Oh, honestly. <laughs> get both of these strands for less than £50 today. Silly. It is bad. It should have been at least, I don't know, 
Yeah, quadruple crazy. that price tag. Absolutely mad. For the two, definitely over £100. Look at the quality of those colours. And the pinks are still the most popular colour of pearl with that pink overtone. There are just eight of these available. Pamela, new customer, new customer. Um, hello to you, Yorkshire. Hello to you. Lo oh, look at that. Oh, Should dear me, Mark. Who's going who's gonna to be successful? All of a sudden, we were inundated on the web and on the phone line. Sally, Pauline, Tracy, Christine, Gabrielle, Julie, Cheryl, Anne, Pauline, Manchester, Devon. Oh, no. Look Neil, really nice. Yvonne, Catherine. Ollie, these are natural. These are naturally coloured. I'm going to move on because I think we've actually crossed the system. Stay where you are on those phone lines. I, oh, I, no. Is this the strand that I think it is? Knew it. Knew it straight away. Um, because I'll be the first to admit that Mexican, Mexican turquoise, I've always considered to be the sort of gre more greener colour. Um, which is beautiful. Like Tibetan turquoise has got a very unique like, colour mm. saturation. If you'd have asked me what, what location this turquoise was from, prior to me actually uh, um, well, finding this out, I would have definitely, definitely have said Arizona. A hundred percent. I launched this, didn't I? Yes. And I remember I actually said that's the best Mexican turquoise I've ever seen. Because Mexican turquoise is normally heavily matrixed and a little bit more green. If I said to you, and I'm not, but if, if I said to you, look at this Sleeping Beauty turquoise, would any of you question that? That's gorgeous, isn't it? Regardless of country of origin, the more robin egg the blue... Mm. I was just going to say robin egg blue, isn't it? ..the more valuable yeah. the turquoise. Origin does make a difference, yes, but it doesn't determine the overall value. No, no. The quality of the gemstone does. It, set, it speaks volumes when I see thousands upon thousands of gemstone strands in, in, in any given year, month even. It speaks volumes when I recognise it. It's perfect, isn't it? Without even being told I've auctioned it before. <laughs> I knew that I'd launched this. Look at that. December's birthstone, course, absolutely yes. perfect. Yes. Yeah. And also, you know, when I, I really like the winter months. I like the fact that, it, you know, you get cosy and you snuggle mm. up on the sofa and things like that. Whereas my husband's definitely, definitely a summer person. So he's always clinging on to colour. <laughs> clinging on to your turquoises and gemstones like that. So it can be re it can be that lovely reminder, can't it, of summer months. £29.99. For, for, for turquoise rounds, it's the most wasteful cut. It's the most expensive. It's, it's the finest quality Mexican turquoise because it is so... There is such a minimal matrix. If I'd have said this... If, if I'd have guessed that this was Sleeping Beauty turquoise, I think most of you would have agreed. Should we do a close-out deal? Imagine this with those pearls that we had earlier on yeah. as your early bird. Imagine this with your technique. Mm. Look incredible, wouldn't it? That's just silly. If this was Sleeping Beauty, you'd have a one in front of it. And that would be a great deal. It would be a triple-figure price tag. Well, certainly used to be a triple-figure price tag. That's exquisite. Ross, when you say close-out deal, <laughs> how many do we have? Hello? 80. <coughs> 80 of these available. Do you want to see one of the best quality turquoise? Do you want to own one of the best quality turquoise at one of the lowest prices? This is the price that we're about to take it to that you would expect for nuggets. Absolutely. Would you agree? No, absolutely. Chips and nuggets. No disrespect to chips and nuggets, but they are more, affo they are more affordable. Well, remember, the more robin egg the blue, the more valuable the turquoise. Under 20 pounds. No, there's no, 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 no. I know when we launched this, how many of them, how many of them sold on the original launch? <coughs> okay, so literally triple figure quantity sold on launch. 
We have the last remaining quantity. Whether Wayne's managed to get a reorder on these, I'm not entirely sure. These are too good to be within the vault. You know, if you're a turquoise lover, I don't think, you know, prior to jewellery maker days, when we decided that we love turquoise, we didn't go, oh, Sleeping Beauty, or oh, it has to be Sleeping Beauty, or oh, it has to be mm. Kochi, it has to be Kingman. Yeah. We just love turquoise, didn't we? And that's really how we should be. Yes, of course, that, you know, country of origin can have a reflection of price tag, but ultimately it's all down to the quality of the gemstone. This is some of the best turquoise I've seen at the most amazing price tag. That's what I said when I launched it a couple of months ago. And I absolutely stand by that statement now. Valentina, Manchester, Pauline, Denise, Carol, hello to you, Elizabeth. West Midlands, Elaine, new customers, Lorraine, Merthyr, Tidfil, hello to you, Julie. So much that you can do. Rounds are also very expensive when it comes to turquoise because it naturally forms um, within cracks of the host rock. So yeah, yeah. you're cutting away yes, absolutely. a big carrot weight. Um, and I learned that quite recently, actually. It was uh, Jake that actually said to us, well, they tend to be slices or mm. heshy beads or ovals at the very least because you're capitalizing on the carat weight of the gemstone itself. Um, <clears throat> but 20 pounds, Mark. It's amazing, isn't it? Absolutely amazing price. It's just beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Love that, and I think I would just recreate it. I'd re restrand it, probably multi-buy at that mm. price tag. So you are, you are a fan of matrix or non-matrix turquoise? Non-matrix. Oh, really? You like, I do you like, like Matrix, right. but I do like the colour. So right. I want the colour to be the sort of yes. dominant. I'd use this with, the, with those orange seed oh, yeah, beads that'd be amazing. that you had a yes. few moments ago. With the, with the amber, yes. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, beautiful. Yeah, if you, if you love amber, we've got more amber coming up as well. Oh. A little bit later on okay. in the show. Um, okay, so lovely jewellery makers, make sure you check out your baskets. Still got loads to bring you, including some amazing, amazing jade out. We've got Grand Digirite coming up as well um, in a strand like you've never, ever seen. Plus, we've also got the calibrated cuts. We've got uh, your Herkimer Quartz coming up and your Deal of the Day. An amazing brand new ring bender coming up as well. Masterclass with lovely Mark. What more to see? Uh, so much more to see. We'll be back after this. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Hi guys, so you, you know now, you guys, a lot of you are more educated than I am, but jadeite forms in boulders. Again, it's only the skin of that boulder that can, if you're extremely fortunate, contain those ultra rare colors. You know, the lavenders, the, 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 the mottled colors, sometimes a white skin. And in the rarest cases ever known, a beautiful red skin, which is the red jadeite. Now this seldom makes its way to market because it is so thin comparatively to the boulder that it's almost impossible to carve an entire piece out of a solid red color. Well, if you join me for this incredible showcase, you're gonna get the opportunity not just to see it, but to own it and at the most incredible deals. Type A, 100% natural, Myanmar or Burmese red jadeite. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know 
that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Happy shopping with Jewellery Maker. Jewellery Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewellery Maker. Jewellery Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewellery Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewellery Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewellery Maker. Oh, welcome back, lovely jewellery makers. Now, up next, a wire I'm ring intrigued. bender. Yes, I must admit, I'm intrigued. Now, this is um, a product that was originally scheduled to obviously be launched alongside, uh, alongside Claire, and she very kindly has filmed um, a technique. So we've got a demonstration from Claire herself actually using this, this amazing tool. And basically, from what I can gather, it's a mandrel that literally you can have set up on your desk. Yes, all the time. It's all the time. Yeah. Say your Durston workbench or wherever it is that you actually create. Um, and it's going to give you that, that perfect ring shank. Now, from what I'm watching just here, and you'll see it in a few moments' time, you don't have to be a fully-fledged silversmith to work with, with no. your wires and things like that, do you? Look at that. But to get that perfect spherical shape... It's actually quite mm. tricky, I guess, without tools like this. Now, it's been available already on pre-order uh, pre and people are actually shopping ahead. This is limited, though. There are only 65 opportunities. So I'm just going to show you um, a couple of sort of prices that we found elsewhere for, uh, for, for, for ring benders. This, I'm guessing, will also work with your existing jewellery. I mean... Certainly, I've actually misshaped, I don't know, rings in the past and um, needed a mandrel to actually oh, sort of straighten them out. Repairing. You can use it for yeah, that for actual so. repairs. Yes. Yeah. Um, so here's Cooks and Gold, one of our close competitors as well. Durston uh, Ring Shank Bender with 11 different dies. There we go. £302. So it's not the exact same one. Is it? Is it the exact same one? Very, very similar. Very, very similar. Um, there's wow. the kind of price points that you can pay for uh, for a ring bender. But again, this is going to be something that there's another one, metal bending set, two hundred and fifty five pounds and sixty pence. Um, but again, yeah. So if you've got if you've got jewellery already, uh, and maybe I don't know a wedding band, they do they do misshape yeah. from time to yeah, time, don't absolutely. they? You catch them yeah. on something. Yeah. Yeah. So great for your repairs as well. Um, so yeah, you can see the price point that you have to generally have to invest in um however not today plus i think this is a tool that as long as you providing you look after it you're going to have and you're never going to need to replace never it's a lovely piece of kit i like the weight of it yeah it's really substantial it is it is heavy it's now gorgeous. i'm the same by the way try and pick that up oh my God. you still only get the it's still only our usual oh. postage and packaging it is a heavy bit of kit That'll cost you thirty, forty pound in postage with that weight. Yeah. Oh my word. Well, what That's we're going to do? We're going to throw to our lovely yeah. Claire. We'll bring the graphics to air, so you can shop during and as and when Claire is walking us and talking us through this amazing product. Um, no, there are only sixty-five opportunities, and four have already gone since we've been talking. Um, right. It's been on. Yeah, it's been on pre-order for about how long? 15 minutes, okay. So if, you, if you're wondering how you use it, I think it's fairly self-explanatory, but never mind me. Uh, let's go to our lovely Claire and she'll talk you through how you use this tool. Do 
Do bear with us. We're just having some auditor uh, auditor uh, issues. We will auditor. Audio. Audio. I, I like auditor. Auditor. I like that. Auditor <laughs> issues. Um, <laughs> as soon as we can sort it, then we will obviously uh, we'll obviously throw throw to that video as well. But. Again, you know, you don't have to be a silversmith to actually justify a purchase like this. You have to be a, certainly a, somebody that might be, might work with your uh, um, with your metal sheets, maybe your ring shanks, but also to actually have um, jewellery in your collection alone. Because um, we brought not so long, or oh, actually was quite a while ago. Do you remember when we launched that uh, sort of plating tool? Oh yes, yes. How Absolutely. many of us yeah. need to replate jewellery? Yeah. Amazing, isn't it? You know. Um, yeah. What about, I'm just thinking, various different jigs. I don't know, I, I'm trying to think of different tools that you would use, not necessarily as a fully fledged jewellery maker. But this is the kind of thing you could have actually set up in your station. Um, and you never really need to take it off. And I assume it sort of screws down to the bench. Our postage and packaging is still only £3.95, pence, regardless of the fact that it weighs a tonne. <laughs> it's very, very, very heavy. And um, we can see you all dialing through. Bear with us yeah. while we just sort out the audit. What I really uh, like is, is the fact that you've got three, no, six different ring sizes. Yeah. That, that's your circles. And then you've got a square and you've also got a diamond marquise shape as well for doing angles. So you've got right angles if you wanted to So it's not square. just ring shanks then? No, no. So if it's for, for square bend, if you want to make square jump rings, I would have thought. Yeah. Or marquise shape. I love that. I oh, that's just, fab, isn't it? So actually, it's a mandrel of many, uh, yes. of many, uh, of many. I don't know uses. I guess. Um, I'm just looking at the recording now, so you can see Claire is actually attaching yeah. it to her her workstation. I believe she's actually got one of the Durston benches, um, and it's just what the, I don't know. A, a wing nut is it? It looks like a clamp, isn't it? It's a, so it's clamped onto your desk, and then you put the base. You put the Yes, yeah, so that's the clamp, and then yeah. you pop this on the top, which actually holds all the mandrels in position. Secures it all into position. I can't tell you, it's, it's really heavy. Let's bring the price to air as soon as we can. Um, again, so 399, we're sort of in the same sort of parameters as, uh, as Cooks and Gold um, for their tool. Again, you have everything that you actually need. Don't be surprised if there's like an oily residue. Um, that basically looks after your yes, tool, yeah. prevents it from rusting. It's like a WD-40 product, isn't it? That just yeah. keeps it all um, going properly. Oil is yeah, steel's oil. friend. It is, yes. It's steel's friend. And when you actually, so may, maybe this has been shipped on water, I don't know, then you want to actually, uh, to actually prevent it from rusting, clearly, because that will obviously damage the tool itself. Now, this is actually available on your five split payments as well. So you can bite the, uh, uh, get hold of this on in bite-sized chunks, if you like. Working with it, literally, in five months' time, you know, you can, you can be working with this. Pay it off in bite-sized chunks. £299. £59.80 on your split payments. That's a lot less, isn't it, than... A lot less. Ones, yeah. A lot, lot less. And, and self-explanatory. Certain tools, Mark, I find quite intimidating. I don't know. Um... Do you remember we did a long time ago? We had um, a jump ring maker with a saw. Yes. That scared me. Yeah. And I've got, I bought it and I've got it at home. It's still in its packaging because it, it just, you know, it's just a bit daunting. Yeah. But I think I think you just need to, to get it home <coughs> and have a play and have a go. So but can, tools so. like this, I don't find too scary because no. it's really straightforward. You've actually only got a couple of different components yeah. here, haven't you, to put together? Yeah. So I think. Even without an instruction manual, you could figure out how to put it, how to set it up. I like the fact that you, that you set it up and you leave it on your desk. I yeah. Think, I think um, I like tools like that. Yeah, you me too. Set up once. You can actually go back to it yeah. and then uh, and never actually move it if you don't want to. Straight away collectors getting involved. Well done to each and every single one of you. There, we only had 65 and we have got collectors getting involved as well. Um, we're at £299, but do you think we're stopping there? <gasps> really? No, this is your deal of the day. Hang on. The demo with Claire is coming. It is coming, I promise. Big oh price God. crash coming your way. Over £300 um, on Cooks and Gold for a slightly different variety. £199 for you this morning. <laughs> £199. Again, it's, it, it's a tool that you're never really going to need to replace if you never. look after it. No, no, it's amazing. 
£199 or, or under £40 on your split payments as well. It is weighty, so don't be surprised when this actually lands on your, well, it won't land on your doorstep. You won't mm. want to drop something like this, I suppose. Um, but yeah, when your postman delivers it, he's going to be thinking, what on earth have you got in there? Um, it's a tool that is built to last. Again, collectors getting involved, £199 only. And, and you've got the different sizes, you've got the different gauges. As pointed out by Mark, you've also got the different shapes. It's, it says the angle, doesn't it? The angle size. We've got 90 oh, is degrees, that what it 90 is? degrees there. And what, what does that one there say? 60. 60 degrees. That's oh, brilliant. I wonder if I can yeah. tilt this forward without them all falling out. Let me have a go. Oh, here you go. Hang on. Nine, it says nine, oh, I think it. this is one of those tools that until you have one, you can't believe that you've managed without it. <laughs> yeah, probably. Yeah. One of those that actually becomes becomes a necessity yeah. to us all. Oh, and it says on the reverse of oh, those as oh, well. Brilliant. So can you see? It actually says the, the variation, the degree of the actual angle that you're going to be working with. Amazing, absolutely amazing tool. Again, a, a professional bit of kit. So much so that if ever you were to walk into like a, um, a fully fledged, I don't know, jewellery workshop or something like that, then this is the kind of thing that you would see mm. um, already set up on their station. Um, any silversmiths. We've got that program on at the moment, haven't we? Oh, um, all, the all that glitter. All that glitter. This is the kind of thing I can imagine them seeing. Um, yeah, it's a great idea. Someone's actually messaging. Can we see it on the overhead? Sure. Hang on. Ooh. That is really weighty. Very <coughs> it's very heavy. There we go. There you are. Shot. Perfect. Yes, so, so you've, got a, you've got an Allen key to do all your, your chucking, I think the technical term is. Is it? So that's your, your main... Gosh, that's amazing. That's your, that, is, that is really heavy. So that, that's your, um, your clamp that touches to your desk. Then you've got your handle, which does all your... Yeah, to, I'm assuming that that <coughs> clamps your, yeah. your tool to the desk. And then you've got your different ring sizes. So we've got from 22 down to size 12. Mm -hmm. So that, that would be your ring, your J to K's and your L to M's yes. and that sort of thing. And, then, and as we pointed out, if you wanted to do right angles, you've got a 90 degree mandrel in here. And then we've also got a 60 degree there. That's so great. could I do things like jump rings with this I would have thought as well? So. Yeah, I would have thought I so. I guess Cause, so. Cause you got, I think it looks about an inch, doesn't it? <coughs> do multiple jump rings you could do. What? Mm. Um, 16. That's fantastic. 18, sorry, what was that, Ollie? 22. Okay. Um, we're gonna, we are going even lower. Apologies, we're having real issues with the actual uh, um, audio. Um, audio of the video. I think we can still play it. Can we play it? Mm. <coughs> no, that's gone okay, typically. Um, either way, we will come, we'll, we'll find a way. We'll either upload it to social media or something like that. We'll upload it to YouTube, oh, yes, yes. so you can always reference it as well. Apologies, we're having real issues with that. Have a little look at our YouTube channel, and we'll keep an eye on Facebook, and I'm sure we can put it on there as well. We are um, we're, we're clicking away, meaning we're going even lower. So what was our closest price point that we found elsewhere? Or at, at our... 255, isn't it? I think. 255 pounds. Mm. There or thereabouts, there's different variations, but again, we will always endeavour um, to beat our competitors uh, um, where possible. It's not always possible, but we'll endeavour to. I can't believe we're going lower. I know, that. I know. I mean, we were showing, it's a totally separate tool, but Ross and I were showing a tool the other day, and the postage of that tool was £40. Mm. Do you remember that, Ross? Just the postage. And again, it was weighty, much like this. Probably not as weighty as what we're showing right now. We had 65 of them. Oh, no, another £149. Pounds. Pounds. We can't go a single penny lower than this. Every single wow. penny, every si that's an apology deal, really, um, on, the ba on the back of the fact that we have, uh, that we, we basically can't play the audio, we can't play the video, but we will upload it to YouTube, we will rectify it. We've got plenty of technical people working behind the scenes that'll be able to sort that out for you, but um, right now for the live show, not possible, but keep an eye on those YouTube channels. And again, any questions, remember lovely Claire, she's always very hands-on, bless her heart, so um, uh, speak to Claire or, or Debbie as well, she's another one of our lovely designers that works quite frequently with silver um silver work i think claire would be sort of the obvious choice i suppose mm. when it comes mm. to rings because she does make a lot no, of them doesn't she yeah 
£29.80, pence, Mark. That's five-way split pay, is it? You yeah. You have five-way very often. Not often. I think it should have been higher than £149 for it to be a five-way <laughs> split pay. But there we go. Again, a little bit of a, a bit of an apology deal for you all. Um, so what you can see there is uh, with, with Claire actually sort of working away, she's, there's, there's a little slot for it all, mm. so it's all going to sit in its place nice and tidily. Well done, everybody. We had 65. We don't have that quantity anymore. Still got loads to bring you as well within the course of um, today's show. Just, yeah. It's self-explanatory. Certain tools, if, 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 if I have to use my brain too much to use them, then I, that's it. I back away. For example, I'm still quite a little bit scared of the Dremel. I've not got a Dremel. I've got a Dremel. I will admit, I actually bought my Dremel for DIY purposes and then took a big chunk out my banister with it. So I was... Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, um, so I don't know, I'm still a little bit scared of it because it's not that easy to put together, or at least it's probably mm. something I'm actually mm. doing. Whereas that looks like it literally just attaches to the desk and away you and go. And away you go, yeah. Away you go. But again, this will be uploaded to YouTube. Well done. Lynn, Bill, Lanarkshire, Janice, Trisha, Janet, Patricia, Zoe, Christine, new customer, Lynn, hello to you. Cumbria, I can see you there. You do The, the call screen's gone on a, on, on a funny kilk as well, so I can't see all of your names, but I know you are there. I'll leave it with you. Apologies once again um, for the technical issues. Again, um, we, we will definitely upload that video for you to the YouTube channel so you can actually watch it back. Well done, well done, well done. We've still got beautiful, beautiful grand digirites still to come. We've still got last of stock opportunities um, in your type A jade. But last of stock, Herkimer Quartz. Um, I, I'm obsessed with this gemstone, and believe it or not, our sister channels never had it on there. So screens. I heard, yeah. So when I had a meeting almost two years ago, and I mentioned when after I was being invited to, I'd been invited to go to Tucson. I said I want to bring Herkimer, um, Herkimer Quartz, and that, and they went what? Herkimer Diamonds? No, what? Never They've heard never of had it. it on the show. No, um, which really surprised me. It's a fascinating gemstone that is actually doubly terminated. I mean, literally, it looks like this. On the ground, it literally looks like this. Double terminated um, and was discovered. It's one of the few gemstones that's actually discovered and mined in New York City. <laughs> I, I, it doesn't it, make sense. It does doesn't. It? No, no, it doesn't. No. Herkimer diamonds are not actually diamonds at all, and they're sometimes referred yes, to as right. diamonds, I and it's obvious to see yes. why. Uh, they are a form of double terminated quartz crystals that began forming 500 million years ago in a dolomite outcrop throughout Herkimer County, New Year, and the Mohawk River Valley. These crystals uh, were discovered in the 18th century and given the diamond nickname because of their exceptional clarity and natural faceting. Herkimers can be exceptionally clear and colourless, or they can be included with air bubbles or flecks of black carbon. If you are lucky, you will come across a stone with an enhydro inclusion, a bubble of water that was trapped in the crystal during its formations. And we're just showing a couple of little pictures here of that double termination. I mean, they can be quite elongated. They can be oh. um, a little bit more sort of, sort of square, I suppose. But there they are with those little black inclusions. And that's classic Herkimer, isn't it? That's yeah. what we expect. It was, for me, it was quite a monochrome-like gemstone because you expected there to be inclusions within. In actual fact, it can be, like diamonds, completely and utterly colourless. And there are a few jewellers that actually work with Herkimer, uh, Herkimer Quartz. Um, and I wanted to showcase a couple of those. This one really jumped out at me. Shards of Herkimer diamonds, uh, which is a type of clear quartz, are clustered together in this large, linear, invisible ring to create a bohemian opulence. The stones are set with warm-toned 18-carat yellow gold. Can we highlight the fact that it is set in 18-carat yellow gold? They are more frequently referred to as Herkimer diamonds than they are as Herkimer quartz. Take a little look as well at pieces like this. Look at the colour of the, di uh, the Herkimer quartz. It's big, but it's very dark. I can't see any faceting either. Very included. No, no. Yes. Little silver ring, £35 in the sale. It's nice. What about those? Could you make those? Mm -hmm. 
65 pounds with sterling silver and there's two two Herkimer court stones the next one a millionaire question mark indulgence of Herkimer diamonds courts for only 60 pounds one two three four five five stones and if they were diamonds then yes they probably would be quite expensive can I just yeah. say this is the level of quality that I'm about to show you Without a doubt. from Netta Porter you can get a 14 karat gold Herkimer diamond bracelet Herkimer quartz Herkimer diamonds do you notice they more advertise it as diamonds oh, <laughs> 380 pounds there's very 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 few um, inclusions within that net within that uh, um, bracelet remember that price point now do you want to see yours this is why I say, and I had the privilege and pleasure of launching this strand. Scott, do you remember, Ross? Scott came down into the studio going, I remember this, I saw it over in, uh, over in India. It literally got our attention. They walked into the room filled with various different gemstone strands and this is the one they spotted. There is some negative news. 60 chances remain. Out of the 250 that we originally launched, it's been on that once and that once only. It was our early bird. And we were saying, gosh, this is like that Zircon strand, the best that we've ever seen. Well, Carol and I launched Herkimer on the Kylie and Jason show when yes. she left for maternity with Hattie. And the quality was nothing like we've got here today. No. This, is just, this is just incredible. It's, uh, it's, it's exceptional. Yeah. It's the purest clarity. I'm just, I'm just fascinated that Mother Nature has done her own faceting. It's not been touched nope. by human hand. It's just been drilled, maybe a bit of polishing. But as far as all these facets go, it's completely... That's what I can't get to And it's with. doubly it's, terminated yeah, as amazing. well. So you get that. You get yeah. almost like a pavilion at both sides. Both ends, yeah. It's incredible. Completely and utterly natural. I wish I had more. That is the only downside. They flew out when we first launched it. It's the second time airing. It's the best Herkimer that we've ever seen. It, again, no big inclusions within the, each and every single one of these stones, which I like. I Don't get me wrong. I do like it when they have the monochrome. But ultimately, that Netta Porter um, bracelet that we showed you a few moments ago for £380, which you could so easily remake, that's the kind of price tag I would expect for quality like this. We've got the final few. Do you know... This is a bridal piece. Perfect, isn't oh. it? Perfect. Yeah, winter bride, imagine. Imagine these in earrings. Nobody would think that they were quartz. They would absolutely assume they were, they were sort of rough diamonds. But even then, rough diamonds wouldn't look like this. No. They'd <laughs> no, have they to wouldn't. be fogged. No, no, They'd no, have no, to they be wouldn't. faceted. Yes. Yeah. Remember that one single uh, Herkimer quartz ring? <coughs> Excuse me, heavily included? £43.50? In the sale, thirty-four pounds and eighty pence. Twenty-five carats, the best we've ever seen. Hello, Amanda. Morning, L, Mark, and team. Morning. I have this strand, and it is incredible. So clear. I might have to buy another. Do you know, like you, Amanda, I bought it that first uh, on that first launch, and like you, I think I have to buy another as well. I haven't done anything with it as of yet. This with the pearls that we had earlier on. Yeah or the pearls that you have in your stash. It's going to be an on-screen sellout. I don't think this is going to get a third airing. £29.99 pence only. This was some of your finest quality uh, uh, pearls. This along something like, I don't know, maybe your pure white natural type AJ dye. Imagine those together. Oh my goodness me. What? Is that what we did, Ross? <laughs> so do you agree the best best without a doubt, best without the course we've ever seen without a doubt incredible quality 60 60 chances remain remember that bracelet 380 pounds okay it's got a gold clasp on there you could soon acquire one of those that's not gonna be 350 pound though is it for the clasp no do you have thought no probably i don't know 20 mm. Yeah. Hello, Angela. Morning, all. I have this strand too. Held it up to the sunshine oh. and it had a glitter ball reflection. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Thank you for messaging in. 
you will not be disappointed with the strand. If you value my, my recommendation, absolutely buy this. It's beautiful. I love the fact that they'll sit flat on the wrist. Yes. Won't they? So it'll be really comfortable to wear as well, I would imagine. We're at a pound per... Wait, so this is from <laughs> New York City. From the original location that it was discovered. It's like the skyline, isn't it? Yes, it is, yes. <laughs> it's like the skyline of New, of New York. Yeah, Herkimer, the, the Herkimer Mines, yeah. call them Herkimer Diamonds as opposed to Herkimer There's a picture of it that we saw the other day of, of the entrance and it looks like Jurassic World. It looks amazing. <laughs> a pound per carat for this level of flawless clarity. It's not been polished. It's not been faceted. This is all Mother Nature's doing. Rough diamonds don't look like this. I wish we had more. I wish we had 200, 300 of these. We did not even stop at a pound per carat. Shall we honour uh, honor once again? <laughs> once again. Your early bird deal. There it is. There's the yeah. entrance to the mine. Herkimer Diamonds mine. There it is. I'd like to go there, I think. It looks ace. It looks really cool. <coughs> Have a little picnic. Yeah. Is that what these people are doing? They're literally searching for Herkimer Diamonds. Yeah. You could go and mine dim uh, Herkimer diamonds. And they have a competition where um, if you have a group that go, they, they get given a pan and they pan for it. And whoever br who br brings up the biggest carrot weight gets a prize. Do they get to keep the Herkimer diamonds? No, they have to give, no, they give, they give, they give, the, they give the diamond to the firm, but they get given a prize. Okay, it's I hope it's a good prize. Of, of panning for We're not even stopping there, there Mark. Uh, uh, these photos are new to me, so that's amazing. Yeah, Absolutely lovely. amazing. It's cool, it's so cool. Look at the photograph on their billboard as well. Yeah. Yeah. These are, they haven't been faceted by man. They haven't been cut on a diamond a spinning wheel. Looks like the James Bond diamond spill, doesn't it? It does. <laughs> yeah, that one, yeah. where they start, yeah. 26 of oh, these no. remain. And, and, and if you disagree with anything that I've said, Mark has said today, then do send them back because I will absolutely take them off your hands. That is so beautiful. I'd happily buy these. I, I bought them the first time round. I'm probably going to miss out this occasion. They are just beautiful. Herkimer Quartz has always been that monochrome gemstone to me with beautiful clarity, and I love it with those inclusions, but this is pristine. Hello, Derbyshire saying, um, it costs more than that to go digging at the mine uh, for a day with no guarantee of finding yeah. it. Yeah. Good point. Good point. And you don't get to keep it. Yeah. That's, no, why, I, no. that's why I was like, well, you don't no, get to keep no, your no. own. No, no. So basically, you, you dig for the company and then you get a prize at the end if you. I mean, they've the got that thing. sorted, haven't there's, they? There's the, uh, the sorting building. There's, no. do, do you see the no. word quartz? No. They highlight, they dwell on the diamond the beauty of the diamond, don't oh they? Gosh. Technically, gemologically, it is a quartz. But visually, well they so You bought diamonds. this originally, yeah. so you've got a strand. Yeah. So you've not missed out. No. You've, you've got, all right, that's, that's good. I haven't done anything with it yet. That's have you good. got this? Uh, I have. Yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Now, maybe yeah. you were watching that and you were thinking, Elle, I prefer the inclusions. See, I'm a massive inclusion fan. But I think I think they work. I think they work both beautifully together. These two. It's still yeah, got yeah, the yeah. fire. It's still my, my, got my, the scintillation. One of my favourite gemstones is Rutile quartz. Yeah. And this this reminds me of it somewhat. But this is more sort of dotty. It's just very subtle. It's Rutile quartz and yeah. then some, isn't yes. it? Because you've got you have got those little air mm. bubbles yeah. that give you that yeah. spectrum of colour. Oh look. Should we do a closeout deal? Uh, uh, and this is how I, how up until that strand, oh, yeah. I always knew Herkimer Quartz. I love this. Carbon, yes. Um, can we go back to the beginning? So Herkimer diamonds are not actually diamonds at all. They are formed from uh, double terminated quartz crystals that began forming 500 yeah. million years ago in a dolomite outcrop throughout Herkimer County. The crystals were discovered in the 18th century and given the diamond nickname because of their exceptional clarity and natural faceting. 
Herkimers can be exceptionally clear and, or col and colourless, or they can be included with air bubbles or flecks of black carbon. So diamonds. It's in effect diamonds, yeah. So you've got diamonds in it. That's <laughs> it. It's diamonds. mad. It's just yeah. mad. If you're lucky, you'll come across a stone. Oh, sorry. Oh, uh, come across a stone with an N-hydro inclusion, which is that little bubble, oh. um, a bubble of water. That will give you the spectrum of colour. So not only will you get scintillation and fire, if you get a bubble, you'll actually get a sort of uh, an amplified um, uh, scintillation of colour as well. Oh. Should we do a close-out deal on Herkimer Quartz? I love it. It's, uh, yeah, the carbon... It's carbon that gives you those black colours. The sole ingredient that makes diamonds. Let's match the previous auction price. <laughs> it's actually a bigger carat weight. You can see those wonderful double terminations. That occurs naturally. It's cool. It's cool. Do you know, this is this. And the spacers, yeah. This, I'd make for Tom would like this. No, I think he would as well. Yeah, yeah. One as a single solitaire ring. We're not stopping here, Mark. So how much was that ring earlier on? £35 for one single solitaire with the little black inclusions. Very similar, actually, in colour to each and every single one, a solitaire. Shall we do a close-out deal? 30 carats, natural certified. Herkimer Court. I need to see you there, though, to justify this. Did you say we have just over 100? Amazing. On this PowerPoint, there's, um, there's a picture of Adele that, I, that we've just skimmed through. I saw it a moment ago. And it was the um, interview she did with Oprah when she did her comeback. And she's wearing Herkimer Quartz earrings. You can't really see them, but they're Herkimer Quartz earrings. Yeah. Wow. I mean, she looks yeah. gorgeous, doesn't she? Yeah. She's so beautiful, Adele. Mm. <coughs> yeah, you, and rough, yeah. rough gemstones, Absolutely. you know. Yeah. Herkimer Quartz is like the ultimate rough gemstone because it doesn't need a polish. No, it doesn't need no. a facet. It's literally, literally Mother Nature is, uh, you know, is, is solely, solely, solely to blame for the beauty, uh, not blame, to credit no. for the beauty of these. Not even £9.99. pence. Oh, well, yeah, they are whoppers, <laughs> aren't they? Yeah. Absolute whoppers. I looked at I looked what? at Adele there looking all beautiful and then it literally came back to, to, to you and I, Mark, looking <laughs> <laughs> We're far more beautiful than Adele. Yes, Adele. <laughs> Have a day off. <laughs> Seven ninety-nine only. <laughs> Absolutely stunning, aren't they? Stunning, stunning, stunning. I would be multi-buying on this as well. And I'd be tempted to use this with something like black onyx mm. or black yeah, spinel, absolutely. pearls, as we said earlier on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Oprah. You all right? <gasps> uh, what was that question again? I'll say it again. I'll say it again, yeah? No? £7.99 only. Jacqueline, if you want those five. Julia, if you want those four. Um, do stay where you are. Beautiful monochrome. Natural Herkimer Court. Absolute closeout deal. Congratulations to each and every single one of you. Now, um, I need to show you something that's coming up a little bit later on within the show. We've still got loads to squeeze in between now and the top of the hour. At about 11 o'clock, I'm going to bring you this oh, beautiful, no. beautiful, natural type A Burmese jadeite haigu. Um, and also, I want to give you a little bit of a heads up because on Sunday, Ross, you're not with us Sunday, are you? Are you? Now, I am reminding you because you're missing out on some of the best diamonds. No, not some of the best diamonds. Diamonds? Talk, diamonds. I've seen diamonds, of diamonds for ages. Honestly, they're the best I've seen. Wow. That will go beautifully with your type A haigu. Right. That would also go beautifully with your red jadeite that's coming up tomorrow. Ollie and I were discussing the red jadeite tomorrow, and it is literally pillar box red. Unreal. 30. 13 mil red. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Unreal. Absolutely unreal. 
But uh, yeah, but this haiku, we'll do it at 11 o'clock today. We will bring you round brilliant cuts that you could sit in there on Sunday. Oh my goodness me. Now, shall we do what we're doing the white jade? Mm. On this green, green jadeite, on the haiku, which is an 18 mil, type A, completely natural. I'm not saying Under that. what? I'm not saying that. How many do we have? I'm not saying that. Is it on pre-order? <sighs> I'll say it. I'll say it very quickly to our lovely viewers. We're going to take, yes, type A, totally natural. A high goo, one of the most symbolic of shapes. Beautiful translucency. We're going to take it under £20. <laughs> yeah, a price of a palm stone, effectively. Not, not, not jadeite, not in a high goo, not in type A. It's just mad, absolutely mad. It's coming up and you can shop ahead and pre-order on that. <coughs> Excuse me. Now, we have wow. the largest strand of natural type A jade coming up now. Um, Dan, gorgeous Dan, please can I borrow um, a black bust? Or white, actually, it doesn't. Black, probably better. That's amazing. This is pure linen white, isn't it? And that's, mm -hmm. you know, Susie, guest designer Susie's a massive fan of jade. I, obviously, it's part of the, her family's DNA, really. I, you know, she's grown up with this gemstone. Um, <clears throat> and white is the colour that she favours the most. Um, but whether you whether you know you follow Susie's recommendations, whether you listen to um, wonderful Dave, whether or, or Jake Thompson, any of our gem, uh, gem investors, this is a gentleman you should absolutely listen to. Because when myself and my fellow colleagues all do our GIA accreditation, our then founder Steve Bennett handed us a book. This book is weighty. And it is, I'll be honest, it's heavy reading. It's heavy reading. The book I'm talking about is Secrets of the Gem Trade. You've probably seen it. Mm. I know, uh, I know uh, Jake has referenced it. And it's written by Richard W. Wise. Now, Richard W. Wise is really the, uh, he's the pinnacle. He's the pillar head in the gemstone world. If you want to know anything about any gemstone, Richard Wise would be the person mm. that you would go to, ultimately. And he said about jade, in modern connoisseurship, a jadeite jade cabochon of a pure white hue with a fine texture and a moderate translucency would be the finest of its type. So let's say that again. In modern connoisseurship, a jadeite jade, cabochon, whatever the cut, I don't think that really matters, of a pure white hue with a fine texture and moderate translucency would be considered the finest of its type. Not imperial. He's talking about pure white jade. So if we take his recommendation which I definitely think anybody, anybody that knows anything about gemstones, anybody that uh, aspires to know anything about gemstones, Richard Wise would be the person that you would, you should gravitate towards. Whilst you admire the larger strand of natural type, and these aren't bleached, natural type A, they're huge, absolutely huge. I'm going to read Richard Wise's words once more. There are 17 available in the world. In modern connoisseurship, a jadeite jade of pure white hue with a fine texture and a moderate translucency would be the finest of its type. Do you see a pure white hue? That's amazing. Have a little look. It's amazing, isn't it? Yeah, completely 
You would almost or assume stuck. that that had been bleached. It's not bleached. It's natural. Take a little look. Here's a strand of jade, whether it's jadeite, whether it's nephrite. £5,000. Jadeite is considered considerably rarer and considerably more expensive. Check this out. Look at the price. Look at the price. And it's nephrite. Jadeite, nephrite's older. No, jade, uh, nephrite is old. It's called what we call the mm. original jade. But jadeite is rarer. Okay. I want some more. I want some more recommendations. Let's go back, right back to 1388. Wang Sao said on examining jades, one should regard those white in colour as the best. Yours is, and I'll say it again, a pure linen white colour, completely and utterly natural. And these are hands down the biggest mm. rounds that we have ever, ever brought to air. It's strange it? because the for, the for diamonds example, you have your white diamonds, your clear diamonds, but the fancy diamonds, the colour diamonds are the more valuable. But in jade and jadeite, it's the other way around. Other way around. It's strange, isn't it? It's beautiful. I wish we had more, Mark. The, uh, the graphics are about to appear. 17, first come, first serve. 525 carats. Ooh. First one of these have gone, well done. You've got two, congratulations to you. 12 mil, look at that. It's beautifully pure white, isn't it? That's why I always describe it as like a linen white. You know, that crisp, pure white. There's no, there's no sort of off color. There's no sort of creaminess to this. It's pure white. I'm gonna count the solitaires. Everyone has multi-bought so far. I don't blame you. I, if, if, if you've got the budget to do so, then absolutely, absolutely do that. I'm just gonna place it on the desk for a second because these are standalone solitaires. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 29. 29 solitaire. Look at each and every single one of them. We don't actually have any white gemstones, do we, really? White Not agates, pure. white agate to the push, white onyx. That's true. That's about it, really. We're, we're always asked for white gemstones. We can do lots of clear, but it's, it's really difficult to find white gemstones. And look how pure that white is. That's beautiful. Absolutely amazing. Goodness me, if we were to stop here at £1,299, that is absolutely bonkers. There was 29 on the strand. That's already less than 50 pounds per round. Each stone is just over 18 oh. carats. 18 carat solitaires. On examining jades, one should regard those white in color as the best. Oh, amazing. All day long, we could stop here. That's £20 per stone. We're not done. <laughs> Ross, what are you taking it to? Really? <gasps> what? The largest strand of white jade that we have, po quite probably ever will have. We'll be able to bring it to you in type B and C. <laughs> True. Oh my lord! Try and find an eighteen carat white gold, uh, white jade, type A white jade, solitaire. See if you can make a com if you can find that. Unlikely. It is unlikely. Two hundred and forty nine wow. pounds. You can get this home for sixty two twenty five on uh, on your split pay. <coughs> And don't be surprised if you see things like, look, I'm gonna show you a few lots. They don't specify whether it's jade or whether it's nephrite. 
Uh, again, jadeite is actually uh, more expensive, more, uh, more, more valuable, which is exactly what you're getting. But look at this. Price realized, US dollars, 116,000. Price realized, 68,500. Price realized, 37,500. And one of the, it actually says greenish. Yes, yes. Yeah. Some of those. You're getting 29, 18 carat solitaires. We've half that price tag. Fifth, no. What? The mm. most yeah. expensive, that's yes. a good point, yes. Ollie's just yeah. said. Have a little look on this. Which one, which one's the most expensive? The one on the far left, why do you think it's the most expensive? It doesn't work, mention the word greenish. It's, it's pure white. Pure white, yes. It is pure white. Oh, I love the grey. Oh, yeah. We're going even lower. Amazing, amazing collectors and connoisseurs. We're going lower. And they are, up. we're over allocated already. Remember Richard Wise's words, in modern connoisseurship, a jadeite jade of pure white hue with a fine texture and moderate translucency would be the finest of its type. You have that here. And they are enormous. Remember how your fancy colored jadeite actually forms. Remember the bulk of a boulder will actually uh, um, include your green colors, beautiful. But the, the finest, the skin of the boulder will have your fancies, which is your reds, your whites, your honey colours, your russet tones, your lavenders. I do advise you check out sooner rather than later because this will sell out. Sonia, Margaret, North Yorkshire, Virginia and Rupal, well done. People multi-buying straight away. I only had 19. <coughs> Excuse me. They're huge though, aren't they? That's yeah. Huge. 29, that's crazy. Another 100 pound off. Just yeah, like that, that is crazy. If these We've don't sell the out, pose. I'll be grabbing these. Yeah, we've still got the split pose. <coughs> We're so blasé. Yeah, yeah. We're blasé about jadeite full stop, aren't we? And listen, we're, we're guilty of it here in the studio as well because we're like, oh, jadeite. You know, we've got used to it being on our screens as well. We are so blasé. In the jewellers that I worked at when I was in my early 20s, they had one single piece of jade. One single piece. And it was awful. It was really ugly in terms of its, in terms of its carving. It even, wasn't even a finished piece of jewellery. It was like a, a kind of like a, a slab, I suppose. Wasn't anywhere near the quality of colour that we offer you, and it was two and a half thousand pounds. I'm going back about 25 years ago now. You can get hold of the rarest colour with beautiful. Do you want to see that? Do you want to see the translucency? Can we do that? Has any? I mean, these are big stones. Dan, have you? Can I borrow your mobile phone? I'm down to the final five. North Yorkshire's got two. Teresa, uh, Lanarkshire, Kath, Suja, Denise. Yeah, I just need to call my husband a minute just to make sure that he's buying these. That's I had some. Can you imagine if he's tuned in right now? Don't miss out. These are the people that need to check out their baskets. You're competing against one another, literally for the final four opportunities. A maker wants six at the bottom of the screens. If you want those six, well, actually, it's not possible. It's not possible. You can still do it, but you have to be uh, sooner rather than later. In modern connoisseurship, a jadeite jade cabochons of pure white hue with a fine texture, a moderate translucency would be the finest of its type. I don't know if we can dim the lights and maybe get a little bit romantic here in the studio. It's funny to say that looking like this, isn't it? But, ready? Oh, look. There's that translucency. Look at that translucency. That's incredible. The light is not blocked. It glows through, doesn't it? Absolutely amazing, amazing translucency. It looks like so, an eclipse, doesn't it? It does. It's beautiful. £149. Silly. That is a mad price. This is, this is the Bonhams and the Sotheby's of the future, isn't it? Mm. Completely, completely. If you're in a position to do so and you're able to multi-buy, and I can see a couple of you actually have done, 
If you are in a position to do so, do multi-buy. And I would absolutely say put it alongside something like, I don't know, um, a, a high-end precious metal clasp. And approach the likes of Bottoms. They are actually uh, recruiting for, for, for pieces to auction. This is, yeah, they've got a PR marketing campaign. Mark, do it. You need to do it. <laughs> Imagine sending this to Bonham saying, I've got a natural type A, pure white jadeite. They're 12 mil rounds. Do you think they're going to ask £149 for it? Absolutely not. The final one, Angela, Jamati, Penny, Yorkshire, Teresa, Lanarkshire, Kath, new customer, Durham, Denise, Valentina, Elaine, Sonia, Margaret, uh, Virginia and Rupal. That's working out of what each? About £5 per individual solitaire. Mad. Mad, mad. 17 of you have that final one. I want to say congratulations. I don't want to leave one there. I want to be able to say well done. I want to be able to congratulate you because it is absolutely beautiful. Amazing, amazing, amazing. amazing. White Jade. If, if the likes of Richard Wise has spoken about it and said, in modern connoisseurship, Jadeite, uh, a jade out of pure white hue, fine texture, moderate translucency, would be considered the finest of its time. That doesn't seem affordable, no. does it? Gosh. Should we give everybody a chance, regardless of budget, the opportunity to own pure white jade? The first price crash how many do we have for, uh, sorry? <coughs> we have 110, but I guarantee, he says, that quantity will jump on the phone lines, even with the first price crash. We're going to open the auction in three, in two, in one. I'm not ready. What are you, gonna, what are you doing? What, what do you think he's going to do with this? I don't know. I've got a suspicion. Got a suspicion. You have those beautiful little rivers of colours running through. Russet tones. Remember the whitish. Remember. And lavender is often actually more of a whitish colour with a hint of lavender and vice versa. So here we go. Here we go. Here's that greenish white. Still classed as white. I've got 110 opportunities. The phone lines are going to go into absolute meltdown on the first price crash. You've got your lovely little drill hole at the top there that you could literally just, I don't know, macrame, lark's head knot. Yeah, jump ring and pop a chain through or a cord. What? Cord. It's not your price. I, I, these need to sell out, though. Can you imagine actually gifting jadeite in, in one of the rarest, most valuable colours? Can you, this is a gemstone in Chinese history they believe is protective. <coughs> no. Ollie's what? just said, I know the price of this, and it's a key ring price. It's genuine type A jade, not type B or type C. I watched, I watched a, certain, uh, a certain shopping channel a while ago. Uh, no. Um, <coughs> not our sister channel. Um, and... They were auctioning jade. Firstly, they mentioned jade. They didn't say they didn't say it was jadeite or nephrite. They didn't they didn't stipulate. So that straight away makes me question whether it is either of those things. Also, it was dyed beyond all rec recognition. It was neon, so much so. Oh the beads around our neck were similar in its mm. colour. This is not dyed. Certified completely and utterly natural. Shall we give everybody the opportunity to own the rarity that is Burmese jadeite? It's, it is nuts. You're right, it's nuts. It is nuts. You could put that, a key ring, yeah. That's a great idea. A gemstone, if you... Susie is saying everybody in her family has to, has to, has to, um, or she gets given jade because it's protective. Right. You know, you could literally just do a lark's head knot. That's it. Bit yeah. of macrame. Cool gift. I bet, Ollie, you'd wear this, wouldn't you? You do wear it. Would you wear this, Mark? I would. I would. Yeah. Yes. 
Absolutely. It's just cool, isn't it? Tom would wear this. My, my other Is it heavy? Wear. I mean, would you, would you wear it as an earring? You could do. Oh, yeah, you could, that, you'd be able to do that as an earring. Two earrings. You could turn it into a cocktail. At that price yes. tag, give it a whirl. So I would bead bezel around that, which would then disguise the hole and yeah. make the most amazing brooch or part of a necklace drop. <coughs> amazing! So amazing isn't it? You know, at the end of the day, please, please know that £12.99 yeah. is no reflection of the true value or worse, not when we're talking of a gemstone as rare as this. But that's a great idea. You can yeah. see that really beautiful, so, so we call it a waxy surface luster. It is totally and utterly natural. I love it. You know, you, even sort of, even sort of the, the, the younger children that you might have in your family, I wouldn't want to give Willow some certain gemstones as of yet because she doesn't quite look after them as of yet. No. Whereas something like this, I would trust her with. And hopefully it could be that education. You won't believe this. What amazing shape. Also, can I be quite unconventional and show you this direction first? It's half drilled. Oh, for your pegs. Can you see that? Half drilled, <laughs> pure white. Who wants this shape. under ten pounds? It's lovely, Never isn't it? Have you seen this shape before? Yeah. Very nineteen twenties. Yes. Makes me want to say Richard Wise's words again: pure white mm. hue. It is literally, yeah, pure white hue, fine texture, moderate translucency. Uh, we will always, you know, as long as I, we have type A, natural white jade I, here, we will always say this quote. Because there is no other person, really, in my opinion, mm. that has, is more qualified. Is he still with us, this chap? I believe so. Mm, right. I believe so. Because there have been edits to, to secrets of uh, the gem trade. We're going to take this to a single figure price tag. I mean, madness. It's half drilled. They've been made with beautiful earrings, maybe with a perfect pearl at the top there, or maybe one of the whites that we had a few moments ago. How about with some absolutely beautiful, uh, um, uh, those beautiful purple <laughs> pearls that we saw earlier on? Single figure price tag. I love, I'm, I'm so proud to work for Jewelry Maker, I really, really am, but there's certain times where I go, oh no, here's me <laughs> talking about one of the world's most valuable gemstones. Do you ever think if Bonhams were to tune in right now and they'd be like, who are these clowns? <laughs> who are these clowns? <laughs> you and me with me, you and me. Yeah, yeah. As in us, yeah. yeah, looking like this, talking about one of the mm. world's most valuable yeah. gemstones. Yeah. We should be in, in um, white tie, really, shouldn't we, selling Jada? Yeah, with gloves. Yeah. So you, flicked, yeah, you flicked through a photograph a few moments ago, uh, um, Ross, and it showed, I think it was the head of jewellery. There we go. Look at him. Oh. That's how we should be dressed every day <laughs> on the channel, isn't it, really? Look at him. What does it say? Unfortunately, despite its rarity, top quality Jada is still grossly undervalued. Um... Mm. Just think, <laughs> do you think he's heading that in our direction? Quite possibly. Look at him. Hi guys, is there any chance you can not sell yeah. your Type A jadeite for a single figure price tag? It's ludicrous. But you know what, lovely jewelry makers, long may that continue because that means that you're sourcing some of the most valuable gemstones at affordable and achievable prices. Stock up on it though whilst you get the chance and never get blasé. Never ever get blasé. David, Andrea, Chantal, Gary, Jane, Valerie, Susan, London, Helena, uh, Cheryl, Alison, Sonia, Manchester, you're there as well. Elaine, stay where you are. Stay where you are on those phone lines. Now, this is the only variety of ice jade that we have left. And this is from the house of Suju. Oh, this is the Chantilly, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. Suju is like Edar Oberstein to your cut gemstones. So, for example, if you've never heard of Edar Oberstein, it's uh, basically the capital of gemstone cutting to the world. 
It is where the likes of Glenn Lehrer, the likes of Rudy Robito went to train. So Idar uh. Oberstein is, yeah, is basically the, 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 your cut gemstone, uh, the location, the hub of the world. Suju is that two jade, pure ice jade, pure ice jade. Super limited and what some of the most skillful carving artistry <coughs> that you could ever imagine. This doesn't, this is still done. It's not done by machine, it is still done by hand. This is still polished by wet bamboo. That level of detail, that level of detail done by hand on something that is effectively wafer thin. This is yeah, east rings. meets west. They've got the <coughs> earrings, haven't they? You've got to buy two yeah. for earrings, without a doubt. You want, yeah. that, you want that light to go through, don't you? <coughs> and well, at the price that we're about to take uh, it to, you can easily right. do that. So romantic. Chantilly lace, you know, we think lace, most of us would say Chantilly, mm. won't we? Yeah, it's the finest in the world, isn't it? Finest in the world, most intricate in the world. So to actually incorporate that into a gemstone which is as tough as steel and to be able to create that beautiful delicacy, it's, it's just mind boggling. And like I said, the House of Suju, they are the ones really that have become uh, recognized for doing that. It's a seven carat solitaire carved by hand. We're going to take this to one of the lowest price points uh, uh, that you could possibly imagine. The level of detail on this is so much greater because it's wafer thin. It's much harder to sort of, I don't know, prevent it from fracturing um, when it's of millimeters thickness like this. You couldn't call it Chantilly, could you, if it was a big, thick piece? No. no. Have we got a Mo scale for jade and jadeite? And uh, I should be able to know. I should yeah. know this off the top of my head. Hang on a second. Is it seven? I want, seven. Right. I want to say right. seven, but let me That's double check hard, myself. Amazing. Hang on. That yeah, six and a half to seven. Oh, fantastic. It's quite a <coughs> stone, quite a strengthy it's a, stone. It's a, yeah. it's a strong stone. Yeah. Carved by hand. Even if we were to stop here, nothing like this has ever featured on our sister channel. It was uh, Jake Thompson who actually launched these to us here at Jewelry Maker. And I know, again, to mention Susie, she got a couple of these and has turned them into That's earrings. Right. Yeah, yeah. Love it. Of course she did, yeah. Why wouldn't she? Imagine them on tassels. Remember that pearl mm. necklace that we were yeah, showing yeah. earlier yeah. on? Yep. Yeah. Shall we take... hundred pounds off that price tag. Ha Sharon's going to have a, have a an amazing pair of earrings. Should we take a hundred pounds off? And if I tell you that we're still not done, it doesn't seem right to do this, but imagine. Don't don't zoom in on me, but. You get, <laughs> just, to, just to get an idea of scale, I, this, no, you know, this has no. to be a first time ever that somebody yeah, dressed like this has yeah. sold the rarity, <laughs> the skill, uh, the house of Suju, all of that. Can you imagine they tune in? Oh, look, they, oh, who's there? Yeah. She hasn't brushed her hair or anything. I don't like Cindy Lauper. Amazing. Amazing. Not your price tag. Beautifully skilled. I'm tilting it on a diagonal as well so you can see. It's not just about the sort of what we call piercing. Um, but, and, and that's front and reverse. So if I literally just flip it over, can you see? That's so beautiful. It's just stunning. You could, yeah, turn it into a boat, mm. uh, sort of a fan. You could turn it into... Um, almost like a, a perfect flower. Look at that. 
22 of these left. Ah, oh, £39.99. Look at it glow, literally from here. It's not light trickery. Look at it literally glowing. Oh, no. Look at that. See that water content? That's what makes it your ice jade. It's paper, paper thin. Everybody thus far has multi-bought. I'm thinking the most beautiful, beautiful pairs of earrings. You can see that lovely water translucency. London, Sharon, well done to you. Cumbria, you've got yours. Carolyn Midlothian, I can see a suite of jewellery um, on their way. Uh, County Down, hello to you, Carola, London, uh, Yorkshire, Midlothian, Susan, Irene, new customers who are there. Twos, threes and fours, we only have that quantity. And it's not something like this. We can't just go, do, 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 do. Hello, how's the Suju? <laughs> can we have a few more Chantilly? Is that all right? No, because they take years, years and years and years. I think definitely now they've seen how we're auctioning it. Mm. Oh, well, they've got, we've got two, two, two ravers from the dead. <laughs> I'm just imagining dropping some tiny little calibrated faceted rubies in the holes. Oh. Or blue diamonds or something. Or diamonds. Yeah, just That amazing, are coming up on it? Sunday. Yeah. Have you seen them? I've not seen diamonds for such a while. Diamond, uh, on Sunday, you should see the diamonds that are coming up. Okay. <coughs> we had them in the studio at one point, didn't we? Yeah, have you seen, they are absolutely incredible. You, uh, that's a great idea, yeah. putting those diamonds I in here. Beautiful. The final five opportunities. Carol Virgin, hello to Yorkshire. Um, well done to you. Moira, Edith, you've got yours. Angus, Cumbria, congratulations to you. Uh, multi buyers getting involved new customers well done to you final four opportunities love 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 your chantilly carvings again three that's it that's all we have left and it's never going to be something that we're uh, able to get a huge quantity of wow. if you want to grab those final two then you can do but if there is uh, well direct um competition between you all i don't think you need to be the most skillful of jewelry makers either just literally open and close a jump ring on mm. there yes that's right now, close out deal. Oh, yes. We You've did already say told the viewers loud. the price, haven't I you? I did. I'd mm. forgotten about it there for a second. Dan, have we got those diamonds about? You have we got those diamonds about for Sunday? Do you uh, know? Yes, we do. Oh. You don't just want to buy other Okay. <laughs> Only because, bless him, I keep him on his toes. Oh, I see. Yes. Just imagine coming up on Sunday, it's your deal of the day. Doesn't matter if you haven't got them right there. But I'm just going to tell you a heads up that we have the most, the finest diamonds we've ever brought to air here at Jewelry Maker, bar none. Calibrated cuts. And just because, <coughs> excuse me, this is going under 20, that's no reflection of the true value. It is going under 20, and it's next. <laughs> Okay. No reflection of true value or worth. I think we all know that, don't we? <coughs> we all know that, don't we? And if you're thinking, oh, I've got jade eye, I've got a high goo, fabulous. Fabulous, fabulous, fabulous. I don't think we'll ever, ever say, I don't think you'll find anyone say in the world of gemstone collectors that understands jadeite that you can have too much. Do you think if we went to Sotheby's and said, I've got a lot of type A jadeite, is that a negative? Do you think he's going to say yes? Definitely not. Do you think if we went to Roland Schlusso, the gentleman who's written articles within In Colour magazine. Do you think if we said, I have a lot of type A natural jadeite, is that a negative? Do you think he's going to say yes? I don't think so. It was him that actually said the fifth pillar of precious gems. Jadeite, his words, was the most, thank you, in-demand gemstone of Tucson this year. Right, okay. Oh, my word. Do you see where I'm coming from? 
Imagine that diamond. And we've got different sizes. Imagine that diamond in the centre of a type A jade. That is incredible. Isn't it? I have 125 natural type A jadeites. And it is happening. It is going under £20. The high goo, one of the most symbolic. Um, look at that. Look at that lovely translucency. Oh, that You've got those beautiful, beautiful pools of impeel green as well in the darker colour. They are. This is this is how Roland Schluso actually uh, um, brought his high goos to wear. And I think there was an amethyst, wasn't it? There was a single amethyst dropped in the centre of a um, of a high goo. It was about twelve thousand pounds. I'll try and show that for you. Look at the level of translucency that we're seeing in the most in demand colour um, of your jadeite. It's all down to personal preference. Under twenty pounds, we are going to have to have to stagger this auction. Even though I verbalised it, we have to stagger the auction because otherwise we'll crash the system and melt the phone lines. Let's show you where it launched. The exact piece that you're seeing right now, type A grade, 18 millimeter round. I'm going to try something. Closed and sold very, very, very successfully at the price you're about to see. I'm just going to try something. 49.99. Yeah, that's amazing. That's amazing. The split pay is 24.99. L promised it. Under yeah. Pounds. Sorry, did I do the royal way? <laughs> did I do the royal way? <laughs> Can you see? Get the idea. I'll try and move the tweezers in a bit. Oh, look at that. You can almost visualise, can't you, that rambling, uh, a rambling diamond or a coloured gemstone mm. of choice. That's where we launched it. That's where it closed. That's where it sold very, very, very successfully in the past. That's where it's closed? Yeah. Before? Yeah. It launched at $49.99. The Haigu symbol is immensely, immensely symbolic within Chinese culture. Because the Haigu, uh, um, in years gone by, the, uh, used, the Chinese used to place this on the chest or waist of deceased loved ones. Oh. And they believed that the Haigu would give them immortality and also um, keep that communication as well, between heaven and earth. It's like a symbol of infinity. Infinity, it? just, just absolutely. A circle of life. Sometimes it's, it's engraved, sometimes it's carved, sometimes left in its sort of pure classic beauty like this. You know where this is going to. Let's take it there. How many do we have left though? 87. That means the split pay is 9.99. <laughs> <coughs> We're not meant to have split payments at 9.99, Ross. Oh, way. Here it is. Ah. Um, the high goes at the top. It's also pronounced pi, not by. It's pronounced pi. Uh, the traditional jadeite flat disc with a hole in the middle known as pi symbolizes heaven. Jadeite also translates in Chinese to heaven. Oh. So, yeah, this is one of, I mean, we've had this before. We've got this mm. emotional connection yeah. to this gemstone, haven't we? You just see it and all of a sudden it's, it, it, it has that sort of overwhelming emotion attached. We promised an under £20 deal. We are already there, but let's well and truly close out the vault. This is why I said at the beginning of the auction, even if you have jadeite already within your stash, I do. I'm not just buying it for my own personal collection. I'm buying it for, the, for my girls. I'm buying it for hopefully their children and their children's children because that window of opportunity, never truer words have been said. The window of opportunity is closing. In fact, it may well have already closed because the world has opened up once again after your pandemic. The Chinese do not want this gemstone to leave. It's their most valuable commodity, above that of gold. Are you joking? And yet we go, yes, do a close that deal <laughs> with our glow sticks. <laughs> Time AJ, yeah, close that deal, woohoo. Is there any wonder jewelers don't like us? Mm. It's closed at £49.99. And, and that's true, by the way. Certain jewelers do not like us. Really? 
They don't like, they, they, they didn't like Steve Bennett. Why? Why do you think, why don't, because Steve's lovely. Why wouldn't, why wouldn't they want, wouldn't, wouldn't they like him? Because basically, he's making something that many, many people couldn't afford previously mm. affordable yeah, now. Absolutely. It's a completely separate business model. That's precisely what Jewelry Maker is doing right now. Instead, instead of taking one and giving it to one, Going again. he took a hundred and however many and gave it to a hundred and however many. Instead of taking massive margins, he took minuscule margins. That's the whole ethos, the model. We're at 18 pounds and 35 pence. Oh, even more ridiculous than this, yeah. right? I went into a jeweler's yesterday. Um, can you imagine if I went, oh, see that lovely type A jade at Haigu there? Can I just give you nine quid today? <laughs> yeah. I promise I'll come back. Yeah. I'll pay you in a month. Yeah. Do you reckon they'd then? No. 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 I don't think I so. I think they'd escort you out of the premise. Yeah, get out. Especially looking like that. Yeah, with your, with your glow sticks and cobwebs. <laughs> No, wow. I'm definitely no Adele. <laughs> Don't see Adele dressing like this, do you? Nobody is paying nine pounds and seventeen pence on your split pay. Nobody is paying eighteen pounds thirty-five. What are, what are we doing, Ross? Seriously, this is why. Even if you've got no idea what you're going to do with it, you get it and you put it away. This is one of those that you can literally just put in, lo uh, put, put, put in a vault, put in a, a special box somewhere. It's always going to have that intrinsic value. You can thread through with a chain, yeah, absolutely. Mm. Beads, oh, leather, £17.41. pence. Miss Janet has said, yeah, I might as well get three. Amanda has just said, I might as well get five. Yeah. London, I might as well get three. Janice, I might as well get four. Lincolnshire, I get, might as well get two. Hertfordshire, two. Linda, two. Surrey, two. Durham, two, uh, four. Eight pounds seventy. You go down, you go down to London, yeah. in certain places, you'd be hard pushed to get a coffee. Mm. I would turn them, I would get two, turn them horizontal, mm. and then get a head pin and then put maybe a six millimetre gemstone either side <coughs> and just suspend them as earrings to have them horizontally sitting Ooh, flat nice. rather, rather than, than, um, that's a than great vertical. Idea. Yeah. Well, at that price, that's silly, isn't it? Like what? Oh, I know what you mean, hoppers. Yeah. I know what you mean with the bouncy with ball, ball in the board, middle. Yeah. I mean, we're, seriously, we're talking about this with type A jadeite right yeah, now. Yeah. I remember those, I could never get the hang of them. Hello to you, Miss Janet. Thank you. That's one each for my nephew and nieces. Absolutely. Oh, bless you. What a lovely idea. <coughs> my niece is a collector of gemstones. And when I said that we sold jade, she was like, pardon? She couldn't believe it. She's 16 years old. And now she owns jade. Wow. Because of jewellery maker. Unbelievable. Well done. Francis, Marion, congratulations. Marion's got four. Lincolnshire's got three. Pembroke's got three. Surrey's got three. Renfusia's got two. Um, yeah, by the way, just casually, let's have this conversation whilst we're all dressed up oh, to the nines. Gosh. Not only do we do jadeite, we do grandidurite, yeah. That's two That's of the top ten rarest gemstones. We've, we've just come back from, from Dartmoor. No, we haven't, from Dorset. Yeah. And um, um, we went to a, a stately home, and they had this huge glass cabinet full of jade little statuettes and statues and at the bottom in tiny there was a sticker on the window saying these are all copies made in soapstone and the real jade are are in a safe in a london bank i should imagine so yeah, it must be millions of millions pounds and worth. millions yeah. of pounds yeah. it's on the verge of selling out loads of well, you still well. with it in your baskets i can see you there though sharon i can see you there, new caller I can see you there, London, on the phone lines as well. Um, please do stay where you are. If you've pressed your option one, I can keep everything crossed for you and hopefully you will be successful at that absolutely crazy giveaway deal. That's the reality. And again, I've got to go back to, go back to what I was saying earlier on, that um, when I was in the jewellers back in my early 20s, we had a, 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 a single piece of jade. It was £2,500. That's 25 Ooh, wow. years ago, yeah. 
um, and it wasn't as significant in terms of the um, the history of your haigu. Well done. Still so much to bring you, lovely jewelry makers. We've got Grand Digirite. We've got loose stones, a calibrated cut, and also we've got that amazing strand. And oh, then great. you've got your gorgeous masterclass as Which well. I've not shown you any of the pieces no. yet, so I'm going to go and get those ready in the break. I did notice that on <laughs> social media. It's very yeah. unusual. Yes, yes. So this kept you all waiting. Looking forward to that. So don't go anywhere, lovely jewelry makers. We'll return after this. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Hi uh, guys, so you, you know now, you guys, a lot of you are more educated than I am, but jadeite forms in boulders. Okay, and it's only the skin of that boulder that can, if you're extremely fortunate, contain those ultra rare colors. You know, the lavenders, the, 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 the mottled colors, sometimes a white skin. And in the rarest cases ever known, a beautiful red skin, which is the red jadeite. Now this seldom makes its way to market because it is so thin comparatively to the boulder that it's almost impossible to carve an entire piece out of a solid red color. Well, if you join me for this incredible showcase, you're gonna get the opportunity not just to see it, but to own it and at the most incredible deals. Type A, 100% natural, Myanmar or Burmese red jadeite. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three, or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay.
Ah, again, um, I don't say, I, I hope Jewelry Maker never, never, never changes because I do not know another channel where you'll have two people sat on it <laughs> looking like this, talking about one of the world's rarest gemstones. Yeah. But our viewers wouldn't expect it any other way. No, so I know. And I think that's why you embrace us with open good. arms. Yes, yeah. Um, yeah, just casually <laughs> earlier on. I mean, not just that when we did the Carly and Jason show. Well, everyone knows what we're talking about. Yeah, it's totally, it's, it's totally. Brilliant. It's a very unique bubble that we live in, no, isn't sense. it? There's not another channel like No, it, there's it? not. And we're very proud to be part of it. Absolutely, and, uh, absolutely. Yeah. And I think regular viewers, or if you're watching right now and you're new thinking, what is this madness? I might look, you know, if you like, just, just turn away from the TV screens and maybe just listen to what we're saying. But we are about to discuss one of the world's most valuable gemstones, and it always has been but now more so than ever. What is Grand Digerite? Let's talk about the gemstone itself because there will be, there'll be many people who maybe uh, um, will be learning about this gemstone for the very first time. Regular viewers, yeah, I know some of you already know it, but some have never heard of it before. My own father, who, who, I, who was best friends with a jeweler, actually, mm -hmm. ironically, and mm -hmm. I thought was actually really educated on your gemstones, no disrespect, Dad. Um, he actually said to me the once, and it was a conversation, I had, I don't know, a couple, a few years before he passed away, and he actually said, I was talking about Paraiba, which is remarkably similar to Grand Digerite in its appearance. And he went, yeah, but it's not as, it's not as rare and it's not, it's not as valuable as, as the big five. And I was like, no, the opposite way around. The big five is the big five because of marketing and Absolutely. because they are available. Yeah. Yes, that's right. Yeah. The gemstones that you haven't heard of are considerably rarer. Mm. And they're not well known, known because they haven't got the millions of pounds of marketing that De Beers threw behind diamonds, that Tanzanite One did with, with Tanzanite. Because frankly, it would be a pointless exercise. Grand Digirite mm. is, is not coming from the ground. Full stop. What is this gemstone? Well, it's not only a gemstone, it's also the rarest mineral on earth. The uh, one of, sorry. The original discovery of Grand Digerite stones happened in a small pegmatite outcrop in the cliffs of, uh, excuse my pronunciation, Andrahomana, Madagascar. However, since its initial discovery, it's also been found in small batches in various parts of the world throughout different continents. That paragraph makes it sound like it's relatively accessible, doesn't it? Mm. It's not. Moving on. Grand Digi... Uh, I should have cropped that. Um, the more iron these stones contain, the bluer they appear. They are also known for displaying strong trichloic pleochroism. This means that they have the ability to reflect three colors, depending on the angle that they're viewed, from dark green, dark blue green, and very blue. So this is a gemstone which has, yes, it's blue, but it has the ability to bring you different colors, much like tanzanite. What is Grand Digerite made of? Well, in terms of gemology, Grand Digerite comprises of a compound of magnesium, aluminium, uh, borosilicate, which makes its hardness comparable to that of a garnet. It's thought that Grand Digerite gemstones are formed and found in pegmatite rocks. These rocks are formed by molten rot or, uh, or magma bubbling up from below the Earth's crust to the surface. Gemologically, not only the minerals that are present, the chemicals that are present within this gemstone, but also, gemologically, the actual occurrence is incredibly, incredibly rare. That's why you only find it in very, very small pockets. We'll read on. While southern Madagascar is the main source of Grand Digerite, it's proven to, all, to be almost impossible to find the stone in other areas of the world. Madagascar remains the only location that has produced Grand Digerite of gemstone quality. However, in recent years, and this will, tell, this will highlight that it's an old article, in recent years, samples of Grand Digerite were found in varied locations throughout the world. These locations include Namibia, Malawi, Sri Lanka, 
The scarcity of the stone is what makes it so prized amongst the, uh, among gemologists. But Namibia, deplete. Malawi, oh, no. deplete. Sri Lanka, deplete. Madagascar, deplete. There is no known source unearthing Grand Digerite as we speak. That's amazing, isn't it? Because of this gemstone's price, uh, because of this, the gemstone's price can be quite high. Mm. I love how <laughs> qu quite, uh, just a cool $20,000 per carat. As with every jewel, the overall price is depending on the number of factors, including color uh, cut and clarity. In general, Grand Digerite is cut into cabochons ranging in size anywhere from one carat to 10 and can demand significant prices. As I said, this is a gemstone that, even when that article was written, quite expensive, $20,000 per carat was the price that was casually thrown around when it comes to this gemstone. But even if we were to look at different, lesser grades, lesser grades, so I scoured the internet and I found a few different pieces. This is on eBay. Yeah, natural grand digerite in sterling silver, lesser quality. It's nice, don't get me wrong, $1,649 in silver. That seems a strange thing to have on eBay, isn't it? Ah, oh, do you know, there's, you there's know? jadeite on eBay yeah. for literally tens of thousands really? of pounds. Yeah, I right. find it odd as well, but people yeah. do buy them. Right. Right. Another one on eBay. I'd be mindful, though. Mm. 749 US dollars. I would be very careful and I would definitely want to see the certificate yes, yes. of authenticity. They were pieces, they were necklaces that were literally tens of thousands of pounds. I was trying to bring it to you at the most affordable. But again, you don't have to take my word for it. Forbes themselves documented some times ago. It's just at the top there, Ross. You were on it just a few moments ago. There we go. Um, there we go. Granted, you're right. Number three, that's on the list of most expensive gemstones. $20,000 per carat. There we go. So Back when it was being unearthed. Let me see if I can remember number two and number one. I think taffetite yeah. and red diamond. Yes, natural red diamonds. You taught me that. Natural red diamonds. Yeah. They might be overtaken mm. because Grand Digerite, those might be coming from the ground. Grand Digerite's not coming from no. the ground anywhere. No. Anywhere at all. Look at this necklace. This is also one of mine, Ross. Oh, my word. What is that? That's eBay, by the way. eBay? <coughs> yeah. £380,000. Oh, my word. Look at the price. Just over three carats. No, no, no. 560 carat grand digerite and three carats of diamonds in platinum. Yeah, you could buy a very nice house for that. The way the pound's going, I'll snap it now. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> sorry, definitely. I'm sorry. I really, I take that back. No, definitely. I do. I don't want to get. I don't want to get political. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> gemstones. They're not watching now. Gemstones. That's the way forward. I'm going to say. Yeah. Right be. then. How about anything over a carat? Incredibly, incredibly rare. You saw the prices. I'm about to show you a faceted Grand Digerite, which is almost unheard of. 2.4 carats, beautiful quality of colour. The more Paraba-esque your Grand Digerite, the more valuable your Grand Look Digerite. So, for example, um, if you, uh, you, you know the one I said earlier on that was quite dark, very, very dark. We can show that one. Show this, show that, that one, yeah. Here we go. Look at that one. It's, it's not bad. 250 pounds. It's very dark. The more parabolic the blue, the more, generally speaking, the more desirable. It's 2.4 carats in a round, brilliant cut. That's gorgeous. Natural. That's what the N stands for. Grand Digerite. We're at a double figure price tag. That's incredible. That's a whopper. That's not the price. <laughs> No, nowhere near, actually. Oh. 
It goes back to the conversation that we had a few moments ago. What? It's giving you access to the world's rarest gemstones. That's mad. Please forget that price point. Please nef never utter that price point again. This is what I don't understand. And a lot of the viewers may say this as well. They've said, well, Elle's just said that it's unavailable, it's not being mined, it's, it's deplete. And mm -hmm. then we bring it in at 40 quid. Yeah. We should have it on the channel for 400 pounds. Yes. You and know? then some. Yeah. I, I know. I know. We make it. We make our own job difficult we for do, ourselves. We do, That's we the do, reality. Yeah. Yeah. If we were a high street, or if we were somebody that maybe listens to what 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 happens within the market, you know, like people that, um, you know, the price of gold fluctuates, doesn't it? Up and down, up and down, up and down. Gemstones do exactly that as well. Um, look at the quote at the bottom of this slide. Here we go. It is very resistant to scratching, hence ideal for jewelry use. Due to its scarcity, faceted stones are very rare. Well, I'm, I'm bringing you a nine millimetre that's faceted massive. round that's and a gemstone that's seen. not coming from the ground. Yeah, me too, yeah. Mark. Yeah. 39.99 or 19.99 on split pay. <laughs> In fine jewellery, that is a big solitaire. Massive, yeah. Well done, well done, well done. I might have to get one of those. In fact, I might get two for the girls. Should we get a pair of pairs? So let's go for a pair of pairs. I remember Steve Bennett once told me that, because um, we, were, we were talking about Zircon, and he said if De Beers had got behind Zircon, there would be no left, none left on the planet. No, it would have been sold out, yeah, sold out yeah, within yeah. a year. Yeah. Because oh. they know that diamonds are readily available. Yeah. yeah. That's Strange, why they went behind that. Sometimes I'm out in the garden digging and I pick out a piece of flint and I look at it and I think, why is a diamond more valuable than this piece of flint? Do you know what I mean? It's probably the same years of age, mm -hmm. you know, obviously different content, but you just think, what makes some one stone more valuable? It's in the eye of the beholder, I suppose, isn't it? But yeah. you just think... And marketing. Yeah, you're marketing, yeah. <coughs> That's true. <laughs> Look, a look pair. Oh, look at those. Beautiful. Again, Grand Digirite, generally speaking, the more tropical the, the, the mm. blue, the more parabres the blue. Generally speaking, the more desirable. You're getting two beautiful stones. You've got just over at half a carat in each, uh, in each um, brilliant pair. Uh, 39 pounds and 99 pence. We're not stopping there. Look at the location, Madagascar. That mine is gone, it's closed. So you know when you keep seeing the threes and the fours against Grand Digi, right? That's basically referencing the rarity of the gemstone. There are over 4,000 different minerals on this planet. 4,000 different minerals. Imagine being number four or yeah. number three. 4,000 different minerals on the planet. Oh, what, where are you in that list? Oh, I'm number three. That's what <laughs> Grand Digerite basically is. Yeah. And that may well even go upwards because it's not coming from the, my, uh, from the ground anywhere. Twen and here we go, here we go again, Mark. 29 pounds and 99 pence. I know it for is madness stones. for two stones. For two stones. But fast forward, if I had a crystal ball, you know, if we could look into the future and I don't know, when, I, when I'm long gone and you know, my, my, my girls and hopefully that, you know, their family and everything look back on the sort of the, the stash and the collection of gemstones that I've accumulated over the years, and they'll go, why is mum dressed up as some kind of weird <laughs> raver? Anyway, yeah. but you know, when they look back on the stash that we've collected and mm. whatnot, um, and, and you go, oh, that's grand, did you right? Hang on, if they only paid 20, 29.99. No, they don't see that because that's not written on there and it bears no relevance to the auction. They just see the rarity mm. of the gem. Amazing. They're amazing. They'll they'll call mm. it they'll call it well Willow does, she calls it mm. treasure. Oh. <coughs> that's the reality. Should we do something ludicrous? This is the kind of stone, <coughs> excuse me, that I should have white gloves. Look at that. Look how it's pooling the light in the, in the coulee of the stone. Oh, yes, yes. Totally natural. Look how perfectly faceted it is. Remember, Grand Digirite. 
because the value of the stone is really ever faceted. Look at the clarity, goodness me. Yes, there are inclusions. Grand Digerite, if you looked at, if you paid attention to the one that, uh, that's photographed on Forbes, it's opaque. Oh my word. It's completely opaque. Make a comparison between those two colors. Make a, com a comparison. Ours is much more eye clean. This is brand new. Over half a carat in a six mil round. Imagine it in finished jewellery. Oh, look. That's beautiful. Isn't it? What did you say you're going to do, Russ? <laughs> They're eating cake in the gallery. Is it nice? Yeah, good. Who's cake? The whole lady Oh, okay. Shall we say something mad? And and, and uh, can you make a promise though, if you if you if you're lucky enough to get hold of this? Forget the price that you pay. Once you've met, you've guaranteed your success, forget the price. Because it bears no relevance to the true value. If ever you get this valued, never mention the price. Because you know, did you know this? That they're legally obligated to value it at the price that you say. Legally obligated. Make them earn the money that they are charging you. Do not tell them the price that you pay for your stones, particularly when it comes for Grand Digerite. In 60 seconds, we're going to do this in one massive, massive price crash. Are we all in agreement? that once you've secured yours, it's a premiere, it's never been on your screens previously before, beautiful, beautiful six mil round, which is round about the size of a one carat diamond, by the way. We've got a hundred of these, it's a premiere opportunity. The only reason we're bringing it to you at a closeout deal, manager special, which is just again, we can sugarcoat this as much as we want, Ross. It's never, it's never, ever, ever gonna be justifiable at the price that you're taking it to. Only a hundred people, or maybe less if you multi-buy, yeah, out of a country that. which, how many? 70 million. Mm. That's true, we are global. They, they, yeah, we are, we are glo uh, global. Well, our Facebook alone has got, what, 70,000? 100 doesn't go very far, does it? All of which know the value of Grand Digerite. <laughs> it's just madness. It is madness. Do you remember when we launched Grand Digerite? I do, yes. It was about £500, wasn't it? And that's a yeah. great price. Yeah. It's a great price. I don't know how Wayne has worked his magic. I don't know how he's managing to secure six millimetre cut solitaires at under 20 quid, but make the most of it. Don't ask any questions and just... Just get it. It's all certified as well. I should show you that. It comes so with we would, um, of we would have mounts of this size, wouldn't we, yeah. at home in our stash? Yeah. I, I, I'm personally, mm. look at that colour. Mm. Come certified. So you can see there all the information. Notice the only information that it doesn't include is the price. Because like I said, that's no reflection of the true value or worth. You have the gemstone, you've got the cut, you've got the origin there. So that mm. comes from Madagascar, well that mine is now but deplete. Treatment, natural, not enhanced. For just 20 pounds only, Susan, Jenny, Carol, Norfolk, new customer, Maker, Zoe, Elaine, London, a load of multi-buyers, Helen in Hampshire, congratulations to you, make sure you do check out those baskets. Even if you're not a gemstone setter, even if, you, even if you're thinking, yeah, but I don't know what I do with it right now. Do you think we're always going to be able to offer Grand Digirite as a gemstone that is globally deplete at 20 quid? Mad, isn't it? Madness. 20 pounds. I, I popped, I, I popped to, um, um, to our local, local sort of supermarket just to get some essentials the other day. You know, your milks, your breads, mm. your lunchbox food and things like that. I paid double the price tag. Yeah. <laughs> Here's a gemstone that's not even coming from the ground. 
not even coming from the ground. At £20 only, well done, everybody. Congratulations to each and every single one of you there. I, I know that Grand Digirat as a showcase is it, getting more and more and more challenging to actually uh, um, do. We've got one strand of Grand Digirat to actually bring you. Is that right? Oh, oh, oh we've got two. Oh, oh, oh. oh no. <coughs> we have two strands. I think this is the one I've Here got. he is, gorgeous Dan. Just yeah. got his Arctic mon monkey tickets, he's happy. <laughs> Sorted. Have you got this? I've got this. Look at that colour. I know, it's amazing, isn't it? Amazing. Oh my goodness me. Right, I'm going to do a reveal. Are you ready? Because I'm about to blow you away on colour. Naturally coloured. Let's do a reveal, shall we? Because this is possibly. This is so beautiful. Yeah. It's, 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 the, only, it's the only strand I own. Yeah. Look at that colour. Look at that colour. <coughs> and from that same parcel, I do have it in the smooth coming up. I have 10, ten. available. You did well grabbing yours I'd nice have and early then. One if I was at home. Yeah. It's beautiful. So beautiful. Imagine that with pearls. Look at that. There's no other gemstone that has that colour, though, no, is there? No, no, no. That's just... I, I love the ombre nature of it. I just think it's so beautiful. That middle section. Yeah, that beautiful. dark. Dark, yeah, it's incredible. From that depleted mine, immediately down to the final six, the colour is bonkers on this. If you want the smooth, we've got the smooth. Straight away, we're down to the final five. Linda, Susan, Mary and Carol, you're there. Oh, grab them, grab them. <sighs> wow. That's so ridiculous. So what was that necklace? I know it was, it was one big solitaire at some mad... Mm. Was it like £380,000? Yeah. It's funny, that is. They might as well... They could have knocked the, the postage off, couldn't mm. they? Let's be honest. Oh, yeah. <laughs> at the very, oh, yeah. I'll tell you what, I'll knock the £69.99 mm. postage off. That's on the verge of selling out. Well done, everybody. Wow. Congratulations to you all. Unbelievable. Now, this next strand is brand new. 40 carats. Um, we said earlier on that, that Grand Digerite is rarely ever faceted. That's because when you've got something that's as mm. valuable as Grand Digerite, you don't want to cut the carrot no, weight away. Absolutely not. Again, let's do, let's do a reveal on colour because this is amazing. How many do we have, Ross? 100. Ready? Oh, look. Look at the colour. That's dark. It, yes. Isn't it? Yeah, it's that beautiful. So you want to dive in, don't you? Yeah. Oh, look. That's so look beautiful. at the colour. It doesn't matter about internal inclusions, much like your emeralds, that's expected. It's about the rarity of the gemstone, the rarity of that beautiful colour. Think about it, you know, just from a... Um, I don't know, not necessarily from a gemological point of view, from a mm. horticultural mm. point of view, this Absolutely, is a rare yeah, colour yeah. in flowers, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, I don't, there is a colour. Uh, maybe a, a Himalayan poppy is pretty close. Well, that's about it's it, a rare colour yeah. in animals yeah. and certainly birds. Maybe the kingfisher, I suppose. You've got one of the rarest, rarest colours that exists on Mother Nature sourcing. Um, um, being brought to us all in one of the world's rarest gemstones. Now, this is a premier opportunity. I love smooth rondelles. In all gemstones, I think mm. I prefer a smooth. My favourite smooth rondelle is a Townsend, <coughs> I think. Yeah. In a smooth, but uh, this is, this is, it's the colour, it's the richness of the colour for this strand for yeah. me. That's amazing. Look at this, look at this specimen. Now, this is showing the, oh, look at that. how it forms, how Grand Digerite forms, and that probably would have been one discovery, by the way. You know, you don't get a huge amount of this from any one discovery. But so look, you think that's a couple of inches tall? <coughs> uh, probably. That, I, think, yeah. I don't think it would be, it'd be massive. No. Gorgeous. It's the colour. It's the colour. From end to end, 15 centimetres, 40 carats, a beautiful, natural, genuine grand digerite, certified, premiering today. 
And I'm just trying to rem What are we taking this to? Twenty-five carrots, we took it under one hundred. This is forty carrots with the same quality of colour from that same location of source. We're already in a double figure price tag. Even though there's fifteen carrots more. You touched on so, you touched on it earlier, the fact when we launched it this <coughs> is that we were. Five hundred pounds, yeah. and that was a great deal. Look here. Look at that. You can see the thread running through. That's the eye clean clarity. I'm also drawn wow. to, to these two. There's a perfect pair. That one straight away, wow. I think, would justify the price that's on your screens right now. Well done to those of you that have already that's made those good. confirmations. We have just... <laughs> Cut that price in half, but if you want us to go as low as what I'm hearing in my ear, Ross, I think we need to do a 60 seconds, uh, a 60 seconds, get people on the phone lines. If you want Grand right? if you're sourcing this gemstone, not just for our own stashes, stash is entirely the wrong word to use when it comes to Grand right? I can almost feel collectors, connoisseurs literally cringing at the word stash. It's like I object to the word strand when you've got Indeed, rarity yes. like this. Yep. I don't like the word strand, even though we use that word with jadeite. When it comes to grand digerite, this is a parcel. This is a parcel of rarity. We're already too low. The clock is ticking away on your screens. That's your call to action. If you want us to take this beyond low, it already is, quite, quite honestly. This is where you play your part. Wait, wait, that's just over a pound per carat. Honestly. <coughs> If there's enough people, should we take it to a pound a carrot? For Grand you right. <laughs> Has anyone got... Uh, um, you've got Google in front of you, haven't you? Ross, can you Google what are the top ten rarest gemstones right now? Right now. Because it changes on a daily basis. Not daily, but regular basis. Number one, I'm going to say, is going to be red diamonds, as you said, natural red diamonds. Will we ever have those on the show? We've had red diamonds. We've had them on the show, mm. haven't we? But they were, they were very terracotta in their colour. Oh, yeah. I yeah. Mean, yeah, but still we've really had Really nice, yeah. yeah. Really lovely. £39.99 pence only for a gemstone that is deplete, gone. Not just the Madagascan source, global source of this gemstone. I'm not saying that hopefully we will find it moving forward. You never, well, you never know. But the rarest gemstone, okay, hang on. Oh, here we Last go. year, so that's the most up to date. The top 10 rarest gemstones in the world. For over 40 years, we've been so, oh, oh, oh. Hang on. Oh, there it is. Look at Grand Dude Right. Oh, it's jumped up then. Thought so. It's number, oh, two. number two. I thought it would have jumped up the list yes. yeah, because yeah. Madagascan sauce is gone. We're going again. Let's do it. I know, I know. Let's pay completely no attention. Me get my cobwebs all caught up. No attention whatsoever to the graph that we've just shown. That's a, that's a website. What's it wow. saying? RareGemCollection.com. There we go. Updated world's 10 rarest gemstones. Grand Digirite, number two. Oh, look, interestingly, Pareba Tourmaline's in there. That's interesting. That, change, that, that, that list has changed. That's amazing. The clock is ticking. Clock is ticking. Top 10 world's rarest gemstones in the world. This, in accordance to that website, Number two. They do vary in different places, don't they?
Um, we don't know how up to date some of them actually are. This mine is now closed from Madagascar. Ready? In 11 seconds, it's going even lower. Even if you just say it's one of the world's Absolutely, rarest yeah. gemstones, and it's always in the top 10, isn't it? <coughs> Tanzanite, 1,000 times rarer than diamonds. I, I couldn't even put a number on this. I couldn't even put a number on it. We've crashed the system. There's that many of you there on the phone lines. Goodness me. Oh, it, yeah, it is a, a, a first come, first serve. Grand Digerite comes from Madagascar and was first discovered in 1902. What's that? What am I reading? Just underneath top 10 rarest gemstones you've never heard of before. One of the 10 rarest gemstones uh, ever. What am I reading? What does it say underneath? Uh, from Madagascar, Grand Digerite is considered one of the top 10 rarest. There we go, over and over and over again, different websites. Collectors getting involved. Listen, I know that there's no graphics on your screens right now. The system's crashed. We will go again. Lower than 29.99, brand new premiere. I tell you what, whilst we sort out our graphics, you've got 60 seconds. Oh, yeah. Crap. Do you know, when, when our grand, grand did you write, actually, you know, when it's gone, and Wayne has already said he hasn't got any on order, he hasn't got any more on order because he, it's, we're, we're priced out, his words. Never too, we're never too proud to say that, we're priced out. Grand did you write, it's too expensive. We won't buy it at the moment. Too expensive. Um, when our when our deposit actually sells out, uh, sells out, you know we could literally buy. We can't buy it at the price that's on your screens right now. But if we're priced out, mm, that's true. Customers are as well. We don't yeah. buy at a higher prices because that price is well me out for starters. A lot of customers. We just simply won't buy it at all. When this sells out, though, do you think your price, your grand digerite value, will stay at thirty nine ninety nine? Do you think that is the price value of your uh, of your? Oh, it's the price. But do you think it's the value of the strand that you're looking at right now? No. Well done, each and every single one of you. It is brand new, a premiere opportunity. If you got that pearl closeout deal this morning, yeah, yeah amazing. That would yeah. be so beautiful, wouldn't yeah. it? Just alternate maybe for that pop wow. of beautiful tropical blue. Um, keep on dialing through. Coming up after the break, your masterclass. We're going back to your lovely at Hawaiian. Um, uh, Hawaiian, I keep saying Hawaiian. Halloween, Halloween inspiration, <laughs> very different, very, very different. Can you imagine the Grand Digerite alongside your natural type A jadeite? Two of the rarest gemstones right there, top 10, coming up immediately after the break with your sterling silver. Mark's amazing masterclass as well. We've got lots of different carvings coming up in the next hour. So um, are we going to put, put all the kits on pre-order so you can actually shop ahead? Wow. We've got lovely little cat uh, carvings also. Join Mark and I after this. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. 
Uh, guys, so you, you know now, you guys, a lot of you are more educated than I am, but jadeite forms in boulders. Okay, and it's only the skin of that boulder that can, if you're extremely fortunate, contain those ultra rare colors. You know, the lavenders, the, 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 the mottled colors, sometimes a white skin. And in the rarest cases ever known, a beautiful red skin, which is the red jadeite. Now this seldom makes its way to market because it is so thin comparatively to the boulder that it's almost impossible to carve an entire piece out of a solid red color. Well, if you join me for this incredible showcase, you're gonna get the opportunity not just to see it, but to own it and at the most incredible deals. Taipei, 100% natural, Myanmar or Burmese red jadeite. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. Now we've got a lot of kits to bring you with different carvings, but we're going to start with something that is on a whole other level of luxury. And if you wouldn't mind, Mark, I'm just going to quickly skim through just because it's so important that people realize what they're buying here. Our prices don't indicate the rarity of the gemstone that we're actually getting, especially red jadeite. You didn't realise what it was. No, I feel quite guilty. I, I would have treated it with a lot more respect. I really would. Well, have you done. have. Yeah. Well, I thought. You I thought. It, I thought it was one of the best quality carnelians I've ever worked with, because the colour is so vibrant and, and that, dark. And that's and probably yes. because Mark, you've got goldstone. Yes. In other kits. In other kits. And mukite. Mukite, yes, which are right. beautiful but more affordable yes. at a whole other different price point. They're incredible. Now, what we're looking at right now is natural red jadeite. And Roland Schluso, uh, uh, again, he's very much a pillar. Um, Christie's Prize for Gemology, co-winner to Tahitian Pill uh, Trophy in 2001. Uh, gemologist, of course. 35 experience within, uh, within the actual trade itself. And there's a photograph of him, and he was actually at Tucson at the beginning of the uh, at the beginning of this year. It's 
he really does specialise in jadeite. And if I can skip forward, um, his words, Pillar and Stone is his company, him and his wife. He actually said the price of type A jadeite is right now at an all time high, over 700% increase. Oh my word. Yeah, year over year. Particularly difficult for us is sourcing the skin. This is the fancy color of jade, lavender and red. These prized colors are so rare because this is the skin of the boulder as it oxidizes. This is why you never get a solid red color, sculptures or jewelry. The skin is so thin comparative, uh, sorry, comparatively, and the boulders aren't coming out in the current market. So oh. there's, a, there's a diagram, basic as it is, that shows you, and we've shown it before, it's, it should be quite a familiar one to you. Can we put that on screen? I'll show this and I'll come back to that next paragraph. So really simple. Oh. The reason why that boulder has turned that sort of fancy colour is the oxidisation. Right. Oh, I didn't know all this. So now when you consider each and every single one of your carved pumpkins... Oh, yeah. Well, now when you, um, you put it that way. Yeah. Yes, yes. These yeah. colours... Uh, I'm just being told, this parcel of Red Jade, when we launched them, on their own, they sold at £99, which is unbelievable. Six pieces, they're nine mil each. Natural, natural, not bleached and not dyed. That's £100 when we launched it uh, a few months ago. I'm just going to read something else. So these colours have turned the industry on its head. The demand and supply is a real issue. And as such, we are seeing some of the highest prices for this material. And still, dealers are reluctant to sell because it's simply irreplaceable. We are finding it easier to provide imperial green to our clients at a more affordable price for the first time ever. Did we hear that correctly? Imperial green is more affordable than red jadeite. Gosh. Mark, these are beautiful. The boulder has completely disappeared from the market as, it is, uh, as it's the only material that's never been stockpiled. This has resulted in the most drastic price jump that the jade market has ever seen. We strongly feel that it won't be long before the auction record is held by a purple or red jade, which changes everything we have ever understood about jade. Wow. Take a little look at Mark's amazing pieces for his masterclass. The beautiful earrings, this gorgeous bracelet. You get, yes, you get silver, Yes, you get the pair of... That's amazing! Yes, you get the pair of amazing 925 sterling silver petals, but it is all about the six natural certified type A jadeites, pure red jadeites that you're getting within this kit that we launched 20 carats. Can I just quickly... Can I just quickly show you a few... I'm sorry, I just had a mouthful of cobwebs all of a sudden then. Can I just show you a couple of auction pieces? So look at these. Look at that. A rare and finely carved red jadeite bottle. Remember, think back to what Roland Schlusser was saying. The it only forms, it turns red because of the oxidisation process. That's why you rarely see a solid red. Look at the price. Look at the price. Wow. 18,800 US dollars. Look at the next. They're gorgeous. A red jadeite bracelet. I mean, that's, uh, I mean, amazing. We've not bought red to wear here, have we? Not bangles. Not bangles, no. And not like, I mean, wait until you see tomorrow. Okay. We've had one strand. I said to Ollie earlier on that red, red jadeite can be a bit terracotta. Would we agree? Ours isn't. <laughs> yeah, ours isn't, that bangle wow. is. It's lovely, don't get me wrong. It's incredibly rare to get red jadeite at that, uh, that size. 375,000 Hong Kong dollars. 
a little snuff bottle. That is so cute. It's beautiful, isn't it? With an imperial jade at the top. 32,000 US dollars. We launched this parcel at 99. Oh, really? Yes. Without the silver. Uh -huh. Shall we match it for the whole kit? Look at this VT. <coughs> the only reason, the only way that box that we sold to them 30 to 40 years ago uh, and they're like, can you do something? Yeah, we're always like, yeah, of course, we'll buy it from you for the value of today. And how much has the value changed for that material? Uh, if I had a guess, 5,000 back in the day, now it's like 50 to $70,000. Um, literally, the only reason these pieces are available to the market right now is, and, and he says it at the beginning of the, clip, uh, the, the actual clip, um, a family member would have passed away and they've been sold back into the oh, market. Right. Gosh. We're starting, we're at 99.99, you get all the sterling silver, we've matched our launch price. It is certified natural. Pumpkins as well are very symbolic in Chinese culture. They are uh, um, a symbol of good luck, I believe. A uh, symbol of good luck. I think uh, pumpkins have lots of meanings across lots of different civilizations also. It's on split pay. We only have 70. Should we do something extra special, Mark? <laughs> because it's your masterclass. What? For one day only. Oh my word. Shall we, ha I'm, I'm buying this, this is ridiculous. <coughs> you can buy the Jedi on their own for 99.99. Or you can get involved with Mark's kit, Masterclass, which includes the sterling silver and the little leaves for half that price today. <laughs> I'm, buy I'm not just buying the one in actual fact, I'll probably get a couple of these. On the high street, you know, just for the silver alone, that's amazing. But for one of the world's rarest of gemstones. Look at these, look, look a red jade diamond pendant suite. Granted, this one's got amazing, amazing translucency, but look at the price. Look at the price. 75,000 Hong Kong dollars. It doesn't say natural on there, does it? Ours is certified natural, I would guess it is. Nobody is paying $99.99 for one day only. You can buy the pumpkins on their own for this price tag that's on your screens right now. Or if you're getting involved with Mark's amazing masterclass, you can get the whole kit for half that price. And it's on split pay. <laughs> is this your first time working with Red Jade? Yes. I've never seen it in real life. This is it's the first amazing, time I've isn't seen it? it. And um, I, as I said, I wish I'd known because I would have treated it with the more utmost. I don't know, Mark. Respect. I think what you've done is perfect because it's all about the jadeite. All about the jadeite. I think they're, they're beautiful. I wonder what I, wonder what I would have. Oh. <coughs> I wonder happened. what if I would have made if I'd have known. And so it's quite nice actually that I just went for it and did what I felt. Yeah. The gemstone needed. Here's so. a gemstone yeah. that's representative of yeah. uh, of moral integrity and that's humble. Um, humble beginnings. I like the fact. In fact, some of the Gemporia pieces look very similar to that necklace. Right, right. So I love what you've done. You can get the entire, you can buy the pumpkins on their own as a bundle. We launched them <laughs> a few months ago. I'll tell you when it was. Oh. 8th of May. Ah. Oh. 8th of May, so part of our birthday. Wait, that was part of our birthday. It was, it was, yeah. Birthday. 8th of May. And we launched them at 99.99. You can get the whole bundle for 99.99, or you can get that bundle as part of this kit for half the price for today and today only. But we only have we only have 77 opportunities. Elaine, Susan, Georgina, Helen, Irene, Michael, and Miranda, London, Janice, Anita, Kim, Sonia, Angela, Carol, Margaret, Cumbria. Hello to you, new customer, Francis. Uh, Rupal, Linda, Tracy, Paula, June, Pat. We've got people on the phone lines. Do stay where you are. It's that colour. Mm. Look how beautiful that, that intensity of colour actually is. It's so warm. It's not russet-like. It's got this... It's not terracotta. It's carnelian red. Yes. 
Yes, absolutely. Yeah. Oh, blood yeah. orange is a great orange. description. Yeah. Great description. So symbol, uh, pumpkin symbolized prosperity oh. um, and star in many Chinese New Year dishes. Heavily rooted in folklore, uh, gourds are also gifted as fertility icons oh. um, in case you're on the hunt uh, for an awkward present. <laughs> love it. Absolutely love it. Um, so lots of meaning. Now, we only had 77. Down to 29. Oh, no. mm. oh, well, that's because our, our lovely viewers are savvy shoppers, aren't they, yeah, at the end of amazing. the day? Well, it's good to see. I mean, we've got threes and twos being purchased for the, for the jade. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah, no brainer, because you know you're going to use your sterling silver chains, aren't you? Yeah. So 99 for the beads. <coughs> or for six. six beads. Yeah. Or the kit for forty nine ninety nine with the six beads. So you're getting the beads half price and some silver thrown in. Mm. That's oh, why we always say, Mark, ridiculous. you're better off buying yeah, the kits. Yeah, 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 completely. You know, quite often yes. you're actually better off buying the kits than you actually are. Um, um, you know, it's, because people will say, is that available on its own? Is that available on its own? You get bigger savings. I mean, that necklace... Uh, it's hard to put a price tag on something like this. It's precious mm. metal. Have I have I shown you a single double figure price tag on no. any on, on on that PowerPoint? <laughs> no. They've all been astonishingly expensive. Have I shown you pieces which uh, you know demonstrate a vastly different colour? No. I mean, yes, you've got the history. Look at the age of those. They're what 1790 to 1860. So yes, you've got the history. Mm. Yeah. But in 2002. They were at 18,000 pounds, sorry, dollars, 20 years ago. What do you think the price is now? Mm. Since the situation over in Burma has, has actually arisen. Down to the final 19. That's the thing. Burmese jadeite is not accessible anymore. No. Because there's sanctions in place, no. quite rightfully so. And you, see, you said that the pieces we're looking at here were 1790 to 1860. That one was when the piece were made. The jade that it's made with is the same age as ours. You know, oh, yeah, millions yeah, yeah. of years old. So, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's amazing, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. That's a really good point. Yeah. It's older in terms of the actual carving, but the, the gemstone's exactly yeah. the same age. No, no, no. The quality of the colours is, is, I think, comparable. If, if not, these are more vibrant in actual fact. You can buy the bundle for 99.99, or if you get, uh, get involved during Mark's Amazing Kit, you can get the nine natural certified type A wow. red jadeite pumpkins and the sterling silver for free. That will teach me to look at my kit listings when they get sent to me. No, but again, <laughs> I think you said it perfectly. You know, had you have looked at it, would you have treated it differently? Mm. I don't know. I might not have made a macrame bracelet using. using I love that. Eslon. I have to say that's actually one of my favourite my favourite yeah, pieces. Yeah. And yeah, to be fair, Ollie's loving this one. <laughs> he is loving that. It is really cool. It is so, so cool. But I'm this, actually bored used um, a lot. But it's a particular colour, <coughs> this orange red, that will work with every single colour. Yeah. Whether it, with purple, with a green, with a blue, turquoise is so. It yeah. will work with everything, absolutely everything. Beautiful. Oh, well done, Down to the final 12. What, a, what an amazing, amazing deal. Um, beautiful translucency, amazing uh, carving by hand as well. Mm, yeah, you know, yeah. these aren't sort of, you know, whopped into a machine no. like diamonds are. And the drill hole is one mil. So um, it's a really good drill hole as well. Even your cord will go through You can get really there. good wire. Yeah, because I've, I've used the 0.5 cord mm. and I've used, two, as you can see, through the hole in the centre, through the drill hole, I've used two thicknesses, which is your one mil. So it's a really good drill hole as well. Oh, so yeah. yeah. Maybe even sort of thicker gauges will run yeah. through there. That, that, that's that's point 0.4 wire, so you can see there's still plenty of space. Plenty of room. Yeah. Amazing, amazing. Well done, everybody. Congratulations. I'll leave those final few nice. with you. Um, now, Mark, we're going to sort of dive to the kit that you're demoing with. Please okay. look at the website because we have got so many kits and there's just slight different variations. They're, they're all available on pre-order. Um, which kit are you doing? So the gold stone. So Goldstone. I, I made with the blue. Uh -huh. I'm going to demo with the with the sort of terracotta colour. Yeah. Always popular, isn't it? Gold stone. Yeah, I love it. It's man-made, so it's a beautiful man-made uh, stone, um, and you get these lovely little, sort of gorgeous little suspensions yeah. inside. So instead of just rounds, which is what we're used to, 
They're pumpkins. Pumpkins. They are very cute. Love it. By the way, pumpkins. Oh, I put it back on the wrong board. It's over there. That's it. Comes with a little pumpkin charm too. Yep. There you go. And there's also a kit with just the charm if you wanted to have a little look at that as well, maybe mix them up. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> now, the pumpkin itself is through drilled horizontally. Through the middle, yeah. And I've so, got... Um, I did have a pumpkin. Oh, it's on the necklace here. So this is the piece I made with the blue. So you can see how the pumpkin sits. Ah, oh, perfect. Drill holes through the centre. There you go. So drilled horizontally. Look at that, beautiful starry-like inclusions within. There's it in the blue. We've got this kit as well. So again, speak to our call centre yep. um, or, or check, out, um, uh, uh, check out the website. Available on pre-order. Uh, this is a pumpkin patch. Ah, sweet, that. isn't it? I always think with the gold, other than the blue, you have a, you have a lot more sparkle condensed. It's all condensed, isn't yeah. it? It's a finer sparkle condensed, whereas the blue, the, the little sparkles are more sprayed or oh, more spread out. Yeah, it's more like show. a midnight yeah. sky, isn't yeah. it? I think they work great together. The only way you yeah. can get hold of the actual pumpkin charm, which is 15, uh, um, sorry, sorry, 20 by 18 millimetres, and the strand, because they are carved pumpkins too, is in this kit. And again, you're better off getting it in the kit as well. It includes your findings pack as well and a pack of your head pins. So you've got your essential silver plated uh findings kit and you're getting a pack of 100 so imagine something like a bubble style or rosary linking like mark has done here yep. we're under 20 pounds should we do an extra special halloween deal following those sort of carvings in the strand itself you can You'll see on my demo oh <gasps> Take a little look. Should we get closer to Mark's amazing necklace? The blue will be going really? to exactly the same price as this as well. Oh, yes, oh. Mark. Look at that kit, 15 pounds. Yep. Yep. Beautiful well, gold stone. Well. Just amazing. Always incredibly popular. The blue is going to exactly the same color, uh, same price point as well. So you can uh, shop ahead and pre-order on that one. And we have got other kits. We've got the charm kits as well to bring you as well. So what are you going to demonstrate, Mark? So I'm going to show you how to wire wrap your pumpkins. <coughs> wire wrap your pumpkins? Wire wrap your pumpkins. So I'm using some gold spacer bees that we've got coming up in one of the kits. And I'm going to use the, the gold stone, the sandstone here. So as so. The orange and the blue each have six little, little splits. So you can, if I look, if you can see down, that we've got the six different sections. And they're all a slight <coughs> angle, so you, they're rather swirly. So your attention to detail, again, is just amazing. So you've got six little slots. So for each of my rosary link sections, I'm going to use three. And I'm going to have spacer bees either side just to separate them. So. Because some of my pumpkins I've used two slots and others I've used three. So if you're, if you're using two slots, two slots, i.e. the little, I don't know what you'd call those, are they? I don't know. Slices? Um, yeah, let's go with slices. Sections. Sections, yeah. So if you're, if you're only doing two sections, so side to side, you can use 0 0.6. But I'll show you how to do three and you'll need a piece of 0.4. So I've, I've got a piece of 0.4, which is about 12 inches in length. And we're going to, look at that. Can you see that? That's Gorgeous. just incredible, isn't it? Absolutely amazing. And prosperity. Yep. There we go. Look at that. See what I mean? The, the, the sparkle is more condensed on the yeah. orange. That's, that's amazing. Also look like those little Chinese lanterns yeah. plants that we were talking yeah, about earlier absolutely. on. Absolutely. Yep. So I'm going to take my piece of 0.4 and I'm going to thread that through. And because I'm going to be adding another bead and a rosary link afterwards, you need to leave about three or four inches of wire. And I'm going to take the longer piece of wire and I'm going to go round, if I hold it sideways, so I'm going to go round and I'll feed the wire back down through the pumpkin and I'm going to pull and you're just going to slowly manipulate it so the wire sits on one of the slots and ju just when you go above the slot, I'm just going to pull. Okay, and that'll sit nice and tight. 
If you want it to sit more tight, you can go in and pull with your pliers, but I think that's sat quite nicely yeah. in the little slot. And then we're going to do that another two times. And because there are six slots, I'm going to jump a slot through the next. So again, I'm going to take my wire through, give it a wiggle, pull it through. As you see, the 0.4 is the perfect diameter. And again, I'm just going to pull that through nice and tight. I'm going to turn, jump a slot through the next slot. Just give that a wiggle through. So, so there's, plenty of, there's plenty of room. You might, for the third piece, you might need to use your pliers. So I'm just going to pull, okay, pull it through. I'm just going to go in and just give it a little tweak with my pliers. And then what I'm going to do, so we've, we've got our three sections. Now, if you were doing two sections, you would do the two slots opposite each other. So when we come to do the, I think Elle's just going to bring the blue. Yeah. You can... Um, Details are on screen. Yeah, absolutely. It's here, yeah. You got it there, have you? Yeah. So we're going to separate with a spacer bead. So on my necklace, with a blue necklace, I've used some seed beads and my U keys. Then I'm going to pop on my second pumpkin and then I'm going to pop on my space bead. So the blue, if we can go close up, can you see there's a section of three beads <coughs> on the yes, necklace? Yes, just here. Yep. So I've got an empty bead either side and then I've got the three wraps. Now in between, we've got one pumpkin and I've used the, the, the two slots, okay, using the 0.6. So it's up to you whether you have two, two sides covered or three. Mm. Love that. Yep. That could also be maybe yep. like a, um, a, a like connector a maybe yeah, for, no, for a slider bracelet. Yep. yep. And Ollie was just saying Morse code. That would be fantastic, wouldn't yeah. it? Yeah. So I've got an empty bead on one side. Mm -hmm. Okay, so just pop that and we're going to do a wrap loop. Cut that off. And we'll do the same on the other side. So we'll get down to the other side and then we just separate our pumpkins with a with a spacer bead. And then a second pumpkin. And then the third. Slide that down. And then we do the same. So we do our wrap loop. Simple wrap loop. So as I mentioned, if you're doing three wraps, use your 0.4. If you're using two wraps, you can get away with your 0.6. And there's your little wrap. And what you can also do is before you finish off your wrap is thread on 15-0 seed beads. And then you can have a beaded outer edge as well. And if you use 0.25, you can fill every single slot if you wanted to. Just decorate that. It's beautiful. It looks like a hot air balloon or a beach ball, doesn't it? No, it's, 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 it's really cool. Okay. Amazing. Love That's it. Really quick, quick little, quick make. But beautiful. You can make, yeah. you, you do modules quite a lot, don't oh, yeah. you? Like, yeah, I love just modules. Just make them up and yeah. then no, I love put them, them together modules. as and when. Modules. Yeah. Would you mix the goldstone with, oh, can you pass me that bracelet? This and one here? Bracelet. Yeah. Oh, Mark, that's gorgeous. That's, that's, that's just a simple stretch. Is it? Just a simple stretchy. So what I've done, if I bring... Are we doing the Mookite, are we doing the Mookite now, are we? Yes. So, so what I've done is I've taken all of the mustard tones. Yes, yeah, so I've taken the mustard tones to make the necklace. Yeah. And then I've taken the reds and the purples and the whites to do the bracelet. See, you know, I always, I'll be honest, when you used to say before that you'd, you'd separate the colours, I'd be like, going no! To, I'm, I'm going to, well, that's, that's what my mum, my mum and I used to do because my mum loved the mustards and I like the reds and I think I'm going to continue that tradition. Yeah. So whenever I have a strand of mukai, I will, I will separate. It's gorgeous. That's amazing. Yeah. Plus, you're getting all of those lovely bead caps. Ross said in our ear that I'm going to do something extra special on the moo kite. This is a lovely kit. Oh, it's it a perfect lovely. pumpkin. Yeah. It's this yeah. season, isn't it? Wow. It's a genuine gemstone carved. 75 oh, no. of these available. I'm buying this kit. That's crazy. 
Love it. Have you flattened those bead so caps in next, too? In two weeks' time, I've got to show all about bead caps. So I'm not going to show you the demo on this one because okay. I, want, I want to save it. But yes, yeah, so there's just different things you can do with bead caps. They're great, aren't they? They're lovely. Absolutely They're amazing. Really lovely. Creates a really beautiful this feature. Kit. This is one of my favourite kits. And the Mukai is just beautiful. Well, you would absolutely yeah. pay twelve ninety nine for that strand of Mukai, oh, considering it's one week. location. And you get everything else with it as well. Like just the plane ticket, the fact that oh, this yeah. is all would come literally yes, from the other side of right. the world. Yeah. And all I've done with this is simple <coughs> with, uh, with a black Ato in between, just Love to separate it. the colours. Oh, look at that little yeah. white one there. Yeah. Have you noticed there's pumpkins everywhere in interior design? You know, I said yeah. I dress my window. Oh yes, yes. I've got a little bay window at the front of my house, and I've bought li these literally. They're velvet. They're velvet pumpkins, ah. um, in these different colours, and just put a little gathering of those and some candles oh. and whatnot. And it looks really sweet. The girl. Oh, yeah, if ever we decided to move, um, one of my stipulations is a, is a bay window for the Christmas tree. Oh, nice. Yeah. Is that where going, you put yours? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And it means you don't have to shut the curtains no. ever because nobody can see no, them. That's it. And it looks lovely when you drive up. <laughs> but yeah, these little, these gorgeous little colours. You're seeing all of these gorgeous awesome. colours within. Um, sort of your Halloween design. Oh, you're loving this. It's gorgeous, isn't it? I'm not surprised. I don't think I've ever seen a Mukite kit for £13 before. That's, I don't think I've seen a Mukite strand. No. Especially carved. No. Unreal. And the, the, little, the little cut slots, they seem to enhance all the veining and the colour. It's just beautiful. I just love these colours here. Yeah. Beautiful. Amazing. It's about to sell out. Now, um, we've still got a couple of kits. Again, you can shop ahead on these as well. So I've got red and blue in the, with just the pumpkin charm, if that's what you wanted. Here we go. They're not on their own. There we go, like that, yeah? So 100 of each. Details are on your screens for the red. Let's bring the price tag in as well. So not only you get um, a, a pumpkin charm, which is 20 by 18 millimetres, you're getting your little mini threading uh, thread kit, which includes <gasps> monofilament. <sighs> beading thread and uh, um, elastic and you're also getting then your uh, what size are they the ch the little spaces two mil 40 of your two mil yeah 7.99 7.99 <laughs> yeah they're sterling silver spacer oh. beads yeah. and you got a threading pack I love this little threading pack. I've not seen a threading pack for ages so you get your elastic your monofilament and your your tiger tail Wait, surely. Threading. I know that our old old yeah. school threading packs were that price tag, weren't they? Mm. Yeah. So yeah. they're silver, though. They're gold-plated sterling yeah. silver. You know what to do. Now let's do the, 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 the gold. Let's do, sorry, the blue colour. So you're getting the pumpkin charm. It's going to be on and gone. Gold-plated sterling silver spacer beads in two mil. <coughs> and you're also getting... And you're also getting the thread, uh, um, the threading pack as well. Amazing, amazing, amazing. I'll leave that one with you. Now, let's show you the putty cats. I love it. So Ripley, I loved, I loved that little, his little fangs were so cute. <laughs> so cute. Since oh. we've come back from holiday, they are so clingy. They won't leave us alone for a minute. Missed it's bizarre. You. They've never been like Missed this before. You. He's so cute. Oh, look. He's got a little cheeky face. He looks like, he looks like Dave. Lovely. He looks like our cat. Yeah, they're beautiful. <coughs> Hand carved, genuine tiger's eye. Name famous cats. Simon's cat, Henry's cat, Top Cat, Rhubarb and Custard Cat. I can't remember which one was which. Uh, what, was the, what's the, what was the creepy cat in Alice in Wonderland? Cheshire. Cheshire cat. Yeah. Oh, Lots of famous genuine. cats, aren't they? I love they? these cats. Garfield. Garfield, cat. yeah. yeah. Nine ninety nine, tiger that came for tea. He's mm. cut technically. Mm. Technically, love these designs. So, what's this macrame? This is macrame, but what I've done instead of having the beads on the lazy strand <coughs> going down the centre, yeah. I've put the beads on each of the working strands either side. Oh, that works. So all I've done. So, really? Okay. They've all got different <laughs> expressions, they have. haven't they? They're different all, they're all personalities. Hand yeah, they're all hang. He's cute. He is he cute. He looks quite posh, doesn't he? This one. Yes, he's got his yes, nose in the air, yes, isn't he? Yes, but sweet, don't you think yeah. all cats do that, though? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I always think that they're like, I look at my cats and it's like, oh, you're here. Mm. Our cats, our cats tut. Do they? Yeah. If, they, if we do something they don't like, they look at us and they go, 
<laughs> they do, honestly. They tut and they do this with their head. It's funny. It's funny, yeah. Um, mine are still, they're still babies. They're just really naughty, our cats. We've got two, Pearl They'll and... grow out of it. I hope so. They'll grow out of I it. hope so. Yeah. Pearl and Dave. Dave's just massive, absolutely massive. We've got it in the different colours as well, different gemstones, did you say? Um, have a look on the website. Yeah, I have got two amazing jade carvings. The what? Fish. Oh. Oh, is it coming up? Oh, koi carp. <coughs> oh, we're quickly just uploading. Uh, here we go. So, the tomcat. Yeah, oh, of course, yeah. which is Ripley. Which is Ripley. Is he solid black? No, he's got white bib and white paws. Bless him, bless him. And then you've got the Labradorite Puddy Cat as well. Yeah. These are going to bound to be popular with our lovely jewelry makers because we are a channel of, of cat lovers, aren't yeah. we? Well, animal yeah. lovers, full stop, general, really. Yeah. Yeah. I love it. Um, yeah, Pearl will literally bite me if I stop stroking her. Not hard, granted, but uh, she'll come and she'll come when, when, once Tiggy's asleep. She'll come downstairs, snuggle on me, and if I stop stroking her, she's like, "Oh, I wouldn't have that." Fussed me. Or do I need to be a bit stronger with? You need them, a water you sprayer. Think? You know the little oh, house water okay. sprayer and just. Okay. Just need to do it a couple of times. Yeah, she'll remember. Uh, sorry, what was that then? Because of all the carvings in this hour. It makes sense to bring you the last of uh. stock opportunities that we have coming up. And um, koi carp, massively, massively symbolic again when it comes to Chinese culture. Very much good luck. And they're incredibly valuable as well, the kois. Absolutely. Thousands of pounds. Thousands and yeah. thousands yeah. of pounds. They're yeah. beautiful too. And they get massive, the sizes they can get up to. Um, you've got the duo here. Now, there's literally five of these available. Plus, then you've got that lovely, that lovely flower. The bubbles are, again, very symbolic. You've got um, uh, the bubbles within the water itself. Um, you've got the duo, you've got the duo there, the golden pearl, yes, there's that, um, that meaning behind flowers, symbolic of beauty as well. Can you see the lotus flower? Lots and lots and lots. Research it, because actually, well, to, to just mention it means this and it means that would be inaccurate, because there's, uh, they cross one another as well. Um, the lotus flower, so symbolic of, 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 of birth, um, considered to be the most beautiful, the beautiful flower on earth. It grows through its roots, finds its way through the murkiest of waters, um, and when it does uh, reach the sunlight, it unveils as the most beautiful flower in existence. So yes, very, very, very rare. But it talks about the journey, doesn't it, with the lotus flower? It's the journey. You know, like many, uh, um, you see tattoos, a lot of tattoos. Oh yes. Um, with lotus flowers, yeah, it's yeah. going through that and journey. Koi, that koi carp. Yeah. Yes, yeah. yeah. In fact, my husband's got a koi carp as well. He's. Uh, um, I don't, I don't know if that was intentional. Oh. He's got a lot of the Chinese tattoos. I scared. I'll tell you in a minute about tattoos. Have you got a tattoo? I've got yeah, masses. Have you? Yeah, I've got loads. <laughs> I was, we were sat on the. There's an advert on TV at the moment that features Optimus Prime from Transformers. Yeah. And I said to Andrew that that's going to be my next tattoo. The whole of my back is going to be Optimus Prime. You should have seen his face. It was hilarious. Does he not want you to have that no, done then? He won't let me have any more. Uh, Koi carp, symbol of strength, which you definitely need for that tattoo. <laughs> symbol of love, perseverance, bravery and dedication. There we go. There's five of these available. Last remaining quantity. They are beautifully drilled at the top there at a 45 degree angle, which basically means that um, if you don't want to wear it as a pendant, then you can obviously still oh. um, display it as a work of art. There are only five. Look at the price tag. It is certified natural type A jade. Koi carps mean they literally are worth thousands are. and thousands of pounds, aren't they? Very long lived. They can live to 75, 80 years old That's as mad. well, some of them. Absolutely yeah. mad. Yeah. Do you know, how old do you think a lobster is, by the way? Slightly sidetracking here. A lobster? A lobster? Well, an adult mature lobster. How, how, how old long do you do think lobsters live for? 20 years. 20? Yeah. How old do you think? 40? Really? What about you, Ross? How many years? You'd have said 10. I'd have said about three or four. They can live to 100. Really? Lobsters. Mad. Wow. Mad. Uh, for, um, we're always learning, aren't we? Yes. The, yeah. the final two of these, make sure you do check them out. Susan, Linda, new customer. Um, amazing. Oh, Let's do... I I, I've got this yeah. one. It's beautiful. Yeah. Dan, please, can I borrow your phone? 
But the reason why I absolutely love this one, um, well, you've got the lotus flower again. You've got the, and it's the, it's the direction. So when you have the flower on one side and the birds on the other, apparently this, this is a, de a depiction of love, a couple's love. And oh. yeah, unlimited. And We've got viewers though. who are solely collecting our pendants, yes. our carvings, which is really amazing. Yeah, I mean, what an amazing collection oh, no. it would be. The combination of flowers and birds single figure quantity goodness me you've got the most beautiful black jade in this as well mix of black green and white all certified yeah yeah a cabochon without a single carving these are done by hand they're not machine cut they are done by hand should we get should we, should we dim the lights show you the I translucency love this. i absolutely love this Look at that. Absolutely. Quite haunting, isn't it? Yeah. Just... There are nine of these remaining. Shall we what? take this under 100 pounds? Oh, no. Look from the distance. The glowing green jade. In 60 seconds, let's take it to a, a, a double figure price tag. This is crazy. It's absolutely crazy. You've got your beautiful, beautiful symbolism, the meaning behind it. But every single one of these pieces will, will vary slightly because they are, they are literally handcrafted. The final few, there was nine, did you say, at the beginning of this. Janice, you've got yours well done. London, new customer, new customer. I'm buying jadeite. I, and I have, I'm buying these jadeite master carvings because quite literally, I'd be, I'd be daft not to. They're, they're just works of art, aren't they? Again, I love the, I love the dark sections running. Me too. As well. Again, that, that piece that I was oh. referencing earlier on was two and a half thousand pounds twenty five years ago, and it was nowhere near the quality, nowhere near the quality that we see on our screens on a regular basis. See how it looks like it's melting? That's the quality that you're looking for. It should look wet. Should look right. physically wet, like ice an ice cube melting. I'm still mm. waiting for a Darth Vader, a J-Dite Darth Vader. Oh, did you see the little to uh, Tokyo Bear? Yeah, that's what got me thinking. Oh, he has done it as well. 99.99. Um, oh. If there's any of these left, I'm getting one of these as well. That's I have a J-Dite carving that my mum actually purchased many years, many years ago that's on a it. trip to China, uh, to oh. a trip to China itself. Oh. Yeah, and it's, it's this. It's she probably purchased it unbeknown mm. to the meaning, but. Um, yeah, it's got the, the flowers on one side and the birds on the other. Oh. Just beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Irene, Kim, well done to you, Linda, London, Janice, Susan, you're there as well. It is drilled, so again, if you wanted to use that drill hole um, to wear it as a piece of jewellery, then you absolutely can. Hand carved. Every single type A jadeite will look oh. slightly different because you've got to remember this is a natural commodity. The final two of these that exist, um, Rupal, well done to you, Janet, well done to you. Have you noticed how we don't we don't recommission master carvings oh yes that's right they, they, we haven't repeated master carvings that's because they are literally done by hand and it's very labor intensive as well something like this can probably take i mean who knows hours weeks don't know months maybe not entirely sure double figure price tag that's the lowest ever price on this amazing piece that's well done gorgeous. that's one of my favorites i think me too it's just so beautiful <coughs> uh, there's a few that really stand out. Did you ever see? Did you see the Sahara um, Samsara? Did you see that? No. Ross, you know the Samsara. Do you remember it? Did that sell out? Oh, right, right. It was just beautiful. That's amazing. Like this, just beautiful. Okay. Now we will have last of stock jade on Wednesday morning at eight o'clock as well. So. And um, we're going to do uh, uh, like a, um, a lounge hour. So if there are any samsaras left, at, um, it's like a three-dimensional flower. That's why I, oh, I right. asked you. Right. Um, I th that's why I thought you'd like it. Should we do some hearts? Well, they look like little hearts to me. Definitely hearts. Yes. Type A, natural, Burmese jadeite. How's all your makeup stayed on and mine hasn't? I can feel it melting. <laughs> <laughs> mine slid right down the front of your face. <laughs> Clearly, it's all gone. Natural type A jade in your beautiful hearts. Again, 
uh, the challenge of, of cutting this gemstone, a heart is it always incredibly complex because you have that natural curve there, sort of the cleft at the top. We're under 50 pounds, goodness me. Again, uh, um, we can't get hold of Burmese jadeite. The jadeite that you are sourcing right now, we should point out as well, you, you're buying completely ethically, absolutely. Uh, we absolutely endorse the sanctions that have been implicated um, to all Burmese gemstones, for sure. So anything that was previously mined prior to the sort of current status uh, over in Myanmar, um, that's that's the only only jadeite that we'll ever actually offer you. So that's absolutely fine. At forty nine pounds and ninety nine pence, you've got that beautiful apple blossom green, not na uh, not not dyed, not um, impregnated, totally and utterly natural. A single solitaire, single solitaire, literally like you did with the mm. pumpkins. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Because you could do that, couldn't you? Uh, yeah. Have you got that corded bracelet again? I think you've got them, have you? Oh, no, there yeah. it is. Just hidden behind. $29.99. So imagine doing this with a little heart. Just one heart. Because yeah. you could take the cords up through the centre, couldn't yeah, you? Yeah, easily. Yeah. $29.99. Well done. Oh, my goodness me. Super, super limited opportunity. Um, okay, black opal. This is the entire parcel. Look at it all. A black opal. Well, an opal is a gemstone that doesn't have a crystal structure. Basically, it forms from water that's trapped between cracks and crevices of the host rock. When it has a uh, when it has a, uh, a sort of dark body colour, it, ele it elevates our ability to actually uh, um, witness those beautiful spectrums of colour. Just look at it this way. I say it every single time. If you let a firework off by day. Um, you'll see it, but if you let a firework off by night, um, you'll see it all the more. Um, incredibly sought after. We're going to do a close out deal. There it is, £49.99. You can get hold of it for uh, £25 on your split day today. Uh, split day today? Split pay today. Uh, hand selected. That's the quality of each and every single one of those amazing solitaires. It's been an absolutely Mega, mega, mega show, Mark. Thank you thank so you. much. No, thank you. Thank again, you I'm, also I'm, for... That's all right. Massive thank you again to Dan for putting all this out for us this morning. All the effort, bless Amazing. him. That's so cool. He's a good egg, isn't he? Yeah, thank you for sorting yeah. all this. You're far Pleasure. more organised than I am. <laughs> <laughs> um, like I said, I'm going to go I'm gonna go pick up right. uh, the children now and terrify some kids. Oh, yes. I've got a meeting now. I forgot all about. Oh, yes. <laughs> With our MD. <laughs> I have got some wipes if you want to borrow them. It's quite cool. Like yeah, that. yeah, just go ahead and see what... With the glasses, keep the glasses on as well. Um, I hope you have a wonderful day. Well done to on all of your amazing pieces today. The jadeite's been unbelievable. Your kits have been unbelievable been amazing. as well. You're back tomorrow. I am back yeah, tomorrow, amazing. yes. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the demo for the ring bender, your deal of the day, is on YouTube, Absolutely. so you can check that out as well. I'm back tomorrow. I'm going to be joined by lovely Claire and also Dave for the best red jadeite ever. We'll Ooh. see you then. Have a lovely day.